yo guys i don't know what's going on my internet is working fine uh of course it's messing up today Ooh. why are you doing this youtube Well, it seems to be working on my phone, he says, in 144p. Let's see how this goes for a minute before I turn on the actual sound. Hey, everybody. I'm not getting any lag right now. But we'll see if that actually continues. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Oh, my God. Dropped another 100 frames. Why is it being like this today of all days? Does that 5 to refresh page? Yeah. You can hear me. That's good. And hey, no air conditioner today. The funny thing is I had everything ready a good half an hour early. <laughs> It seems to be working now. I dropped 100 frames at one point. But other than that, it seems... It went red again. <laughs> no! It just dropped another 100 frames. Hmm. Well, we're going to do our best. If it starts to mess up again later, I'm going to have to just essentially turn off my internet and restart it, and hopefully that'll fix it. Worst case scenario, we'll have to continue tomorrow, but... I'm going to start the intro song. Hello, everybody. Um, thank you for being here. Um, 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 ignore me.
Hello, everybody, and welcome to the stream. I am sorry about that. That was rather embarrassing. <laughs> I had everything prepared so early. I was so ready to go. I'm so excited for this game. And then, yeah, I don't know. I pressed let's go live. Everything looked good on my end. <laughs> and then I saw people talking about is the audio glitching? And I watched it from my end, and it was glitchy as F. Um, but yeah, restarting the computer seems to have mostly dealt with it. I'm dropping a couple frames here and there, but from my end, it looked good. I was getting 1080p, 60 FPS. So hopefully we're good to go now. Uh, welcome back, everybody. Sorry about the trouble. Um, I have not touched this game. I'm very excited to see how it goes. I've got all of my amiibos ready for when they unlock. I'm so excited for this story. <laughs> Basically, I'm just ready to dive into this. How about you guys? Hello, Fuchan, don't worry. Thank you. I'm not sure how long we'll play today. We'll see. I mean, we had a bit of a curse start to today, but hopefully everything will go well from here on and we'll have fun. Just if it does start to bug again, let me know in chat because I will want to deal with that as soon as possible. I don't want any of these videos broken. I don't want anything glitched. I want you guys to have the best experience while we go through this. Been waiting for you to play it. Thank you. So excited. 11 hours, let's go. I doubt it. I think more like three to four hours <laughs> if i can beat like the preliminary area i'll be happy also happy birthday to the person who said it's their birthday we'll properly read things at the end of the stream where we always do it's lovely to have you here today on your birthday i'm so excited there let's dive into this yes this is what i mean like i even open up the game to make sure the audio was perfectly balanced i was like let's do this <laughs> Nintendo presents. Oh, I'm so excited. It starts immediately with this deep, dark shit. You know it's good when it starts like that. Ah. Oh. Three to four hour, you sure, Fuchan? I don't know. That's what I'm aiming for. We'll see what happens as we go. <laughs> waku waku, me too. So atmospheric with the heartbeat in the footsteps. Oh, yo! Still got my hair all tied up. I've got the Master Sword. This is New Game Plus, I guess. This strange <laughs> bloom keeps getting thicker. I forgot she sounds like that. It's a really cool accent. Zelda Queen. Yeah, I love the short hair. I kind of expected we would get a scene where she cut her hair in this. We've been descending for a while now. These tunnels are deeper than I thought. What could be down here? Good question. Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. The bob hair, I know. It's, it like goes out so far from her head to the sides too, though. Oh. This isn't just a movie. Oh, I've got like full stamina and full hearts. Sick. Controls. Okay. Beneath Hyrule Castle. I never imagined this was all deep beneath Hyrule Castle. Very interesting insight, Princess. Oh, yeah. That gloom does not look great. It's not too strong, though. So many hearts. I know, right? We never had this much in our last game. People have been falling ill after coming into contact with the gloom drifting through these caverns. Hmm. Well, here it seems almost misty and not concentrated enough to harm us. Well, we gotta go deeper, then. Make it stronger. Keep going. With it coming up from beneath Hyrule Castle. We do not know what waits below, so we need to be ready for anything. But I know I'll be okay with you, Link. She trusts him so Let's much go now. Solve this mystery. That's so cute. She hated him so much in the 100 years ago timeline. And now she finally realizes he's a good boy. He's a good swordsman. A man of few words, but he will protect you. Hero that he is. He's kind of in love with her. For good reason. Oh, he can't use the Sheikah slate anymore. I was going to zoom in on those thighs. Oh, I'm blocking her way. My bad, princess. <laughs> when I was a child, I asked my father if there was anything below the castle. He told me there was, though seeing it for ourselves or even discussing the matter was forbidden. No one in our family knew anything more than that. Okay. So they just basically told you, just don't go there. 
<laughs> Why was King Hyrule like this? King Hyrule was like, hey, Princess Zelda, you're going to have to like unlock your full ridiculous amount of power by yourself. Keep going to the springs. It'll work out sometime. And at this point, he's just like, oh, the castle? Beneath the castle? Oh, it's evil as shit. Just, just don't go there. But don't worry about it. Does he even know what was down there? <laughs> I can recall what my father said even now. No one must ever venture beneath the castle. Not even one of us. Okay, yeah, so he just didn't know either, apparently. He said this warning had been passed down through my family for as long as anyone could remember. Damn. You guys are the... Oh, do I have to talk again? We need to continue to explore this underground area. Forbidden or not. The source of the gloom is down here somewhere. Are you sure you don't have the Triforce of Courage? This is like... Not very wise. <laughs> the one rule was don't go down there. Pass down through legends. And she's like, but what if I did, though? <laughs> I'm determined to discover the connection between this place and the emergence of the gloom. Okay, you want me to go for... What was that? Oh. Huh? Link. Yeah, my sword be glowy. That means calamity is near. It only glue when there were like bad things when I was in Hyrule Castle. It's powered up now. It does 60 damage per strike. The Master Sword. I mean, I already pulled it out, but okay, you can do your little cutscene. We must be sensing something. I knew we had reason for concern. Ever since the end of the Calamity, the castle has fallen into neglect. I never could have imagined anything like these tunnels were hiding here. You must be careful as we move deeper. I love their outfits too. My god, the cloaks look so cool. And the, like that little like leathery bit around her stomach. God damn. Me with the little pieces of leather armor on the shoulder and chest. Not very protective, but damn, I look good. <laughs> Sword glue, he says. I mean, look at it. Fi is not having a good time. Fi is warning us. May maybe don't go down that way. Maybe listen to your daddy and every ancestor you've ever had. Let's keep on going. We're sure to find some clues to all of this ahead. Sure we will. The gloom's getting thicker. Oh. Link, look here. I mean, I tried to. <laughs> you caught me with the cutscene before I could. No protection but hot. I mean, yeah, that's what you want in life. <laughs> These are ruins from an ancient civilization. Wait. Something is written here. Might these ruins be from the Zonai? Also, do let me know if I need to like change volumes for anything. If the game's too quiet or too loud, let me know. Let's keep on going. We're sure to find some clues to all of this ahead. I mean, it's teaching me to swing my sword. But it's not like I can even take out the gloom. What do you think about that one? These carvings. I'm sure they're Zonai in origin. I've seen designs like this in my studies. The Zonai are said to have lived long ago, in the time of the earliest legend. They possessed godlike powers and had a prosperous civilization in the sky. Many history books tell us about the Zonai, but none give us the full picture. Much is still unknown about them. Is that like Skyward Sword time then? The people who got lifted up into the sky by the goddess Hylia? I wonder if that's who the Zonai are going to be. That would be interesting. So many hearts. I know I'm so strong. And yeah, I like that Link is just slightly shorter than Zelda. He, he is a short king. I think he's canonically like five foot three or something. Also, she's got the Seeker, Seeker Slate. That's actually kind of badass. She deserves that. Let's keep on going. We're sure to find some clues to all of this ahead. Ooh, nice statue. Want to share your picture? Is this what the Zonai looked like? They seem so different than us. And such large ears. We had pretty large ears too, man. How did the ruins from a civilization of the sky end up here beneath the castle? It looks like the path ahead goes even deeper. Let's continue, Link. Go deeper, Link. Bird people, huh? I think they would be the Rito. They kind of look like the ones that give Samus her costume in Metroid even. Certainly not the people from Skyward Sword then. Law, that's how. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'm freaking out about the law right now. I love the law of Zelda. Anything else? The ruins we're seeing down here. I'm certain this all must be from the Zonai civilization. Okay, she's finally run out of dialogue. That's a lot of... Oh, I hear bats. 
What up, buddies? Now I, uh, now I need bombs. Zelda, you have the Sheikah Slate. You deal with this for once. Are you Link? Oh, come on. It was bats. I took down Calamity Ganon. <laughs> the way she just doesn't even say anything after that. She's like, damn, no. You're looking pretty Look damn fine. Mirrors. Oh. Well, they're drawn in the same way as the legends in Breath of the Wild, too. That's cool. Is this continuing from Breath of the Wild? Yeah. Of the royal family. This is straight up like right the after stories it. Stories of a great war fought long ago. It was a conflict between allied tribes and someone only ever referred to as the Demon King. Oh, Ganon, let's go. Yeah, those look like moblins. Do these murals depict the same legend? <laughs> and I wonder if those are the tears of the kingdom. With a this zonai. Is similar to the statues we saw earlier. A zonai. And he's These flying. Look like Hylians. Are they making the Hylia a zonai in this? Suggests that the zonai descended from the heavens. Hmm. Ganondorf? Yeah, I can't wait. It's it gonna be fun. My ancestors, the first of Hyrule's royal family were born from a union with gods who had descended from the heavens. Okay, I know born from the union probably means they created the them. The tell a similar story. And if they are accurate, then the gods mentioned were the Zonai. But it kind of sounds they like they smashed. They must have relationship with the Hylians <laughs> of that time, working together to establish the kingdom of Hyrule. Oh, we're going to the creation of Hyrule now. Let's go. This figure... Oh, Ganondorf, so big! Something of incredible power from the young kingdom. And bringing the calamity with him. This all aligns with what I've read during my studies. No, they might have smashed. Shows the demon king. That would mean the Hylians are all part god. And a fierce battle against Or at least the royal family. If the creature depicted here really does represent the demon king, then... Oh. So sexy, even in ancient murals. Yeah, we know those well. Incredible. This mural must be the Great War recorded in the royal histories. The Great War. It looks like a this black sun at the top, the too. War. And the events that led up to it. Link, this is a huge discovery. She's such a law nerd, too. I love it. She's adorable. Aw, oh, and he's so supportive. God, they're oh, so domestic in this already. This invention of Puras. I'm glad I didn't leave it behind. Puras? That was the Sheikahs. You point it and click. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, it looks like the rest of the murals are obscured. Oh. So that... Just what is this place? It's a switch. It does look like a switch. Maybe we'll find more answers further ahead. Literally a camera, yeah. I don't think that's the Sheikah Slate. It does look different. Damn, no wonder she can't use the bombs. We could have seen the rest of the murals, though. Ah, I bet they're going to depict something we need later, then. I wonder if I can throw the Master Sword. Oh! <laughs> okay, just beam attack. At least she didn't mind that too much. <laughs> just give her a little booty smack. Ah, she's fine with it. <laughs> I can't tell you how excited I am. The mural is down here. The images support so much of what historians have written about. Okay. Okay, nerd. We'll find out what's down here. The fun way. <laughs> Damn, the monster sword looks so badass when it's growing. Damn it, food chat. I couldn't help it, man. That was so awesome. Atmosphere is so good as well. Just gonna let her go first. I'm just here as backup. Dude. The music's getting louder and louder, and there's so much more gloom now as well. It's actually kind of terrifying that it doesn't even react to the Master Sword. Like, this is supposed to be the sword that seals evil and shit. 
the gloom just doesn't give a fuck. I find myself wondering, how did this area come to be so forgotten? Why was our history left hidden here? Did the royal family in those ancient times want this place and these murals to remain secret and out of sight? Yeah, they literally... Your royal family literally told you not to come down here, girl. Oh. That don't look good. <laughs> Zelda? I'm gonna need some fire. Maybe some bombs. Yeah, what do you think about this one? green light in the distance i'm having the strangest sensation this is also ominous yeah i love me some horror games did not expect this to be a horror game <laughs> what is this place wait we get a log now oh no we don't let's continue link but we must be extremely careful okay God, they look so cool. What is that? Oh, dehydrated Ganondorf. Oh, that arm. Huh. And one of the tears. Are oh, you gonna want to grab that? So glowy. Uh-oh. We <laughs> just set Ganon free. <laughs> I, I was so distracted by the tear. I was like, wait a minute. That's not good. <laughs> oh, that's so creepy. Hey, buddy. Nice, Link. You... Bastard. No fucking way you just broke the master sword. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. Oh, we're in for a fun time. <laughs> that fragile sword destroyed my arm too and he knows us Roro placed his faith in you and that was all you could do he healed from that shit too no our names the voice yeah oh no Matthew Mercer is giving it his all. He really sounded like a zombie at that point. That was so good. The way they directed that as well, the creepy movements he had were incredible. He said Raul. So this is how the islands rise up. Damn. So he's got the power of gods. And yeah, Rauru was the sage of light in Ocarina of Time. Grab a link. Don't use that arm. You chose the wrong arm. Oh, the music. I think that's the first time I've heard Link so desperate. Oh my god, that's creepy. Another corpse hand. And another lost Zelda. Why couldn't the hand grab Zelda too? I mean, damn it. Grab my strong hand, Zelda. <laughs> but that's so cool. So this is Ganondorf from Ocarina of Time. The original Ganondorf. He remembers everything. He remembers our names. Oh, that's wild, because Rauru was the Sage of Light in Ocarina of Time. And this is set, like, at the end and end and end of timelines. So are they trying to make, like, a separate Calamity Ganon that was, like, Ganon Ganon, the big old pig Ganon, 
and then Ganondorf that's been here this whole time. That's... Mmm. Mmm. I'm so excited. <laughs> Plus freaking Matthew Mercer giving us all on that. And now he's going to be hydrated and sexy. <laughs> Yo, welcome to the club, Link. Every now and then, we gotta switch out hands, switch out arms. This one looks a little bit cursed. But you know what? Body horror is fine with me. Arm club, yeah. <laughs> Been there, done that. Oh, we've got the hair now. Which means I can now. Da -da -da -da. We've unlocked long hair and long ears. Yeah, that'd be a freaky thing to work out, wake up to. The dude who did Ling's voice did a really good job as well. Finally wake. Hello? A nice calming voice. I've heard a great deal about you from Zelda. Ow. <laughs> Wait. No, we already met the king. Your wounds were severe. I am relieved to see you escape death. Thank you. You could have saved my clothes too. Was beyond saving. I had to replace it lest the injury endanger you further. Thank you. It is a cool arm. Introductions would be nice. How do you know Zelda? And what happened to my master sword? He was fully powered up. I did the trials. My baby. Oh God. He really did corrupt it and then snap it in half. He's naked. Yeah, I don't want to know. That That would be my first question. Like, buddy. Decayed Master Sword. The sword that seals the darkness. Its sacred power has been diminished after being ravaged by the gloom beneath Hyrule Castle. Is that what happened to me? Was I ravaged? Is that why I've lost my clothes? It's taking a break. Yeah, it's a bit tired. How do I have that strapped to my bag? Oh, I do still have... Okay. He saved my sword holding belt. Don't put it that way, Fu. That's the way the game put it. The master... Oh, God, they took away... I mean, I guess they had to take away my stamina, too. It was crazy. He just drained away all of Link's hearts. Destroyed the master sword. Reduced him to this. Long, luscious hair, though. I love it. <laughs> And to anyone who wants to check out the artist who made this beautiful asset, um, it's in the description of the video. Back down to three hearts, back down to pretty much no stamina. Yeah. Yeah, we screwed. We're going to have a hard time getting through Hyrule. They kept the important things. Yeah. Ooh, hand symbol. Touch it, Link. He said belt is all you need. Belt was all he left me with. <laughs> At least he kept my underpants. That's something. <laughs> it could have been worse. Blowy blue elevator. I love how Link isn't even asking any questions. He's just like, okay. There's a voice in my head. I've had this before. Last time it was Zelda. It worked out okay chasing after her. Surely it'll be fine following this voice's command. <laughs> When I first heard it, I thought it was Matthew Mercer as well. I was going to be like, wait, is Ganondorf leading me around? That would be so cool. Okay. Ooh. Oh, no, they are the same size. I thought the right hand was longer. Bum, bum, boo. Creepy. I wouldn't want to get ne near these things in real life. You look like they'd grab you. Jump. Ooh. <laughs> Why is there a special button to jump there? I wonder if that's going to be one of the mechanics for like jumping off sky islands and stuff. He's nothing if not consistent. True. He's just like, okay, voice in my head. Let's see what we're up to today. <laughs> Wee. I feel like there's going to be one where there's no water below me. And it's like a test of stupidity. Okay. So far, so good. <laughs> Standing in water, even from a great height, will prevent you from taking full damage. Lovely. 10 out of 10 dive. It looks pretty incredible. Archaic legwear. But no shirt? 
I mean, take it. Oh, hell yeah. Got a little kilt going on. These sandals? Hell yes. Just like Minecraft. Wait, what? <laughs> no. Oh, here we go. Oh, they're going to make me dive off of the edge of the world, aren't they? Sick. We're not getting an FMV for this. I thought there'd be a little movie while I walked to the end of this. Well, I'm all about courage, so... Yeet! Oh. Okay, that's even better. That's so sick. Okay. I doubted you, Nintendo. That's my bad. Didn't need to do it at the edge of the thing. We do it while we're falling. God, you fall for miles. Imagine if there wasn't water down there. <laughs> Just go splat. Is that... There's a dragon flying by too. Oh. This is sick. Let's hope it does not attack me. Accelerate. Oh, hell yeah. The way the music swelled up too. Oh my God. That's such a good intro. Me with my broken master sword. On to the Great Sky Island. Love the music. The music in Zelda games is always good, but yeah, that was particularly impressive. Creepiness at the beginning and now how chill it is. Sky Shroom. Common little mushroom. I should have read that. Probably would have told me. Tree branch. Oh, it begins. It's stronger than the Master Sword. That's... That hurts me. That hurts me. <laughs> nice haircut. Yeah, I like it. Okay, so that's the same as old school Breath of the Wild. More sky storms. Oh, hello, buddy. You want to... Oh. Want to go? Ow. Dick. Come on. Hit me. We can't flurry rush anymore? Hit me. Or am I just doing it wrong? Yeah, you can't flurry rush anymore. Well, that wasn't a backflip. I'll try one more time. Yeah, you can. I was getting my ass beat. God damn. Give me your tree branch. There we go. Soldier construct horn. At least they didn't hit so hard. <laughs> it was a it has a stick. It's doing its best. Zona charge. Damn it, I need to start reading things. I'm just scrolling through them to get to the next birdies. Ooh. A wooden stick, tree branch with added grip, an excellent balance. <gasps> we have a real weapon now. A wooden stick. <laughs> what a sticky situation. How dare. Tasty medleys. Ugh, terrible. 10 out of 10 also. Which way should I go? Giant staircase or little area? Giant staircase. No, little area. Giant staircase is the way they want me to go. Advanced stick? I know, right? <laughs> We went from a tree branch to at least it's an actual stick. Hello? Oh. Pinecone monster. Oh, that's a long neck. Hey, buddy. You friendly or you want to fight too? Because I just killed one of your friends. I wouldn't start. Okay, we're doing this now. <laughs> How do you know my name? Link, I have waited for you. Princess Zelda left something for you in my care. Is that the camera she was using? Yeah, it's not the Sheikah Slate. This is the Pura Pad. I'm told it is an invaluable tool that will provide you with direction. So there are good robots and bad robots. Interesting. Gonna have like my quests on it. I sure hope so. The switch? Hell yeah, let's play some Breath of the Wild. We don't need to save Zelda. 
Princess Zelda's prize device. It has a variety of features that are essential for adventure. Hmm. I received it from Princess Zelda. I have now passed it on to you. My records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting at the location marked on its map. My message has been delivered. How does everyone know? Have I been asleep for a couple hundred years again? I swear to God. Where am I, dude? What's going on? We stand in the Garden of Time. But like, like the Temple of... That's not the Temple of Time. I've been to the Temple of Time in this one. The new Temple of Time. Okay, you know what? Fair enough. The Temple of Time is visible from here. It was used in the distant past. Many rites and ceremonies of the kingdom were held there. But no more. Now it is a lonely place no one visits. I guess old Temple of Time, if this is like the Zonai Temple of Time. The past, past, past Temple of Time. But how do you know Zelda? How long have I been asleep? This is the Garden of Time. Okay, okay. okay. I'll go to the location on the map. Goodbye. Head to the... Head to the location indicated. Take care as you do so. Okay. Um, what do you do? It's tiny whiny. Yeah, I don't know what's up yet. I'm sure we'll find out as we go. There's clearly been a bit of a time skip as well, since they're not using the Sheikah Slate anymore. They're doing other fun things. Bro really said no answers for me. Yeah, what happened to the voice in my head? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I have many questions, and I don't even have a shield. I don't even shield surf. Life is pain. Ooh, apples. A common fruit eaten by people since ancient times. Eat it fresh or cook it to increase its effect. Some things never change. Oh, some things really never change. Oh, sorry, but I didn't know. I'm not trying to hurt you. Although I will take this stick. Hey, bud. Hello. You seem to be new here. Do you intend to use that as a weapon against the soldier constructs? What do you mean, soldier constructs? Soldier constructs are those of us given strict orders to protect this land. The Zona who created us directed them to eliminate trespassers. They will consider you a trespasser. You must treat them as a serious threat. Allow me to offer unsolicited advice. It is crucial to maintain a proper distance and target your opponents. Swinging haphazardly will not yield results. Okay, thank you. I did just get my ass beat by a baby little soldier. Technology has advanced, yeah. That was always funny to me, that they had ancient technology with the Divine Beasts, and we're still in, like, medieval times without electricity properly. They have electricity, but in weird ways. Anyway. You may practice targeting on me if you want. Oh, but please do not actually attack. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's so cute. I feel bad now. I mean, I'm going to continue doing it in the future. I'm going to smash all your shit and take all your apples. Did he stay? No, he woke up. He's fine. See? Don't worry. Ah, I figured I could zoom like that. Oh, God, it's got motion controls on. Nope. Nope. How do I get rid of that? Um... Yeah, no, I don't like that. Oh, so much better. Okay. Foo the bully. He started it. He told me about soldiers and stuff. Oh, it's icy down there. I don't want to go there yet. But this was good. Now we know what soldiers are. I think I've gone... Ooh, stick. Be branch. <gasps> okay, so that's a way to jump. So we can't come back here. Let's go up the stairs. He's like a little hermit crab. Yeah, he gets all defensive. I like the long neck thing. I wonder if you could, like, separate the neck from the body. <laughs> Bye, buddy. I hope you have a good day. <laughs> he gave you advice? Exactly. That was his first mistake. He gave me unsolicited advice. I did not ask for it. That's on him. Sometimes that's considered rudeness. For a weapon. The game's really like, yo, you have too many weapons now. Drop some of those sticks. So don't pull you them. But it's fun. Okay. Up the stairs we go. 
Don't make Link mean. Nah, Link's a good boy. I'm just having some fun with him. Wee. If stamina will runs out, you'll be too tired to do certain actions till it fills up again. Boy, don't I know that pain. He was backseating. Exactly. I know how to fight. Oh, this is where I came from. I'm a freaking idiot. I got another stick, though. It was worth it. <laughs> so there was only one way to go. God. Love your hair. Yeah, this asset's so beautiful. And there'll be more surprises as we go on. But yeah, this is such a nice asset. I'm so happy with it. Tree branch. Oh, more mushrooms. I'm glad I went this way. Oh, God. Let's not just make a jump out of nowhere. <laughs> ready for a stick up? No, 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 no. Wow. I wonder if it would scare him if I get ready to throw it at him. Hey, buddy. <laughs> okay, I can literally hold them at stick up range. That's perfect. <laughs> Down we go. Wait, there's no water. Oh, shit, go right. Oh, there is. <laughs> I thought that was a teaching lesson. I thought I was going to die. <laughs> God damn. Okay. This place is beautiful. Ooh, can I pick up the rock? Now I've got a new weapon. <gasps> Soldier. Come at me, bitch. Yeah, what I thought. Now we're not holding back. I take your stick. Which better have better durability than the tree branches, because they do not do well. Lesson one, look before you leap. Yeah, I should really learn that. But get out of the way. I want the zone I charge. Sky shroom and tree branch. Same two things as always. Ooh. Tree branch. Oh, I'm out of tree branch space. That's okay. <laughs> Fuchan looks pretty. Thank you. I love this hair. The ears are a nice touch too. Sky shroom. Hmm. Giant roll. What are you? Birdie. I'm back. I like ostriches. Where are you going? Come on, become my meat. You're lucky I don't have a bow. Oh, you ran the wrong way. Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. <laughs> meat obtained from animals in plains and forests. You can eat it raw, but cooking it will make it more delicious and nutritious. I, man, I hunt. Oh, no. Herb. I'm back here. Oh my god, he can hit me. He hit me harder than the soldier. Come here, you. Fine, you live. I got enough meat. <laughs> Why is the bird like a sheep? True. Kind of like a confidant. Aggressive and ramming. Oh, here we go. Well, that one didn't work, but this one surely. Yeah! Oh, he lived. Nice try, bitch! That'll do. A spear. A long stick. Oh, here comes another big boy. Perfect. Let me break my stick on you. Oh, he's spinny. Okay. <laughs> You've got more power. I respect that. But I've got a long stick. Big stick, exactly. Wait, how many tree branches do I have? Because I want the wooden sticks. Long, long stick. Did you just hit a confidant, sir? No. It, it was a burb. It just kind of acted like a confidant with its aggression. Confidants be like that. What is this? Oh, that's kind of terrifying. It's kind of like decayed. Like my arm. Ooh, apples. Two? There's normally three. Oh, Temple of Time, right. <laughs> I forgot what my objective was. I've just been running around. Hey, buddy, you gonna fight me or you wanna chat? Which one? Oop. Oh, God. I get that one. 
Big jump. Big jump. There we go. Hey, buddy. We aren't this aggressive. I'm pretty sure you are. I've met you. Um. Hello. Were you lured in by the delicious smell? I assume so. Ingredients are especially fragrant when roasted by a fire. It may also be tastier and more nutritious. I would not know. Then why are you roasting them? Oh, you are unfamiliar to me. My apologies. Among my tasks is to explain anything that first-time visitors might require knowledge of. You may have questions about this place. Please rest assured that a construct can answer them. I recall that your question was about... Roasting food. I roast ingredients by placing them beside the fire. I do not eat, but I am given to understand that it improves the taste. Our creators roasted ingredients in order to enhance the nutritional value. Do you have ingredients? I invite you to use this fire to roast them. Okay. Look at this stupid ass mushroom, you fungi little bitch. God, burnt all over the place. It doesn't even look like you're cooked properly. You're not mixed with anything. Pathetic. I have roasted the toasty sky shroom. I have done what the robot required of me. A simply grilled mushroom. The heat brings out its flavor and increases the amount of health it can restore. Let me roast some meat. Um, there we go. Yeah, give me delicious burnt meat. I have to put it on the fire. Oh, okay. Fine. Normally beside the fire would be okay. Please don't just burn to death. No, it's on fire. That's not how you cook things. This may go terribly wrong. Oh, see it's steak. Okay. Meat cooked over an open flame. Cooking has increased its flavor and the number of hearts it provides. Sure, I'll do the... Oh. I'll do five mushrooms too. And then we'll move on. Bum, bum, bum. Boop. For chance chill? Never. He has double roasting. <laughs> it's well cooked and burnt. Hey man, now I've got so many hearts ready to go. Look at these. Half a heart each. We're golden. In fact, I should eat some. Damn it, now I need to roast more. One, two, three, four, five. Then we'll move on. I want most of them for recipes later. Did one just explode? Come on, do the thing. Yeah! Take dapple. Needed to restore three quarter hearts. It only adds a quarter heart? Damn. Okay, Temple of Time. <laughs> I got a little distracted, but I'm here now. <laughs> no pants, but more man skirt. Hell yeah. Don't even need a shirt. I'm fine with just the pants. Get some Cajun seasoning, if only. You can't combine anything right now, and it's sad. Temple of Time has seen better days. I wonder if there is some timey-wimey BS going on. Because one of these robots knew who I was and knew Zelda. But the rest of them... Oh. Hey, buddy. I got the... Wait, can I use the Master Sword? Oh, you have a shield. You're better than the other guys. You can! And it broke. <laughs> That's okay. It only run out of energy. I'm sure it'll be back. Oh, you can actually swing. Okay. Come on. Wow. I got too close. I chickened out. That's on me. Old wooden shield. An aged, worn out wooden shield. To stand lighter attacks such as arrows. Sweet. Raise your shield. Koemokagari. Rusty broadsword? Yeah, that makes sense. Once fearsome sword has been seen better days. It can do some damage in the right hands, but also breaks quickly. That's a lot of damage, actually. Five? Let's go. Wee. Okay, into the temple, I guess. Did I lose one heart from... Damn, yeah, this sword's way stronger. I'm gonna wreck shit with this. Stick fight mode. Hey, we're just learning. We're, we're baby right now. We'll get there. The shield actually looks pretty damn badass. Huh? What does that mean? I need a red power? The door will open only to those with sufficient power. Are they calling me a little bitch? I'm sorry. I did not intend to startle you. <gasps> it was I that spoke to you earlier. That arm originally belonged to me. Oh, you're a Zonai. You've got beautiful Everyone eyelashes. You're not Rauru. 
source of the right arm. Hey, buddy. So you've got the power of a god. Forgive me for appearing to you in this manner. Unfortunately, I no longer have a physical form. You don't need to be embarrassed about that. You still look kind of fired, I'm not gonna lie. In any case, that arm should allow you to open this door. It seems to have lost the power to hair. do so. His hair is gorgeous. You might be able to restore it, but you would need to enter a place filled with sacred light. Does he have a third eye or is that just like a forehead? Yeah, there's like a bulge there too. Of course. Why not visit the shrines on this island? Oh, we're back to shrines. <laughs> okay. So this is Prologue Island. Would smash 100 out of 10. Eh, eh. The shrines. Yes, I'm sure they are. The I mean, I'm not a furry, but it's the voice for me, man. And he tall. And he's gone. <laughs> and I mean, I have his arm. So, I mean, anytime I touch myself, it's basically. Let's not go there. Let's not. Let's not lead into those thoughts. We were better than that. Open adventure log. The closed door. When you tried to open the door to the Temple of Time, Rauru appeared and said you were a little bitch. Go visit the shrines. Zelda's in there. Oh, Temple of Time. There is timey-wimey shit going on. Okay, okay. So she's been here for a while. Whether she, like, went into the past or I've been asleep. Um, Let me move myself out of the way of the map as well. I didn't realize I was that much in it. There you go. Perfect. She was now, though. True. My arm. My rules. I almost jumped off the edge and then I remembered I didn't have a sailcloth. Oh god, it's weird not having a sailcloth. Okay. Yeet! I lived. There's a shrine right there, right? I, I, I was like, he pointed me in that direction. I'm guessing. Okay. Let's go kill this soldier. Bum, 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 bum. Ogre, please don't be like that. But I gotta. It's what I do with my life. What are these? Oh, we're about to get our first bow. Let's go. I feel when no paraglider. Yeah, it's sad. The world is a sad place without a paraglider. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh, no, I don't want to waste that just yet. Tree branch. Okay. One more hit should do it. <gasps> Big stick. Yeah, get up. Dare you. Old wooden bow. Wooden bow from the olden days. Built for hunting, but it's not very powerful. Um, yeah, okay. Same as always. Bonk. <laughs> yeah! I've got so many bonk sticks. Ooh, five arrows. Okay. Gotta climb the stairs. There's gotta be something secret out of here. That's civilization. Yeah, we're getting longer and longer sticks. More and more power and some metal and... What did I just hear? Oh, this is ready for me to build shit, so I'm not supposed to be here yet. Um, yeah, I should focus on actually... Oh, <gasps> surprise attack. Oh, God. He doesn't know. He does know. He threw a rock at me. <laughs> hey, buddy. Yeet! Kind of missed, but it worked. Let's see if I remember how to... Oh, no. Yep, crit hit. Okay, waste of an arrow. Let's just go to the shrine. <laughs> we have a knower. What's a knower? Still works. Yep, I still know how to use... Oh, rush rooms. Oh, these existed even back in ancient times. Mushroom that can grow almost anywhere, but prefers ceilings and sheer cliffs. Cook it before eating to temporarily increase your movement speed. I thought they did stamina stuff. That makes sense. They're called rushrooms. On down there. I need it. I need everything. <laughs> I am a hoarder. I think learned the art of the stick. Yeah, we're getting into serious. What is that sound? That was weird. Electables. Yeah, you gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Ukua Shrine. I wonder if these are still named after developers. In Breath of the Wild, they named all the shrines after, like, developers who made the game. 
Is that like a bell? That's what it sounded like. It sounded like some sort of alarm system saying, oh no, there's someone here. Pick up everything you see, yeah. And then cook everything you see. Collect everything you see. Let's get in here. Oh. That, that's a cool effect. In the shrines in the past, they like took you down into the ground. This one, it's just like massive on the inside, but tiny on the outside. Interesting. Raru, you, yeah, I figured. <laughs> You're gonna tell me. Don't worry, I won't just give you my power. You have to earn it. So, you've made it here. This is a shrine of light. Long ago, I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe this light will restore an ability your right arm has lost. Now then, extend your hand. Yeah, so far we've got Timey Wimey and Tardises. Timey Wimey and Tardises, we're definitely playing a Doctor Who game. This has to be Ultra Hand, right? Like, yeah, I figured. They have to start me with, like, the combiny power. Da -da -da -da. Grab and move objects, rotate them, and stick them to other objects. Mm. With my own form of glue. This is the Ultra Hand ability. It allows you to move objects freely and attach them to other objects. With it, you will be able to build a great number of things. Really, anything you can imagine. Use Ultra Hand and receive the blessing from the shrine. So yeah, this is straight up Tutorial Island. They're going to give me powers, make me use them to get through. It's perfect. Do, 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 do. The ability to create Ukur Shrine. Oh god, he's hot. <laughs> Chat is so down bad for Rauru immediately. It's hilarious. Oh, okay, how do I... Oh. <laughs> He uses a different button from Breath of oh, That's got to be weird. Powers were always the up thing in Breath of the Wild. I did it! <laughs> but how do we stick things together? Um, how do I rotate? Hold on. Ah, you, it's that simple. Of course it is. Nintendo are gods at this. They know what they're doing. He's the source for. True. He's teaching me how to use his arm. He keeps calling it my arm too. He's very polite about that. I would be like, I'll return the power of my arm. This dude's like, no, no, no. It's your arm now. Triple bridge, baby. Um. There we go. Okay. I have the super bridge. That was a cool dude. I love his voice. He seems really chill about everything, too. I don't know why. I wonder if the Sage of Light is named after him. Or what's up with that? Why can't I make it high enough? No. Go up. There we go. Wait, could I have just grabbed that? Yeah, I could have just grabbed that. <laughs> you could attach treasure chests? Oh, that's great. The long bridge. I'm sticking. Like, this bridge is staying with me. I got amber. And so is this treasure... Oop. So is this treasure chest. You're now part of the ship. <laughs> oh, this is great. Can I use it as a weapon? Come on, give me an enemy. Fine. Oh, God. Giant bridge. Is it long enough for this? No. Oh! It totally... I... There's a rail here. Ah. Come to me. Oh, that's just teaching you how. Because you've got the pieces here. I see. Oh, unstick. Sick. Oh shit, it starts moving. No. No. No, no, no. I'm back. Oh, just... Yeah, okay. I need to... Form it first. 
Time to make a flying ship. I don't think I have the parts for that yet. We need like a dozen fans. <laughs> okay, so. I'm gonna... I mean, they gave me two hooks. I'm guessing that's in case you lose one. If this game has torque, I better put it in the middle. I'm pretty sure I can just do this, though. Like, I'm going to do it the right way, but... That kind of angers me. <laughs> I, I mean... <laughs> put that to the side. <laughs> but we're going to do this. Because, <laughs> God damn it, I built this hook thing. I want to use it. Let's go. <laughs> but the bridge would have worked. Which is even more funny. I guess this is just Nintendo saying, yes, we will let you do things the way you want. Okay, we're done. We got the special item in the shrine. That's so cool. Oh, they teach you to build it with that thing up. I freaking love Nintendo. The polish is on another level. Is there an easy way? Choose the hard way? Yeah, choose the fun way is the most important thing. Ooh. It's the pretty girl from the mural. You have done well to reach this place. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. Love that voice sound as well. So Raudu had a girlfriend. I wonder if she's... They said... At least the Hyrule Royal family was formed from Hylians with Zonai. So are these like Zelda's ancestors? Because the woman kind of looked like Zelda. Or is it time travel and that is Zelda? Did this guy cuck me? No. This was like the first game since Skyward Sword. We actually got together. Don't do it. Light of blessing. A crystal that glows with a light that purges ancient evil and purifies with its radiance. Don't tell me that's Zelda all grown up. After time traveling... May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. Goodbye. Well, I kind of formed a treasure chest. I and kind of the temple of time is shaped like that too. Tears of the Cuckton. <laughs> I love the theories we come up with while we play games like this. It's just like, ah, uh, we've been cucked. Zelda went back in time, became a furry, fucked this dude. And now this dude gave me an arm. I don't know how to feel about that anymore. <laughs> I feel like I'm being like, like it's like, it's okay, kiddo. I may have stolen your wife, but you can have an arm. There you go. <laughs> you did very well getting through that shrine. And you've restored an ability. This is wonderful. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you should be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. You may want to mark the shrines in the distance with pins, and you'll never lose track of where they are. The Pura Pad offers you a very useful scope. It's very handy. <laughs> Get it? Handy. Uh, we like to joke when we lose a limb. Anyway. Have fun, Link. Okay. I already asked that question, Frey. <laughs> Basically, yes. I mean, if I got the Ultra Hand ability, I would start playing with things. <laughs> uh, where are the other ones? There's one. One, two... Are there three or four? I guess there's three. Do we learn three abilities here? Oh my god. This island kind of scary. Or maybe... Once I get up to that one, I'll be able to see another one. That's like icy. Yeah, they want me to do this one first. I'm gonna follow like the thing that... The oh yeah, now I can build a bridge out of that stuff. Oh god. <laughs> um... I'm going to follow, like, the way they want me to go for the most part. Unless I find something more fun along the way. But, I mean, this is Tutorial Island, so it makes sense that you just, like, follow. Like, Nintendo knows what they're doing about, like, setting up things. Getting you used to storyline. Gameplay mechanics. This is going to fall off, isn't it? No? Okay, I'm counterweighting it. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Don't jump, remember? I... Ugh. It feels so much like Breath of the Wild. I'm like, it's fine. My paraglider's got me. There we go. 
Perfect. Giant bridge. Long, long breeze. I mean, they give me so much stuff. Can I just keep... How big can a bridge get? How far can you go before the game starts to break and says you've stuck too many things together? Because until I find out, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to take this bridge with me. Do, 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 do. Wow, this one's too long now. Ooh, apples. Wait, you can... Oh, that's kind of sick. But it's like magnesis, but it can grab everything. You can attach an apple to a bridge. That's great as well. Oh, God. This bridge is... Oh, God, it's so hard to maneuver. It's okay. We're bringing this with us. This will come in handy. I'm sure of it. As long as I don't walk off this edge behind me. Oh. You can fuse like 20 things max. Okay, I want to... Oh. oh, it's Rauru. I didn't know what that was. <gasps> They're giving us logs too. Our bridge is going to get so much bigger. Come on, buddy. We're on an adventure. <laughs> it's already... <laughs> the FPS on the switch is dropping a little bit. Maybe I should have used that to get down. Nah, we're fine. We. <laughs> hey, Rauru. <gasps> a boat. Kind of. I mean, yeah, I guess that counts as a boat. What's up? You looking at logs? Oh. I see that they're still at work even now. We originally created the constructs to insist, assist in our endeavors. All of us were fond of them. I never imagined they would continue to carry out their assigned tasks to this day. Hmm. The fact that their labor no longer serves any purpose, yet they perform it still. It is disquieting to me. Yeah, that's kind of sad. They're just going to go for all eternity. All this guy does is just, what, chop down tree? Yeah, he's made wood for me. Portable bundle of wood. You can use this to make a campfire if you have something to light it. Okay. Fix your gaze forward. Face it head on. Hmm? Pardon me. I was absorbed in my wood cutting. Are you here for wood cutting too? I love wood cutting. It's the reason you exist, right? Wood cutting is the practice of chopping down trees to create logs. Logs can be combined to assemble platforms. You can also chop them down further to make wood. Lumber has many uses. That is why I come here daily to chop wood. And yet I still find it difficult to chop them down in the intended direction. That is why you have heard me muttering to myself. Fix your gaze forward. Face it head on. Ah, I apologize. I've been rambling for some time. There is an axe I no longer need over there. It is yours to use if you want to do some wood cutting. Oh my, has it grown so late already? I must have failed to notice the time bell. I will rest for today. Time bell? Was that the sound we heard earlier? So it's just literally a bell that like lets them know what time of day it is? Cool. Okay. I guess we're getting rid of a stick. What is my purpose? You cut wood. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that must be so sad. Oh, he went to sleep. Oh, he's a maker construct. They have different, yeah, they have different things to do. Ah, oh, I see. You are still here and hard at work after the night bell. Wood cutting is certainly strenuous. I'm taking a short rest. It's nice to be able to rest when the time bell rings. Though the time seems to pass so quickly as I gaze at the fire. Oh, he's a happy guy. So a cuckoo clock? Basically, yeah. And a stick. And a log. Okay. So... They want me to make a log bridge here. Oh, and there's a river over there. Okay, so I need that boat. And I need my giant thing. My giant bridge. Is there anything? In oh, there's so many logs around here as well. I didn't really need to cut anything. That Is he dead? Oh, this one ran out of power. And I stole his Zonite charge. Poor buddy. 
So some of them have kept going on forever, but some of them actually like pass away. I guess they just like run out of battery. But his charge still seemed to be... Maybe he was killed by a soldier or something. Ooh. Yeah, carrying this thing makes it lag so bad. What is that I can grab up there? It looks like a giant box. It's recycling. Oh, um, yeah, I mean, he wasn't using the battery, so... It's like a floating That's... island. Too far away. Okay. <laughs> no one is going to maintain them. Yeah, Rauru is too busy doing his own thing. Come on, Bridgie McBridge. Stop turning. I didn't want you to... How do I... Oh. Rotate R. Oh, it's too high up. There's a tree in the way. This thing is too big. There we go. Extend my bridge of doom. <laughs> I'm bringing the boat too, though. There's that boat. Yeah. These guys made me a boat. It's mine now. There we go. Um, I'm surprised you can't get things higher. Bridgy McBridge and Bodie McBoatface. Well, that's just going to end up going left because, yeah, the water flows that way. Yes. Need to get it past the stone bridge. Bum, bum, bum. And what are these things? They're like floating islands. Oh, there's the time bell again. They just... Yeah, they just hover. Sick. kinds of weird things this is gonna be a thing isn't it yeah it is <laughs> sorry to tell you we're gonna be bringing that bridge everywhere <laughs> until it like unloads i think at some point like probably when i go into the next shrine it's just gonna disappear but for now we're stuck with the bridge pew 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 at least i didn't add logs to it i know when to stop it's lagging enough as it is i do not want to break the game um, ba -ba -da 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 -da. Pew, 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 pew. So it's giving me a lot of options to get past this water as well. It's like, hey, you can use this to climb up that mountain and go sideways. Where am I even going? Um. Oh, that way. Red. Yeah. Oh, so I do have to get rid of a lot of water. I can climb that way or I can use this boat. Does it actually go forward? No. I need to actually have some movement of some kind. But it's teaching me about momentum in water. God, this game's so smart. And there's a campfire over there. So there should be something interesting. Ganon is a sexy man? Yeah, he is. We're away from him right now. Is that a bow? Oh, hell yeah. <gasps> Are you hunting? Buddy, are you going to take out those little birds? Quiet. I am engaged in hunting. Hunting? Yes. I hunt wild creatures that inhabit the forest. Hmm. I do not remember seeing you here before. Three constructs fulfill several roles. One is to provide any necessarily explanations to newcomers such as yourself. Other constructs you meet will be able to answer questions you may have about other subjects. My specialty is hunting. The hunt is to dispatch wild creatures. Many of them dwell within the forest. They are highly nutritious to organic life. They are also extremely wary. A hunter must not make noise. Crouching is essential for silence. A bow can be used to strike from afar. Aiming for weak spots is best. I will give you the bow placed over... Where is my bow? What happened to my bow? Human. What happened to my bow, human? <laughs> Ranger construct. He's like, wait a minute. I didn't offer that to you yet. Okay. So they're saying headshot. You get in my... That should not have hit you. I'm sorry, buddy. Okay. Nice. Did you steal my arrow? I really thought the arrow would still be there at least. I was nowhere near him. How did he get shot? Where is my meat? There. Yes, delicious meat. Do I still have bullet time is my next question. We're going to find out. Eventually. Yeah, I'm going to use that tree. Don't hit me. 
I'm planning something. <laughs> planning on killing you in a more... F Ooh, I'm taking your babies too. Bird egg. A fresh bird egg, bird egg necessary for making dishes such as omelets and crepes. You snack them from bird's nests if you're sneaky. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't sneaky about it. Yeet! <laughs> yeah, we've still got bullet time. Where'd you go? There you went. Sick. That only gives me one, though. Beating it with a stick gives me two meats. But beating it with a stick is better. I forgot my bridge! Well, it's fine. Got more sky bridges over here. I abandoned the bridge already. God damn it. So easily distracted. Oh, God. What are these here for, though? Are they just to play with? Oh, no. We can get up there. Only two of them. That's fine. Probably. Yeah, I just need to be able to climb up to it, really. Or Bodie McBoat. I mean, Bridgie McBridge. We had a good time. No, we don't need to attach. These are so cool, though. I, I could really just bring these with me, huh? And I'd have a floating bridge. Should have collected the last one, too. Buy a bridge. <laughs> we, we, we will order the bridge. Don't worry. We'll recreate the bridge at some point. But longer. And out of metal. And with flamethrowers. We're platforming now. Literally placing platforms. Arrow. Another bow. Oh, another dead body. I wonder what your process was. I mean, I'm probably a hunter since you're surrounded by so many arrows. He has good memories with bridge. Yeah. Bridge served us well. So many arrows. Oh my god. No. Keep getting those buttons wrong. We're already up to 22. Any eggs? I'm a hungry adventure. Yeah, boy! God, we're foraging so good today. Okay. We can get our way back down here. Where we go in is that way. Water! We're gonna need a boat. I didn't bring the boat, but I'm sure they'll provide me things to make a boat. Ba -ba -bum. Wait, should I bring those with me? Or is there a safe way? Oh, there's another one. God, this game is so awesome. There's so much to do just running around. What are you? Stam bulb, a wild plant with bulging roots. Often found in cooler climates, it contains nutrients that increase endurance. Look at to restore stamina. Don't mind if I do. Oh, there's enemies. Oh, they have alarms. Ow, dick. Oh, there's one above. I'm an idiot. Yeah, fire that arrow. <gasps> Not my axe. Yeah, bitch. Give me your arrows. Oh, why did I calm down from there? It's bullet time, baby. Yeet! Oh, yeah. Ow. There's another? Okay. Select shield. Yeah, I know how to do that. Don't shoot me. I'm friend. By friend, I mean I'm going to murder you. Oh, so many bows now. This battle music's really good as well. I love the way it cuts out. That's an awful sound. Yeah, it is. It's so noisy. <laughs> Ooh, special unlocked one. What we got? More amber. They've been giving us a lot of amber. An opal. Sick. <gasps> Things to cut up. Bum, bum, bum. Not the bulge. <laughs> I mean, sometimes <laughs> games describe things in interesting ways. <laughs> I don't think I picked up. Yeah, I figured he'd have arrows. He dropped a bow too, but I didn't see where. It, oh. Well, my hand helping me find it. Maybe I did grab it. Yeah, probably. Okay. Got to be boat building parts around here. But where? Gotta go that way. So probably. Oh, we can go lower. Yeah, that'll do. And they gave us water. Oh. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I need to reach my front. No! Meat! 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 Oh, God. We're so close. Hey, which friend do you need to meet? Oh, no. <laughs> it begins. 
Ah, we've got a comfy Korok with us now. Let's see how we do with this. This is awful. Where's my friend? Yeah. Huh? You can see me? I'm a Korok, one of the children of the forest. I was traveling with my friend, yeah. but we got separated. Yeah, <laughs> that kind of cute. I feel I feel worse for them now that we have like a comfy version. Wait, did I not? Oh, it got cut off. Okay, I need to add. I thought I added the references, um, but this is a different asset made by a different person. Um, so we've got a little comfy Korok as well. A little sheep pretending to be a Korok. My friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. I'm so tired, though. I can't move. Okay. Can I stick you to things? No? Yes. Okay, good. First off. <laughs> Stabella shroom. A nutritious mushroom chock full of natural energy. Cook it to release its stamina restoration properties. Cool. And I drop you on your face. He rolls over like a turtle. Okay, I'm going to help you, buddy. Don't worry. We've got hooks. We've got... Oh, so I need to build my own bridge. We don't have, like, the little wooden thing. I need to... Yeah. That's smart. I like that. Belief abuse. Hey, I mean... People bully trees all the time. It, it, it's a tree. Maybe it has feelings, but I can't understand them. They're beyond my comprehension. Uh, up here. Then we'll stick you to that. I is in chat? So mean. <laughs> Look, he's adorable. He must be bullied. We're doing it in a loving way. Yeet. Oh, we have to. I'm helping him get to his buddy. He, he, they have the smoke signal. I'm ready to go. Off we go, little Korok buddy. Oh god, it bounced so much. I need to reach my friend. Yeah, I know. I'm helping. Now, I mean, I tortured you for a little bit. But now we're helping. Yeet! <laughs> you, you happy? You happy with my process? I'm going to put you on the fire. There's my friend. <laughs> Smoked Korok. Delicious. Delicious. Reunited at last. Thanks. I'd like to give you something, but here's all I have. Korok. Oh, times two. Let's go. <laughs> He's so happy. Bye-bye. Your friend's fine. A little carbon monoxide. Oh, he came down. That works too. <laughs> that works too. <laughs> I love the Koroks. Yeah, they're pretty cute. I'd have feel bad for torturing him, but you got to do it sometimes. He's survivable. He's fine. He got through it. Yes, officer, this man right here will never take me alive. Be gone before you can be here. Some more arrows. Ooh, a mushroom. Another hook. Lots of hooks. Hooks and a bridge thing. I need that for down there. Perfect. We've got hooks. We can extend our old one, in fact. Why am I collecting when I've got one? I could just create a boat up here and then bring it down there. <gasps> this is awesome. So. Let's extend. Oh, that's so bad. Yuck. There we go. Make it four along. Two bridges is better than one, though. <laughs> True. Now we don't even need bridges. Now we've got rails. I could have two hooks, but I don't want two hooks. But that'll offset the counterweight of this thing. Of the sail. Okay. That should be fine. Um... 
I'm scared that I'm going to put it on the hook and it's going to go without me. Because <laughs> this is now pretty heavy. Come on. Come on. Oh, I need to take it around. Or is the sail just too big? Yeah, the hook is too big. Actually, I need to get it like down here. Don't fall. Don't fall on me. Oh, God. Come on, attach, buddy. There we go. Okay. Is that attached? I can't tell. Yeah, that's attached. Oh, God. This is going to be close. Go! Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. Um... I wish there was a way to, like, hold it still while I climbed on it. Go! Son of a... It's so close. I'm so scared. What if I counterweight it? What if I... Leave this here. And then get on it. And then push this onto the front. If I attach it here. Nah, it doesn't weigh us down enough. Oh, crap. I'm scared. Okay, I'm just going to push. Good. Mm. Now oh, it's too heavy to push. <laughs> fine. Fine. We'll do it the dangerous way. I'll just run and jump. Oh, God. No. Tough. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. This is so funny. This is torturous. I don't want to waste all of this work. Okay, I have a boat where I need a boat. Get off there, Hook. Come on. Come on. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. Barely stick the landing. Yeah, I was so scared that was just going to run away without me. Oh, there's the bell again. Is that an enemy? Yeah, let's explore before we take this boat. Hey, buddy, you got a big old club. How does that swing? Sideways. Okay. Come at me again. Come on. Do the thing, buddy. Wait, I've got my axe out. Second thought, don't do the thing just yet. <laughs> Wait, I've already got one of those. A thick stick. Oh, yeah, baby. A thick back cut from a large tree. It's not the sturdiest weapon, but its heavy end does have a bit of power behind it. Now I've got a thick stick, but I like axes. So I'm going to get rid of this. There we go. Bum, ba -dum, bum. Bonk it? Hell yeah. I've got so many bonk sticks now. Oh, I can get rid of the Korok. We don't have a Korok here anymore. No more comfy Korok. A horn and a charge. Oh, so they have this stuff here for me to build a boat, too, if I did lose my boat. Now I feel kind of dumb. What are you? Two-handed X? Don't mind if I do, but first. Yo, you guys are... Oh, you guys are strong. Stronger than I expected. Good you giddy. Would you like a bonk? A long bonk or a thick bonk? Oh, my choices. And now I have a two-handed... Smash. I've got quite a variety of weapons considering these are all like Stone Age things. How big is this like a spitty weapon? Yeah, that's a heavy weapon. I'm guessing this is a heavy weapon too. Yeah, makes sense. Okay, so we'll stick with the uh, wooden sticks for now. Don't waste things. Anything else over here? Another choo choo. Thank you. Two, three. Mochu. There's some glowing stuff. Oh, that's the sky. <laughs> Two-handed smash. I mean, if it needs two hands, yeah, that is a thick stick. Nah, there's nothing else over here. This was just for the fun of it. What about on top of here? It's just a weird little stone fence thing. Bum, bum, bum. Ooh, fireflies. Oh, can I actually get them? I wonder if they're actually legit fireflies. If they're just environmental. 
Yo! The firefly glows gently in the dark. When cooked with monster parts, the compound that causes it glow results in an elixir that allow you to move quietly. Okay, just like Breath of the Wild. Bum, 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 bum. Come down. Are you up high? Come on. Come be a friend. Come be a friend. So that I can cook you into things to make me more sneaky. To find more of your friends. They look so pretty. Yeah, this is nice. This is a nice atmosphere. But if you just run at them. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. Oh, the other one flew. Okay, we got enough anyway. Um, there's a stronger stick here. Goodbye, old broken stick. Good. Okay, let's take our boat on over. This looks like a good place to launch it, actually. Because it won't be able to run away from me if I drop it in the water there. Oh, well, damn it. <laughs> Come to me. You would not believe your eyes if sunset fire flies. Get off of my boat hook. Let's move you to the middle. There we go. Now we're ready to swim. Boat? Fly? Whatever. Yeet! Okay. We're doing the thing. <laughs> It'll take a while, but we're on the way. Good time zones, Fuchan, everybody. Glad I woke up. What's up, Fuchijin? Thank you for joining us today. This game has been incredible so far. I knew it would be. This has just started off so gentle and calming. Sing a shishanti. Mm. What shall we do? Wait. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Early in the morning. Nah. It's pretty much the only part of that. I know. There are so many sea shanties, but I always forget them when it actually comes time to sing it. The wheels on the boat do not exist. Do not exist. Do not exist. The sail on the boat gets blown. Oh, that was a big lag spike. I don't know what my switch right now. I didn't expect this game to be this intensive. Anyway, we made it. <laughs> Put him. Oh. Put him in the brig and tell he's sober. Put him in the brig and tell he's sober. Put him in the brig and tell he's sober. Does that also end with early in the morning? <laughs> Come to me! Okay. We got a few. What's up, Choo Choo? Come jump at me. We. I can't believe I can't flurry rush these things. They're so adorable. They'd be perfect to flurry rush. What's up, soldier? You good? Or you want to fight? Because if you want to fight... <laughs> oh god, he spins. You know what? This is damaged, so. Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> I'll just trade sticks on over here. Um. The zone I charge is going away from me. I don't want another thick stick. I've already got one thick stick. Mushy mushroom. Badger, badger, badger. Soldier, 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 soldier. I'm going to do the thing first and then explore this area. The stairs are here. I trust Nintendo to guide. Ooh, that, that definitely has eggs in it. They're making me climb to it. It definitely has eggs in it. Spinny boy. I know. He thought he was a Beyblade. It didn't work out very well for him. <laughs> okay. Poor guy. I love that they give you pants immediately and they just leave shirtless Link. They know what we like. Um, whoop. Mushrooms and eggs. Make a nice one. Oh my god. Okay, I'll come back to you. In fact, I will mark you on my map. Big giant hole. Big giant scary hole. I'll be right back. I've got to climb these stairs first. And do that was scary. Yeah. Stepping off the edge there and then seeing a giant hole into nothing below me. I was like, wait, I'm going to die. Oh, I need bombs. Where can I get bombs? Welcome back, Foger. Thank you, TB. I'm glad to be back. And I'm glad to be playing this game. Yeah, I love that. It's so massive on the inside and tiny on the outside. What do we say about looking where we leap? I didn't technically leap. I fell that time. I let myself fall off. <laughs> Other times I've been actively jumping. So yeah, that is kind of on me. What do we got? Oh, do we get a new power? I just realized, yeah, new shrine, new power. 
Do, do, do. So, you've made it here. Now then, extend your right hand. Love how, like, wary he is every time. <laughs> He's back, yep. Furry daddy is back. That feels wrong to say. But you know what? Am I lying? <laughs> Am I lying? Sword. Do I get my master sword back now? Is that what it is? I get to, like, recharge the baby boy? Fuse. Add something to an equipped weapon. To oh, or shield to enhance it. You can undo the fusion, but that will destroy whatever's been attached. Okay. Mm. This is the fuse ability. It allows you to fuse something nearby to your weapon or shield, thereby enhancing it. Why not pick up that sword just ahead and then fuse a nearby object to it? Mm. Use fuse and receive the blessing from the shrine. Okay, so it's just going to be a bunch of fighting, but they're also going to let me fuse things. Set ability. Ah. Boulders! Oh, that's how you break rocks? A large part of me wants to fuse the sword to my shield. But I won't. What if I fuse the sword to my long stick? Okay, wait. We need to try something first. Let's see if we can break through this with a stick. Uh, wooden stick. Plus two, so six damage. Okay. That's what I like to see. In which case... What's my strongest weapon? The rusty sword is my strongest weapon, but I don't want to use that because it'll break. Um, thick stick. No, I like long stick. I'm going to make the longest weapon possible. Long stick plus a claymore. Rusty claymore, six damage. A two-handed sword, not properly kept. Oh, that's just the rusty claymore. Don't expect it to last more than a few strikes. <laughs> oh my god! Oh! <laughs> oh shit. Come at me, enemies. Come at me. <laughs> I think I'm good now. I, I think I'm going to be able to deal with some shit. Um, I should probably combine one of these other ones with this boulder too. Yeah, just a wooden stick will do. Wooden stick. And maybe... Thick stick? Yeah, thick boulder. No, there might be other things. Let's go ahead for now. Um, boulder stick. Boulder hammer? Boulder hammer. Long jump ready? <laughs> yeah! We're going to be able to fly into the air now. Okay, we can break these things. What's this about? What are you? Spicy pepper? Fire fruit. A fruit that generates heat when struck. Cooked correctly, its heating properties improve blood flow. Stimulate muscles to raise attack power in high temperatures. Huh. Raise attack power in high temperature. Oh. Oh. Attach materials to arrows. This is this guide. I didn't realize I got that with the same power. Press and hold up. Keep bro drawn. Okay. So I can create a fire arrow with fire fruit. They gave me so many. Then I can set that on fire. Fire fruit. Sick. Come to me, treasure chest. I wonder what the other things do when they combine. This game is so cool. Yeah, there's so many mechanics to it. Small key. Damn it. I was kind of hoping that was something special. What else can I fuse? You can literally fuse everything. What do I... Oh, I've got to have so much fun playing with these. So many options. No wonder they give you so many arrows. So the arrows can just be used as a delivery system too. We fruity now. We fire. Oh, there's the thing. Yay! Yeah. Any others? Nah, it looks like it's it. Just five arrows. Not bad. Literally anything that's so cool. Yeah, just any item. It's like, go nuts. We're not going to tell you what it does, but you can try. <laughs> it's like Dungeons and Dragons. It's just like, well, you can certainly try. Not telling you anything useful is going to happen, but... Go nuts, kiddo. Nothing secret here. Oh, this has got to be a fight, right? Okay. My boulder arrow, but I also have fire fruit. Because that's a lot of, yeah, leaves. Oh, he, bad, scary looking. 
He could fuse too. So enemies are going to be able to fuse. Interesting. I should have set the ground on fire. I'm an idiot. But that kind of stunned him. Come over here, buddy. Or don't. Fine. I'll come to you. Come at me, bitch. You're just going to chill. I want to set the crown on. Fine. I mean, they could have made that harder. <laughs> okay. Construct bow. Oh, I can't carry anymore. Um, I'll drop the one I've been using. This one's stronger. Captain Construct Horn. Can you combine... You must be able to, right? Combine, like, monster parts and another rock hammer. Well, anything else I can use a rock hammer on? Another boulder there. We jump in this man? Yeah, we destroyed the poor dude. Oh, he did not stand a chance. I didn't even get to use the fire ground on him, which they clearly wanted me to. What's up here? Big stick. Yeah, literally just a long stick and a wooden stick. What are these? I can combine spikes? Okay. What do we put those on? Thick stick? Thick st oh, spiky rusty broadsword? Plus four. 10 damn. Oh my god. That looks terrifying. <laughs> That's just a shit ton of damage out of nowhere. Um... That'll do. I mean, I could put it on my... Uh, no, I use my axe for... Well, I've got two axes. Sure. Try one. Wait. The stone axe is already... Oh. That counts as a combination weapon. That must be like a... Rock combined with a stick? I'm confused. But it's fine. Okay. Interesting. Make a spiky shield. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. What? Then when the enemies hit me, they'll get hurt. I use it on the rusty shield. Um, I forgot you could bind, combine things to shields. Oh, my God. I could probably hit enemies with that, too. They would just do five. This game is so cool. There's so much intricacy to everything this one i've used this one is new <laughs> wait are these the same size oh no that's a bigger one older hammer this is just a rock sword i'll take the boulder hammer yeah okay too terrible too amazing we've got a spiky sh look at that shit oh my god that even a spiky shield that's a murder shield <laughs> Oh, I'll just skip this this time. The same every time. Give me my light of blessing. Two down. I feel like there was going to need to be four, but there's only three. Normally it was four to like upgrade yourself. Maybe you get the fourth in the Temple of Time. Thank you, Dauru. You're going to rock someone's world. I'm going to rock someone's world and then I'm going to spike their drink with extra alcohol, not with anything bad. Don't take that the wrong way. <laughs> Oh, it's a steward con. I thought it was going to be Rauru. Link. I love how it moves like an old person. The stewards, like, they have their hands down there, too. He's cute. Looks like a little old person wobbling around. I came because there's something I failed to give you. Thank you, Link. I haven't came in hundreds of years. Sorry. Please take it. What are these? That's my battery pack, right? Does that mean I'm going to be using, like, technology soon? Energy cell. A gift from a Zonai construct. Designed to be worn on a belt. It can power Zonai devices. What I have just given you is an energy cell. As you read, but now I'm going to explain it anyway. It is required to make use of the tools known as Zonai devices. I cannot demonstrate its utility because there are no Zonai devices right here. Look over there at that shit, man. I have associates on the other side of that cave system. They can teach you how to use this. Go on, kiddo. I believe in you. I hope that the energy cell I provided is useful to you. You're adorable. Thank you. 
Oh, he doesn't even fear me anymore. That's that's fair. I wasn't actually going to hit him. Um, I want to open up the cave in front of me, so I'll mark this for now. Cave system down that away. Let's see what this is. You don't even need bombs. Oh, it's just a chest. <laughs> that works too. <laughs> no, don't hit him. Yeah, he was nice to me, so I I'll let him live. He lives for now. So many branches around here. Oh, can I combine you? No. The fact that you can combine, like, sticks to other sticks. Ooh. Yeah, those are just rocks. So I could combine more rocks. Bonk the wall. <laughs> yeah, you don't even need bombs anymore. Just like now, I'll just smash the wall with my giant boulder hammer thing. Don't forget the giant hole. Oh, shit. Yeah, there was a giant hole just at the bottom of here. We. Let me save before I go down there. That may be one of those things you... Oh, bird. Maybe one of those things you don't come back out of. Oh, yeah. Give me that chicken meat. Well, bird dumbstrick. Dr dr dumbstrick? Drumstick. This meat is tougher and chewier than a standard steak. Tastes better cooked. I am such a good hunter. Okay. We save. I may not come back out of here. <laughs> I do not have... A paraglider or much stamina. Bum, bum, bum. I'm gonna go down the rush room way. Oh god! Oh, it's a cave. That works. Still want that rush room. The, the boulder sword is like as big as Link. And he just carries it around one handed. That's crazy. I really thought this was like a hole straight down. Ooh. Another big boulder. Ooh, pretty. Oh. <gasps> If I had cryosis, I could climb this so... This is so gorgeous. Oh. Ow. I'm just going to be fine kicking that. Just some more amber. This is taking me back the way I came from, right? But it's given me rush rooms. So I'll grab these rush rooms and then I'll go... To the cave system. Oh, so many rush rooms. New arm stomp. Yeah. New foot stomp. Oh, I guess I am. Yeah, I'm wearing sandals. So I guess... Makes sense. Oh, this took me back through the river. So that was another way to get to the other side of the river. That's crazy. This game has so many options for you. And this is gorgeous. Just the water falling endlessly. Love that. Can I make... Can I use this? No, you can't make a treasure chest weapon. That would have been fun. It would have been like a mimic. <laughs> For sound why you're so cute. I'm not cute. I'm a gremlin. As you could see, by the way, I'm playing this game. Very pretty. Yeah, I love that. Weep. Looks like an Instagram post. Got more stuff to make a boat, but we don't need a boat right now. I wonder if you could just use like one log rather than creating like three logs so it's more stable. <gasps> Enemies. Oh, they're fighting choo-choos. I'm going to back up the choo-choos. The choo-choos are my boys. These guys move too much. I don't like it. I got your back, too. Oh, God. Not cool, buddy. I'm here, you. Bad. Bad. <laughs> well, that made it nice and easy. <laughs> they were too busy with each other. So ungrateful. I know, right? Oh, I missed a bird. Okay. Another enemy and a treasure chest. Get the treasure chest first. I'll never see it coming. <gasps> Item. Nope, they saw me. That's fine. It's still mine, bitches. Soldier Reaper. A tree branch with an added grip and excellent balance. So this is a combinate combina Oh, you can actually trade things now. That's freaking awesome. Um, goodbye, thick stick. Drop. Yo! It's like a little sword. Oh, it's got a Zonai horn attached to it. That's what it is. Yeah, that's strong as shit. Come on. Bad. Got another shield. What do you have, sir? Oh my god! 
creates a giant gust of wind? Seriously? I'll put that out. Do that again. That was crazy. Come on. Dude, you don't want to fight? Oh, he's setting things on fire. Fine, I'll take it from you. Put the fire out, damn it. Oh, it broke. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that's what's on the weapon. The soldier construct horn. You got to spank you? Yeah, I broke whatever that was, unfortunately. But we got a cooking pot. That's more like it. Okay. But barely any health, so... Let's just do meat in a shroom. Oh, why is that so strong? What the... Check out those ingredients. You have a check recipe thing now! That's more like it. Okay, yeah, that's the perfect balance of things. Bum, 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 bum. You getting hit with paws now? Yeah, that was kind of incredible. I can't wait to see some of the other things that you can combine in this game. He's facing head on the inventory now is so funny. Yeah, he's just like, what are we going to do? What are we going to do, player? What's your plan here? Scrambled egg. Oh, I should make an omelette. Let's make a mushroom omelette. I like my omelettes with two eggs. One egg is not enough. How about that? Mushroom omelette? Oh shit, that's a lot of energy. Damn, the eggs go hard. What about a yakudon? I have bird. I have chicken. I have chicken and egg. That should make a yakudon. Oh no, I'd need rice. But still. Meat skewer. Oh, so it's just like egg fried meat. That's that's fine. Um, This is for stamina. So I'll double this up. I didn't mean to do that. Frick. Um, rush room. I need this to increase my movement speed. Take five of these as much movement as possible. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Speed up times. Ooh, double for five minutes. Let's go. Um, fire fruit apparently makes you stronger in high temperatures. I'm not going to find high temperatures for a while. Keeping my choo choo jello. I can't believe I ate this. Ugh, stamina restoration. Restore stamina. So yeah, we'll, we'll double these up. I could have made three. Damn it. Don't accidentally eat the construct horn. Can you eat construct horns? Because I kind of want to try now. No. Damn it. <laughs> but I wonder if I can use that to make elixirs. Let's see. One monster part. Let's see if that works. If that counts as a monster part. Because it's technically a robot. That does not count as a monster part. <laughs> That's dubious. That's fine. That's fine. I'll make instead... Um, oh god, I wasted so many sunset fireflies. I'll, I'll use the choo-choo jelly. That's the only monster we've found so far. There we go. Stealth up for nine minutes. Hell yeah. Um, and let's just make a little more food before we head on. You're going to eat the horn now? <laughs> if I could. I'm not going to lie. I would have tried. <laughs> I was lagging. Ah, sorry. Welcome back. Has anybody else been lagging? I have got a few drop frames, but it seems like it's better than it was earlier, at least. Hopefully this is just a today thing and it will fix itself soon. Fruit and mushroom. I'll do one more and then we'll head on. We shouldn't need too much health too early on. We should be getting a lot more ingredients as we go forward. It's fine for me. It keeps dropping, but we good. Okay. At least it keeps coming back. Sorry that YouTube is like this today. My internet's definitely, like, fine, but OBS definitely... I don't know what's going on with it. Okay, this is the discovery. Pondside Cave. Bright bloom seed. A seed that's often found in caves or wells. When struck, it will light... It will take root and bloom, giving off faint light for a small flower. So I have to strike the... Oh. Hey, guys. Let's not waste this anymore. Let's go back to the boulder blade. Wait, no, I need, like, a rock. Oh, God, everything's good. I'm going to use this because it's hilarious. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> key swing and aerodynamic material dropped by a defeated keys. Arrows and thrown weapons fly farther with this item attack. Sick. Mysterious orbs scan their surroundings. Take advantage of their glaring awareness and attach one to an arrow to grant a homing quality to the arrow. They home... How do you say keys? I say it keys. I'm not sure if that's the correct way to say it. But that's how I say it. 
Boom. Boom. More amber. Oh. Are you an enemy? You kind of look like an axolotl for... Oh my god, they are an enemy. Bubbles. Bubbles everywhere. Okay. Okay, bud. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, that was easy. Hello? What the... F was that a blue pea? Bubble gem. A strange crystal left by defeated bubble frogs in caves. Its eerie blue glow may entice you to collect even more. So it's just a collection item? Collect those? Okay. Um. That was a weird interaction. <laughs> Did it turn into a blue pea when it died? Are these like the ancient ancestors of blue peas? That's kind of cool. Flint. Oh, sweet. So that's good for making fire. Rock salt. Crystallized salt from the ancient sea. Commonly used to season meals. We got salt, baby. We can finally season our food. What is this? Giant bright bloom seed. Seed that's found underground. When struck, it will take root and bloom. Radiating a large amount of light. Okay. I mean, this cave isn't too dark. I think we're good without the light. Did we release his soul? Maybe it was like a soul thing. I don't know yet. <laughs> Hopefully the compendium will tell us later on. Lint. Oh, you can break this too. Sick. Ooh, golden one. Lint and a ruby. Rubies contain the power of fire and have fetched a high price since ancient times. Are you telling me? So if I attach that to an arrow, I get a fire arrow as well. It has to be a... Does it have an attack power value on it? Wait. No, you can't see that there. Um. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it didn't do that. Good. I thought I lost that construct horn. Yeah, no, okay. It came back to me. Um. Yeah, it's still only one fuse attack power. Well, that would have been higher. I didn't fire it a ruby. I can just fire a goddamn fire fruit. Yeah, you look. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Took them both out with that swing. Uh, <laughs> Bye, buddies. So many bright blooms. Oh my god. We're going to need those soon, huh? You put it away, you get it back. Okay, good. I was so scared of that. Oh, we finally got the archaic tunic. Old fashioned upper body wear. It's got some holes, but the soft cloth feels good to the touch. Hard to keep it wrinkle free. Baby, we don't need a wrinkle free. That means I get to do this. Hey, what up, everybody? <laughs> Archaic me. Yo, I love that look. Showing off the tattoos and everything. Let's go. <gasps> so glad somebody made me these assets. They're so beautiful. Is this? Oh, there's the exit. And a giant one. The very good look for I know it looks beautiful. The hair, the outfit, it's so good. Hey guys, you my buddies? Oh, I know what that is. I've seen these enough online. Fans. It's my fans. The rats for crossing to the other side are broken. Transportation is on hold indefinitely. This is ordinarily where we send resources across the river. The only silver mining is that the zonai devices are undamaged. Zonai devices. I have a thing for that. I have batteries. Ah, it seems you do not know of the Zonai devices. They are necessities around here. Allow me to explain. This green thing is called a Zonai device. The one you see here is a fan. It can produce wind on demand by striking it. They are self-evidently useful. We have a variety of Zonai devices for multidinal... Multidinal... Multidinous? Multidinous purposes. Using Zonai devices does require energy. An external energy cell will be necessary in your case. Oh, I can delete this message, by the way. But I never unpinned that. Ah, you have one already. That is a relief. But perhaps a refresher explanation is in order. An energy cell stores the energy required to use Zonai devices. Its energy will replenish automatically while Zonai devices are not in use. Its capacity is not unlimited. Use the energy contained within wisely. Otherwise... You may run out at inopportune moments. Pardon the long explanation. It does not change our need for a raft. Zonai devices are extremely useful. Think creatively and find many ways to employ them. Okay, so we only have one fan. And one... Oh, no, we have a bunch of logs. 
Yeah, we can do something with these. Bum, 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 bum. Multiple levels. Yeah, the artist did so good. I mean, like, just the hair and then also the full thing. It's so beautiful. Which I now have Boba. I told you, I have Boba. They've just been hidden. They've just been hidden and now you could finally see the Booba. <laughs> These river rats are seriously damaged. They may be beyond repair. This could present a problem. The rats are broken. The Zona devices will be useless until they're fixed. I already got told about Zona devices. You can create a raft of your own. You're damn well right I can. Oh, hey, buddy. I didn't even see you there. What's up, fairy daddy? <laughs> Whoops. The steward constructs were the first to be built. After that, we crafted others suited to different roles. Culinary constructs, maker constructs. You'll find all sorts of them still active in this place. Some became so skilled within their specialties that they surpassed us. We began to learn from them instead. You should take time out to talk to them. They can teach you many things you might not yet know. Yeah, they've been helping me quite a bit. More than you, who's supposed to be my teacher. Just saying. Arrows. Arrows. Nothing. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, let's explore this area. Oh, there's more fans. And more parts. Okay, good. We're going to be able to make a super raft. Construct takeover. Hell. Ah, oh, god damn it. I scared away the cricket. Well, they're the only things alive now, but surprisingly, they haven't turned evil. They've been fine and chill, even though they've been left to their own devices. Give me the fish. Come here, Finana. Ancient Arawana. A lively fish that hasn't changed much since ancient times. Nutritious mute can meat can restore a bit of health. Huh. This whole area is a biologist's dream. Just unevolved life forms. Ancient Arawana. And also rocks to throw into the water to scare the fish. Yeah, live in fear, fish. <laughs> oh, sky bridge. Okay, this has to be leading me somewhere. I keep pressing up to use my powers. I'm way too used to Breath of the Wild. <laughs> they probably want me to climb up, right? Maybe one here, and then one here. Pull this a bit closer. There we go. Climb this one. Whoop. Go up even. Oh. No, I want to go down. Oh. I screwed up. <laughs> I screwed up. That's on me. Um. Down. Down. Then that's still not enough to come back up. That's okay. We can move this. Down that way. Then this one has to go lower. Bum, bum, bum. Women fear fish, as they should. Fish are scary, man. They're unevolved. They do all kinds of crazy things. Why can't I push this down? This is far down as these go. There we go. Make stepping stones out of them. Perfect. Then I can get back up when I need to. Get as low as possible. Yeah. Oh, God. I didn't even see you. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's the axe. That's not what I want. Oh, God. Oh, that was pure reaction. Oh, it broke already? That's kind of rude. Oh, I'm using the wrong bow, too. Um, Finish it off with this baby. Like the soldier reaper. Okay. Construct bow. I'll drop one of my old bows. I guess. Sure. Used it once, but that's fine. So I charge and construct horn one, and I need to get up there. How? Trees. I've got trees. I can make a climbing thing. Yeah, if I chop down some trees, uh, I can prompt, uh, yeah, I can climb up them if I stack them up. Need to make space for the new stuff. Yeah, they're giving us so much stuff. It's so cool. I'll probably need like three trees. In fact, I might be able to do it with two. Let's find out. 
Did that give me an acorn? The power of bridge. Always. Yeah, acorn. Often found on the ground near trees. Scrolls adore this nut. <laughs> God damn it. So you may have competition while foraging. I'd want to a meal for a nutty seasoning. It's so nutty. Okay. Um, yeah, I should do. Perfect. If I made it longer, I wouldn't have to climb, but I mean, who cares? These nuts, I know, right? They really just gave us the nut out of nowhere. Amber. They're giving us so much amber. And another stem. Oh, it's just the alarm thing. I get so freaked out every time that happens. Is that another item? No, it's just grass. We got nut in the bag? Hell yeah. You're so nutty. I'm not nutty. This game's nutty. There's so many things to do. Ba -ba -ba -ba, so much to see. Can I make that jump? Yes, I can. It's kind of dangerous, but I did it anyway. Yeet. Oh, God. That was close. This should be fine. <laughs> Every time I jump, I'm like, maybe I won't make it. And then I ran out of stamina right at the top. Okay, let's build our uh, boat. What we need now is a boat. But a fan boat. An electric powered boat. It's got to be fantastic. We probably only need three things. And then we can attach three fans to it. It'll be super speedy. Which way do they shoot? Oh, probably. Yeah, they shoot it that way, I'd imagine. Uh, one here. That's a rock. <laughs> I tried to attach a rock. That would not have worked. Fantastic. Oh, the puns are already beginning. Yeah, we're going to make a fantastic boat. It'll be better than the last boat. We get three. I want this supercharged. Every fan they have here belongs to me now. Rock the boat, don't rock the boat, baby. Rock the boat, don't rock the boat, honey. wonder if you could have a sail and fans. It would be a hybrid energy vehicle. That doesn't quite look... You know what? It's fine. This will be fine. This one won't sail away from me, right? It's just logs. It doesn't have a sail. It's drifting left. Okay, that's fine. Um... I don't want to waste the stone axe. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't want to waste the stone axe durability. Um, I guess the rusty broadsword. Oh. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, back to the soldier. Coach. Soldier Reaper. This looks like overkill. Nah, look how slow this is. This is still pretty slow. I need like 12 fans. This is pretty fun. I, can I... Ow, no! And I'm drowning. <laughs> How do I turn them off? I have to... Yeah, so you hit them again and it turns them... I'm not leaving them here. They're mine now. My own. My precious... Your behavior is a threat. No, it's not. I'm, I'm, I'm adorable. I don't know what you mean. Talk to me. Come out of your shell. Fine, screw you. I'm just going to collect these things. A big fan of this build. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. Well, I mean, I've seen a bunch of things that people have created that are ran like randomly wild. Oh, I'm a f it was a p it was a pun. Okay. Wake up, buddy. I wonder if I can put the fans on the bottom and send myself to the sky. Probably too heavy, right? Um. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, are you going in this direction? It's very late to be traveling. This mountain path is especially rugged. You must take your environment into account when traveling. I've developed guidelines for traveling the mountain path. Shall I tell you them? Sure. How do I climb? You teach me how to climb. Very well. Fire is a crucial tool when traveling the mountain path. A fire can be used either to cook or to warm yourself. I know how to start a fire. I can cook? Wait, I know how to cook. Okay, damn it. Warm, recover stamina. Okay. That's all good then. I know about fire. Put down some flint, put down some wood, make a fire. Or can I just like shoot a fire fruit into things nowadays? Guess I'd be able to do that too. The dad jokes are strong as always. Always. This chat is always full of dad jokes. It's lovely to see. 
Oh, and they gave us the cooking pot. Uh, rusty broadsword. I thought I just broke one. No. I just used it once. But that's enough for me. I've got a new one and another restroom. I see you up there. But yeah, I haven't got anything that will actually warm me up, so there's no point in cooking yet. So I'll just bring my boat and go. Bum, bum, ba, dum. Bum, bum, ba. It's not even a mountain path, buddy. There's stairs. I mean... Okay. We're big fans of dad jokes. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. How dare. Oh, God. This does make me move. Ooh! Definitely got to save before I go down there, but... I really thought he'd die in one hit. There's a way down. Let's see if chopping through that just makes me fall to my death for eternity. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Time for a fabulous broat ride. You know it. Okay. Yeet! Yeet! Okay, that wasn't so bad. Dead soldier construct. Oh, a zone I charge. Material used as a power source for constructs and other devices. Use it to recover a small amount of power for a Zonai energy cell. Oh, those are the things I already had. <laughs> but they also have two fuse power, which means they're stronger than anything else I have to fuse with bows. Link lived. Disappointing. It would have been funny if it was just... Ooh. Korok seed? Wait. Don't waste the strong bows. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Hey, you found me. Huh? You're not hostile. But, you see me? I know someone like you could see children of the forest. Wow, if you see Hester, please return this to him. It's his... seed. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places too. So you should keep an eye out while you wonder. Okay, buddy. Whatever you say. I will continue to shoot balloons. <laughs> This, this sounds fun. But yeah, I think it would have been funny if you like broke through that hole and just fell to your death for eternity. <laughs> like that would have been a good learning lesson for hey. Maybe don't like dig holes straight down. Like you learn that in Minecraft. There's a way to climb up there. But my boat though. But my boat. <laughs> I must bring my boat with me. Be more fun if you fell into the abyss. Yeah, it really would. What's that oh, it's just a stick. Hello? Oh, big choo choo. Hello? Nice. I haven't tried to use my shield as a weapon yet. Let's try that. It works! Oh, that's so sick. So you could attach spiky things and other things to, like, shields and just. Sha! Sha! That's so cool. What is that thing? It looks like they built that upside down as well. Oh, and there's rails here? There's so much to do. Damn this shield. I know, it's badass. I'm so glad somebody said try attaching it to... I'd forgotten you could attach things to shield up till that point. I was just making swords. And I was like, yeah, why not? Just try it. Let's see what happens. Oh, hello, evil cave. I feel like there's going to be enemies here. I can't see. Oh, minecarts? My boat moves on. Okay, so we've got three fans we can attach on more fans. <gasps> so many fans. We're going to move so fast on these minecarts. I need to stop bringing things with me. Oh, there's enemies. Okay, I know exactly what to do with this boat then. <laughs> You're now a weapon. Hey, buddies. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, my God. That did so much damage. Well played. Well played. I didn't realize that was what he was doing when he charges that up. God. But he was like trying to create a fuse weapon. Oh, he's got one of those fan weapons. Um, what weapon should I use on you? Oh, the soldier reaper. Imagination? Hell yeah. 
We're going to use our fullest imagination in this game. Ford Guster. Well, that sounds badass. We're your fan club boo. Is this what this is? The fans are actually you guys getting me through this game. That works for me. <laughs> Let's drop yet another normal bow for a construct bow. Ford Guster. I want it. It makes wind. God, I need more space already. This game is incredible. Let's let's wear this out on these boxes and then I'll throw it away. We've already got another axe and we've got a two-handed axe, so we're doing good. Boop. So many arrows. Oh my god. I'm almost up to a hundred. You really are leaning it with the arrows. Oh, poor. oh fan and club. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. If yeah, if you combine a fan and a club, you could create a fan club. Oh, damn it. Okay. Goodbye, Axe. You've served me well. Yay! Lord Guster. So does that... Yeah. So now even without fans, I'd be able to, like, power a boat. Well, I mean, like, make a boat move, at least. Another apple. Cool. Come on, boat. May not eat you anymore, but I need your fans. Did I open that treasure chest? I think I did. Yeah, I did. Oh, crazy. Should have sent it to the... <laughs> it's true. Should have just dropped it and seen what happened. Okay. So you can lift up carts. Does that mean? I keep pressing the wrong thing for the powers. So used to... You can! Okay, I know what I'm doing. Can you really make a minecart sword? <laughs> That's fucking insane. <laughs> I mean, you can probably make a... Oh, good, there's an extra one over there. Can you make a minecart shield? Does that just give you, like, extra strength? Um... <laughs> oh my god. Look, oh god, I look so dumb. I am the minecart warrior. People think I don't know how to minecart. Wait. Does that mean I can grind on rails? <laughs> this is the greatest game of all. I don't even need the fans. I don't even need the fucking fans. I'm gonna, because I want to be super powered. I'm gonna attach like 12 fans to this bitch. Um. Stop. Ah, oh, so used to the other button controls. Game of the year. Yeah, this is crazy. Skating unlocked. Yeah, we're playing Tony Hawk now. We're done with Zelda. How do I? Oh, right. It goes between the cards. <laughs> Unlike my shield surfing ability. Um, boop, 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 boop. Wrong way. There we go. Come here, you. So if I put them all in a line... It should power it up, right? Like, it should be supercharged. The possibilities, I know. God, now we can... So all those, like, m rails we've seen in the distance, we can just shield surf them. That's crazy. I don't like the reverse controls. They confuse me. <laughs> uh, we're going to have six fans on this baby. It's going to drain our battery so quickly, too. <laughs> okay, I'm getting used to the reverse controls. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. Okay, boat. You've served me well, but I need those. Well, well. Um, sure, that'll do. We're going to be zooming? Yeah, we are. I'm fine with that. Anyone who likes things to be in perfect positions is going to get really annoyed with me because I'm fine with that sticking off to the side. In fact, you know what? We're going to expand it. I'm going to stick one here, too. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> and then one more on the back. Oh, my goddess. Oh, wait for it. Wait. Let's make this one really annoying. Let's make this one on top of all of them. Okay, now we're going to zoom. Okay, what should I hit this with? Um, 
I guess the axe is nice and stable. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not even that fast. Uh-oh. This is dark as fuck. Um... I'm severely disappointed. <laughs> but you know what? I wanted to go collect those bright broom sleeves. I can just pick it up and take it to the other side. It's okay. Oh god, it's so dark in here. That's wild. I couldn't even see anything. But I'll collect my bright blooms and then I'll come back in and lift it over. <laughs> that was short. I know. It finally started to pick up speed and then it just crashed. But yeah, I guess that's why they're giving us so many bright blooms because it's so crazy dark in here. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's so cool. That's honestly pretty much as fast as this thing that I've built. It took me ages to build. <laughs> oh, this is what they look like when they're dropped. He overestimated his fans. Yeah, my fans, maybe they don't, you know, they definitely stack. Um... This cave is especially dark. You'll need a light in order to proceed to the mining site ahead. Do you have any bright bloom seeds? Yes, I do. What a relief. You would not otherwise be able to see anything as you proceed. Bright bloom seeds grow primarily in caves. There was a time once when they grew here as well. The cave has been mostly picked clean of them. That's because it is especially dark. The seeds were often necessarily... Necessarily? Necessary. My associates often forget to bring bright bloom seeds. I am posted here to provide a reminder. Use them to light your way if you are proceeding ahead. Watch your step. Okay, so if I strike it, it gives me more light, right? No. This is one that's already lit up. Is there a tra There is. Yeah, there is a minecart trail here. Let me bring this with me then. Oh no. I made it too big. There we go. Okay, um, this is okay. Hey, you hide, buddy. It's okay. There we go. Does this not count as a minecart thing? What I'm going to do is... So I need to... Patch a bright bloom. Oh, sick. But then my question is, can I attach it to the car? No. What about to the fan? Oh, that makes the fan move. Oh, God. Where are we going? Where are we going? Okay. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> so you can attach them to things and then just carry them around or make them move around. Then you have a light source that moves with you. Why doesn't this fit on... Man... Stupid old broken minecart. I wanted to bring that with me. I'm going to anyway. But it's making it hard. Zoanite. The panic in your voice. I didn't realize an arrow made them work as well. That freaked me the hell out. An unusual mineral that has many purposes. Ancients extracted energy from it and refined it into the crafting of weapons of armor. Still one fuse attack power though. So many weak... Ooh, they count as a special resource. They counted at the top right. Interesting. So yeah, this isn't... Yeah, these rails are destroyed. But if I line it up, should be fine. <laughs> well, you know what? At least I have light. This is too many fans. It drains my battery like instantly. But you know what? Instant light, buddy. That's sick. You only need one bite, bright bloom for like an entire cave. Karma of not stacking the fans in the middle. <laughs> yeah, they go all over the place now. Another zone I charge. Oh, so I can choose that to like recover my battery early if I really wanted. Oh, and my boulder's about to break already. What is that noise? Damn. Well, I can make my own boulder weapon. We have boulder weapon at home. There we go. <laughs> no! Okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. 
I? Oh, so it, the weight of me actually like becomes a problem for that too. Because it worked longer without me in the cart. Interesting. Frog. Oh, is that a frog? I don't see a frog. It was these guys. Hey, buddies. Unless. Yeah, I guess it was these guys making that noise. Behind you. Oh. One minute, I'll go check. Well, he glows, so being in the darkness will probably be better if it is a glowy frog. Hmm. Nah, no frog. Oh, oh, okay. Hey, buddy. Don't run away. I just want to put... Buddy. There you go. <laughs> done? He done. They do turn into blue peas. How did we miss that? <laughs> I don't know. He didn't want to fight like the last one. The last one was like... Ooh. Sick! I can just skate anywhere. This isn't even like shield set. This is like... I've created... Oh, and there's more here. I could create another one for when this one breaks. Um, um, um. Yes, please. I'm having nothing but minecart shields for the rest of my life. We have a skateboard. Yeah, essentially. This is badass. Wonder how quickly it will break down, though. This cave previously had ample resources, but is gradually yielding yes and less. That's how resources work, but That is why I require support, but my requests have so far gone unanswered. I must therefore continue to mine without resting. God, you sound like Pomu and Uki. Uh, rock hammer. Let's smash some of these for you. Your behavior is a threat. No, I'm just stealing your resources. Don't worry about it. I'm not threatening you. I'm just taking your shit. There we go. The shade. That's not shade. It's just saying they like Minecraft. Oh, now we're going to need a lot of fans. Because now we need the power to go forward against gravity. I'm going to try the shield surfer, actually. I'm going to see how far I can get. But I'm imagining I'm going to need fans to push forward through that. <laughs> okay, colonizer. <laughs> Look, man, I need the resources. The Earth doesn't need them. I do. This is a minecart station. Excavated resources can be transported from here. Could it be that you've forgotten to bring Zonai capsules? The heck's a Zonai capsule? You have forgotten yours. Or perhaps you may not even know what I mean. Zonai capsules, pardon me, are a convenient means of carrying portable Zonai devices. It is unfortunate that you seem to have none. I will lend you a few surveyors. So you can just carry... That's sick. Zona device that produces wind. Yeah, it's like any. You can just drop those around so you can carry fans around with you. You don't have to just find them in the wild. That's sick. Ones I gave you were fan types. You can deploy them at any time. They will generate wind when struck. Zona devices are useful and come in many varieties. I always carry several with me for any occasion. Any neglect to keep a healthy supply on hand. I keep watch for such individuals. The spares I gave you were the last ones I carried. Take care not to forget again. Remember that a device cannot be put back in its capsule. Think carefully before deploying one from your pouch. Oh. So it's not like a resource where I can reseal them back in. You get like a certain type and you can use the certain type. He gave me his last three? That's so nice. How, how do I... How do I use them? Oh, they're in the wheel. Okay. Do I have to shoot them out with an arrow? Interesting. I mean, I've got enough fans. Now that I think about it, I'm going to be fine. Um, but it was nice of him to give me three. Um, mm? Apologies for not noticing you. I was focused on processing zoanite. Zoanite? I got some of that. Oh, are you unfamiliar with it? This is the zoanite I mentioned. It is a unique material that can be mined far beneath the land below. There are trace deposits of it on this island as well. But they are limited to this cave. 
our society flourished by processing this substance into other materials. Processing? What did you did you turn it in? I guess yeah, all of that technology. That makes sense. Zonite is processed by smelting it in a furnace. It is thereby converted into materials with useful properties. A few such materials will be ready for your review shortly. Wait one moment. Hmm. Okay, you processing me something? Thank you for your patience. I will now explain what sorts of materials the ore can be processed into. Why did he make me wait a moment? Oh, he turned all these things on. Okay. Zonite technology is typically powered by zonite charges. These occasionally solidify into a form known as crystallized charges. Converting zonite into other useful materials in this way is called processing. What does zonite charges? They just recharge my battery, right? Zonite charges are what power zonite devices and constructs. A charge can be consumed to replenish your energy cell. Um, what are crystallized then? Solidified form of zonite charges. You mainly use them as a raw material in the construction of energy cells. Please visit any time you require processed materials. Yeah, I want these. They turn into energy. Oh, I trade zonite for them? Or I trade zonite for these. Okay. Gimme. How many do you require? I'll take them all. How many do you have? Wait. One, two, three, four, five times two, ten. As ten, I'd need thirty. Ooh, that's a lot. Um. Um. I'll, um uh, let me mine the rest of this cave first. I kind of want all of these things. I'm imagining I can buy all of these things, but I'll be careful. And fuel my mind. True. <laughs> Precise charges will upgrade your batteries. Yeah, that's what I was getting. He said, like, you can use them to create energy cells. So I'm guessing he can also turn them into energy cells and make my batteries longer, which is cool. Which I'll need, because I need to remove some of these fans. I'm going to remove, like, the final three. <laughs> uh, that's a bit too many fans. Okay. Yeah, give me all of these. And then we'll see if he can trade them for the other things. And here will cost you 30 pieces. It's a deal! Thank you. I'll process the zonite later. The zoning materials will be available to you once the processing is complete. Oh, so you can come back to trade for more once he's turned them into other things. Processing. Okay. But he doesn't make the batteries. Somebody else is going to make the batteries. Blah, 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 blah. Do I want zonite charges? I mean... How many are there? One, two, three, four, five. So ten... I still have six zonite. Yeah, I'll take them all. Fuck it. It seems like that's all you use actual raw zonite for anyway, so... I'll just take everything he has. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum. Nope. I'm pressing the wrong buttons all the time. Why did they make that different in Breath of the Wild? Okay, let's remove this one. That should... Nope. Remove this one. Good, that removes both of those. Let's try with four fans. All in a row. Then I've still got my bright broom flower attached as well. That should be enough. Um, ba -bum -bum. Bum -ba -bum. First try sealed surfing. Shield surfing even. See how that goes. Yeah, I figured. Gravity's... Oh, God! Oh, my life. Okay. <laughs> that gave me so much anxiety. <laughs> I thought he'd start to slide backwards. I did not think he would just suddenly freeze in the middle of everything. <laughs> okay. Let's go! Come on, my fan club. Take me to the heavens. <sighs> yeah, this is actually much nicer on my battery. I genuinely think... Having the ones at, like, different angles was doing us bad. He skateboarded his way out. I did my best. <laughs> the panicked gasp. Yeah, that was terrifying. Oh, hey, Raru. Let me just turn off my machine. Make sure it doesn't slide away. What are you doing, buddy? Don't give me a heart attack, folk, or I don't know what will. That scared the shit out of me more than it scared the shit out of anyone else. Believe me, I was terrified. <laughs> the time bell that sounds from the Temple of Time rings at a set time each morning and evening. 
Along with the constructs, we woke to the sound of the bell when we heard it in the evening. We knew it was time to rest. It also played its part in our traditional ceremonies. In a way, it was this place's beating heart. The sight of the temple and the sound of its bell stirred fond memories in me. Aww. I was getting all emotional thinking about being human. The hair looks so fluffy. Yeah, it does. Look at this. I feel like I'm sleeping on a cloud. <laughs> Mushy mushrooms. What the hell? What are you? Hello, buddy. You got a capsule machine? Oh, Zoanite capsules? Yeah. Okay, sick. Give me them. Device dispenser operation confirmed. On track to meet today's Zanai capsule production target. Oh, did you want to use the device dispenser? I've nearly met my target. You're welcome to use it. Yes, this is a device dispenser. It produces Zonai capsules by converting certain resources. The resources it accepts are things such as construct holds and Zonai charges. You can process resources that you hold by dropping them into the receptacle. It is similar to using a cooking pot. Yes, please do. I mean, those are what we already heard about. Yeah, okay. The device cannot be put back in this capsule. They are also plentiful. You can extract many Zonai capsules from a single dispenser. There's no harm in converting your spare resources into Zonai capsules. It ensures you'll always have a few. I'll continue my maintenance checks. This dispenser is available for use. Okay, sick. So yeah, it's literally gotcha. First, taking these out. Maybe these will give me more items. Just arrows. I kind of thought they were going to give me construct horns to like put more into here. Just in case I'd run out. But okay. Um, What have I... He said charges. That's the circle. Yeah. Zone I charge. Five? Gambling time, baby! That's what I'm talking about! Aw. Really do be like a capsule machine. That's a lot. I did not expect that. Flame emitter. <laughs> a Zonai device that shoots fire. It's thought to have been originally used as protection from monsters. Portable pot. A Zonai device for cooking food. Oh, I can just cook food anywhere now. This is sick. Okay. Fan, fan. Portable pot, fan, fan. Portable pot. Oh, is that all you get out of this one? That's fine. I'll, I'll do one more. Put in. Bum, 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 bum. Skip. <laughs> so yeah, this is fans, portable pots, and flame emitters. They don't want to give me any of the cool stuff yet. Well, that's okay. I take what I can get. And we move on. Whoop. So many arrows and another fan. Do I need... No, four fans is enough. I learned my lesson. I don't have a strong enough charge yet. Five pull. Let's go. Portable bottle, one time use food chain. I think they're all what? Well, not the. F Wait. I see it. Oh. Hey, buddy, come on out. What you doing over there? I need to reach my friend. Where is he? Is he across the rails? Nah, I don't see any smoke. Is he up? You gonna tell me? Ah, uh, my friend and I got separated. Yeah, <laughs> now that's the voice. There we go. My friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. Oh, that's the smoke. That's a lot of smoke. I thought those were clouds. I'm so tired, though. I can't move. I got you, fam. Don't even worry about it. Where am I going to stick you is the bigger question. You know what? You can ride in the front with me. I won't be a dick to you. Probably. I could be a dick to you. I have so many ways I can torture. Ooh. Oh, no, I have to do you first. I'll do you, then I'll come back and explore. I need to reach my friend. Uh-uh. He's so cute. To the hole, like a... Oh, you're right. I should make him the maiden head. Hold up. I'm going to fix that. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> when you're right, you're right. Come on, Minecraft. Oh, God. Minecraft sword. We're going, buddy. I'm taking you home. Ooh. 
Okay, buddy. Surely he won't mind that you're attached to him. Oh, wait, that may make my minecart disappear. Here you go, bud. Boop. There's my friend. Here, I'll tuck you right in there. Be nice and comfy. Thanks for bringing my friend. Here's something for you. Thank you. Hi. I love how they don't even say to give them to Zet Hestu anymore. They're just like, hey, here, have some seeds. I mean, the single one does, but the friendly ones are like, nah, fuck Hestu. Yeah, you can have my seed. Is that because the pair of them can produce more seed? One of them by themselves doesn't have any other seed. But with two of them... A dirty thought has entered my mind. <laughs> and another Zoe Knight. Perfect. Oh god, please. Um, I mean... They basically said it. That's, that's the game. That's not me. Ooh, Amber. Didn't expect that to see coming out. Ah, uh, slice. Slice. So many arrows. Have I got hooks? More minecarts. I've got all my... Yeah. Got my minecarts filled up. Every freaking time. We have to find the worst possible answer. Ah. So this is going to take me up higher. Okay, okay. So I need all my fans from that, but I need to attach a hook to my mine. Okay, perfect. Add a hook to the minecart. I'm too far up. This has a really short range. I'd be classified as... <laughs> no, no, it wouldn't. I don't know what you mean. Do, 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 do. There we go. Um, For balance, I should put it at the back because that's a lot of battery. Okay, stick, stuck it to the middle anyway. I love how this bright bloom seed has just been coming with us this entire time too. Down we go. Oh, up we go. Um. No, not on that side. Crap. That side's broken. Yeah. I can't put it on the other one. Hmm. I can turn the hook around. I can turn. I, yeah. I just turned the hook the wrong way. There we go. <laughs> but you're so right and I hate it. I mean. <laughs> yeah, I can't really be wrong. Two of those adorable little creatures could make as much seed as they like. Okay. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Let's put him away. Let's put the comfy Korok away. Come on. Link. You're embarrassing me, Link. There we go. Let's fly. That actually worked. I thought they were going to make me use a board. I'm not going to lie. I thought they were going to be like, the minecart is too heavy. Nice try, though. Yeah, you turn off. Don't crush me. Oh, oh was that? Dragon. Oh. Oh, it doesn't stay with it. It moves away. Oh, that's unfortunate. Just get rid of that red mark. It's cool to see the dragons around, though. I guess they're just like, yo, what the fuck up with the floating islands? This is kind of random. Dragon these nuts. How dare. <laughs> Tree branch. Zonite. Oh, yeah. Zonite charge. Bum, 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 bum. Just around here, there's a chest over there, so yeah. Start moving that way. Oh god, the lag again. The dropped frames. It's doing its best. I could take the hook off, I guess, but I might need it again. I'll leave it for now. Random XD almost down. <laughs> I didn't go that far. Another zone I charge. Another zone I charge. Let's go. Charge chest. Oh, he doesn't even... He just, like, touches him. Another portable pot. Hmm. Oh, this way... Oh, apples. I wonder where I'm... Like, the thing is so close to me. Yeah, that's another apple up there. I'm here. Here we go. Okay. Big old boss enemy. That doesn't look fun. I mean, it looks fun, but not survivable. <laughs> so this is the island we need to get to. Oh, wait. That's the same one with the gacha. 
Ah, okay. So now we're going up to the wintry air. Okay, it just leads back to here. That's smart. That's smart. God, I wish I had my sailcloth. Down we go. Wonder if those can break. Is that a giant hole? No, it's water. Fantastic. Okay, where's my fish? Inanna. Where'd she go? Oh god, she escaped me. Hmm. Okay, they don't despawn. Come here, little fish. Get in my belly. There we go. That it? One fish? I wonder if you can grab fish. I need to try that next time I see a fish rejected by fish. That's okay. You definitely can't grab crickets. Now I know that. I want to try this boss enemy. I feel like it's got to be here to teach me I'm going to get my ass kicked by them. It looks like a guardian, but... We're going to do our best. It won't despawn my minecart, right? I've been building that thing for years. Is this far enough? Yeah. Okay, let's save here. We're going to get our asses handed to us. Oh. Um. Maybe a bit further. Well. Um. Yeet! Oh, God. I'm fine. I'm fine. I lived, bitch. I lived. Okay. Only one way to start this. Maybe with a zone I charge. No. Those are worth things. Um. Um. I do have 28, but they're worth gotcha. None. We'll just try it with normal arrow. Oh, that did pretty big damage, actually. Oh, why is he... He became a man. That's kind of terrifying. Okay, I'm going to use my big weapon on this ship. That looks like a weak spot. Okay. Keep hitting it. Oh, shit. Too late. Okay, this isn't as bad as I thought it was. Hmm. What the fuck? What is he making? Oh! Don't get crushed by it. There we go. This thing's cool. That was extra damage. Let's go with this one. Oh. One more hit should do it, actually. How do I... Oh, God. There we go. Attack on Minecraft. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. I wasn't so bad. I really... Ooh. What are you? Portable pot, portable pot, a bunch of zone eye charges. And a spinny. Can I? Oh, that's that's a fusion. Um. I don't have anything I can fuse. Oh. What's something that's strong? Wood gun, no. Rock hammer? I guess I'll break apart the rock hammer? I can do that in the weapons menu, it said. Oh, if only I had another stick around here. Oh, okay, okay. I'll just have to uh, break apart the rock hammer. And then fuse that. Oh, sorry. Um. <laughs> 14 down. Oh. That. I'm not going to say what I'm thinking about that. That does not look pleasant, is what I will say. <laughs> that. Oh, some enemy is going to really not enjoy that. <laughs> don't. Don't say it. Yeah, no. Nah. I'll, just, I'll just shut up. I, I'm glad I've got a powerful weapon. That's what matters. <laughs> Am I even able to get back? These are two pretty big jumps. Okay, no, that wasn't so bad. Don't you dare. Fair. Fair. Okay, so we're going this way, but I'm going to grow a cave. I'm also going to grab my minecart. Now with added hook. 
And it can light up the cave. Because it's got a bright bloom. Your behavior. No, it's not. I didn't drop it on you. A discovery. <gasps> Finally, spicy peppers. I need those. Pepper is exploding with spice. Cook it with uh, cook with it to create dishes that will raise your body temperature and help you withstand the cold. It's just a fancy glow stick. Yeah. Look at it. It glow green. It look pretty. <laughs> hey, buddy. You okay? You don't want to talk to me right now. That's okay. Oh, that's a hidden hole too. Uh, rock hammer, please. Oh, boulder. Boulder will do. Hello? It's going to be a frog. Yeah! Okay, I'm getting used to that. Minecart sword. So I created that abomination for no reason, so we'll slowly break down our Minecraft sword. Oh, Boo Boo! Yeah, it was a... We did see a little bloopy. Definitely a bloopy. God, they just rain you with bright blooms. I suppose if I'd had to actually be shooting them everywhere. I'd have a lot. Like, another ruby. Let's go. I'm going to be so rich. But yeah, I've only really used one because I just attached it to my minecart. <laughs> Monstrosity. <laughs> Not booby. Blooby. Don't be silly. Now you ready to talk to me? Oh, yep. Yeah. Excuse me. The snowy mountain above us is extremely cold. Unprepared travelers will swiftly lose vitality and may even die. Are you fortified against the cold? Fortified how? I got some spicy peppers. I can cook them. Insufficient preparation can lead to death in harsh environments. My advice can avert this. Please listen carefully. The primary safeguards used by our creators were meals that warmed them. These meals were typically prepared using ingredients with warm-sounding names. Any such ingredients will suffice. Some also wore thick clothes or warmed themselves by a fire. These solutions were effective, but less accessible. Be mindful of your ingredients when cooking. My understanding is that only one cooking effect can apply per meal. You must take care not to eat something with a different effect afterward. The chill will set in again sooner than you expect. Okay. I use my three things, make a... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll make some warming food. Go up the mountain now. He is a Nakey we find. Yeah! But I think it's got to be, like, more hard once we get up there. Cold resistance for seven minutes. That's all I need, baby. Um, while I'm here, did I get anything else interesting? I got salt. Nah, like, we've got enough healing items for now. I'm surprised we managed to take off that boss so quickly. Also... There's something up there. Can I climb up there, though, or will I run out of stamina? We'll find out. Oh, I can't. Oh, don't look up Link's skirt. Um, kilt. We'll call it kilt. Don't look up Link's kilt. <laughs> Your little meat body will become a popsicle up there. That'd be a far nicer way to say it. I forgot just coming in. Wow, that asset looks great on you. Thank you, Nina. That's so sweet of you. I love this asset so much. I I forgot that I, the, the 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 description for this video broke, so I oh hey guys um I need to add like the references to the people who created the assets in the description after like probably while I'm doing my Zatsudan I'll add them so everybody can see them but yeah we've got that and we've got a little baby Korok a little baby sheep pretending to be a Korok a comfy Korok if you will where does this take me oh is this the continuation to the way I was going. Yeah, it was just a faster way. Okay, but I'm going to bring my minecart. <laughs> my minecart with me. It's so powerful. I mean, oh. Is this... Are these ledges here to stop me? No, they're fine. It's still good. It's still good. It's still good. It's still good. It's still... It's still good. Just sit there. Wait for me. There you go. Ah, no, 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 no. Okay. Link and Finn's Minecraft more at 11. We're going far beyond Minecraft at this point. Action in this game is way too good. Uh-oh. It's getting tighter. Why won't you let me grab? Okay. Oh, no. There we go. 
<laughs> Just jam it in there. Yeah, it's about to be cold. Will seven minutes be enough? How far do we have to go? No, we have to go quite far. I'm going to grab these spicy peppers and then cook all six of them. Yeah, yeah, I know. Cold as shit. Don't worry about it. I'll be right back, minecart. You better not disappear. I'm not going far. This is so cool. Oh, I love it. We literally have a skateboard. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Cook. Starting to believe he's got to be bringing the vehicle to the end of the game. I do think it's going to break when we go into a shrine. I, if it actually manages... Ooh, 12 minutes. Yeah, that's enough. I won't even cook the final one. 7 plus 12. That'll be enough to explore the whole icy region. Um, but yeah. I, I don't get the feeling that they'll like have the resource. In fact, it may have disappeared by the time I get back to it. Oh, I'm out of stamina. I forgot stamina was a thing. Um, but yeah. I feel like once you go into a shrine, it will despawn anything you've created because... That's just too much data for something to try and remember while you've loaded a completely different area. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey there, Fuchan. I mean, it says hell there, but I know what you mean. <laughs> hey there. Hope you're having a good day. Welcome to the stream. Okay, good. It stayed for now. And uh, let's eat our foods. Um, start with a seven minute one. Seven minute one may actually get us as far as we need to go. We go in that direction. Okay. Let's begin. Hey, Rauru. Oh, hey, buddy. Want to fight? I've got a Minecraft sword. Fight choo choo jelly. It's cool to the touch and squeezing it seems to relieve stress. If struck, it will explode in cold mist. Which begs the question. Can I use a white choo choo jelly attached to a bow to create an ice arrow? Hey, Daudu. You thinking about life again, which you don't have anymore? You're still kind of around, though. The soldier constructs and captain constructs are only doing their duty to protect the Garden of Time. At the time, it was sadly necessary to protect our land from invaders. I'm terribly sorry for any threat they pose to you now. Yeah, considering so many of them are so nice, they should probably, like, you know, defend themselves rather than just choosing to attack me. I feel like there's got to be something on top of the mountain. It's just, like, it's just... Video game sense, right? More spicy peppers. And there's got to be a Korok seed or something up here. Bum, ba -dum, bum. Bum, ba -dum. I don't know why India... Aha! What is that? A seed? Hello? Oh, I need to grab it. Or do I need to shoot it? I think I need to... Something A there. Something with A pops up. I think I need to grab it. Where does it go? Sorry. Okay, yeah. You just need to press A on it. Yeah, you found me. Oh, yeah. I can put you away now. <laughs> Got another Korok seed. Bye -bye. Okay. That was interesting. <laughs> Onward we... Oh, God. The lag almost killed me. Oh, God. That's how you do those? I guess. I only figured it out because it said press A on it. At first, I was like, maybe I have to shoot it while it's falling. But yeah, you have to like chase it. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> Oh, come here. Oh, God, I missed. Okay. Fight me. Damn it. Okay. I think I have space for a stick. Yeah, I do. Oh, and these are soldier construct ones. Nice. Okay. People are very strange these days, are they? What are people up to? Just keep making the special seeds. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we need seeds. That's fine. I feel like I could go through here. Maybe. Nah. It looked like it. I was wrong. Maybe I should finally abandon the minecart. 
I'm starting to think it isn't a good idea to carry it around. For one thing, I just missed a bird. Yeah, it slows me down. I think it's finally time to give up on it. Hey, buddy. Okay, can't do that. Yeah, you fight these guys. I missed. I wanted to freeze him. Oh, that's a lot of fire. That hits really hard. Holy shit. I should have healed. That quickly? Two hits. God damn. Fire death? Yeah, first death. How the hell did you die? Somehow that fire does more than one and a half hearts. Crazy. Meanwhile, I was just playing with that guy. Oh, hey, buddy. Um, don't do the thing. Okay, so he had a flame construct and he fused it to his weapon. And now he's going to try to fire me. And he destroyed the choo-choos. Oh, not the fire. Put it away, sir. Jeez. Oh, he turned it into fire choo-choo jelly. Look at what you did. I wanted ice choo-choo. Let's see if these do work as fire arrows. If these work as fire arrows, that means the ice ones work as ice arrows, too. They do! Sick. Okay, let's finish this guy. He hits hard, but he doesn't take it very well. Minecart sword is finally damaged. Good. Now I get a flame a minute club? <laughs> Oh, he uses battery, too. That's kind of wild. And we know for a fact it does a lot of damage because it destroyed me. <laughs> Should I climb that mountain? There's probably going to be another thing up top of it. Yeah, let's go climb that mountain. We got time. We made a lot of foods. Got a lot of cold resistance. Let's just see what's up here. Oh. Hey, buddy. I do not want to use this on you. That would not end well. Anybody. Come on, do your little jumps. You do jump. Bah. Oh, no. That shit's scary. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep. I knew that was coming. Remember that shit from Breath of the Wild. Okay, come here. Good boy. Flamethrower, literally. Yeah, it's a cute little flamethrower, too. You just do a little slap. Tree branch. What else we got up here? Nothing? Okay, now I feel like an idiot. My game senses were off. Okay, onward we go. Oh, I'm so sick. Oh, my God. Goodbye? Yep, goodbye. <laughs> that was just, you know, scary moment. Hey! Just, just drop to the ground. You know, I'm surprised these guys don't do more. Da Is that a bomb flower? I'm sorry. Bomb flowers are back, baby. Means I have bomb arrows already. That's crazy. Stop jumping around, man. There we go. Oh, he died already. Did not do well against that guy. <laughs> a bomb flower? Yeah, bomb flowers were in Ocarina of Time. I was like, yo, that's a bomb on the ground. Oh, it's a flower. Let's go. So now we have big explosives. Arrows. What is this craziness? There's something hidden up there. I see it glowing. God, I'm so scared without my sailcloth. Is it just mushrooms? It's just mushrooms. <laughs> oh, God. I'm up here in the dangerous area for no reason. Link, 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 fall gently. There we go. Good. <sighs> Ogre has nukes. Yeah, for some reason they gave me the codes. Not very smart of them. And I'll prove to them why. Down we go. Oh, God. Don't like that area. <laughs> that area was concerning. Oh my god! And there's something over here too. There's so much to explore. Palm flower. 
Damn, three more marrows. This tutorial area is amazing. They're really teaching you everything you need to know. Risking our lives for that fungus. <laughs> I didn't know it was just a mushroom. I just saw something sparkling. I thought it would be something better. There's a ledge over there. But it doesn't look like anything interesting is over there. Okay, there's definitely a monster above me. <laughs> That's going to be fun. Is that just a bright bulb? Yeah, it's just a bright bulb. I wonder if the bomb flowers grow back too. The collector in him one? Yeah, pretty much. So there's an enemy up here somewhere. Mm, this one. Oh, the bomb flower. What the frick? What do you want? You're nothing. I have to like counter you, don't I? Come at me. Oh, not with that shield. Oh. That was simpler than I imagined. I thought I'd have to like draw you out somehow. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I don't like that thing. That worm kind of creep. That's a like like. Oh shit. Strange found surround stone. He could have eaten me then. I should not have stepped that close to him. I'm such an idiot. A strange round stone from a like like made of crystallized inner fluids. Ugh. It's a good ingredient for elixirs. Okay, that's good to know. It had a chest in it at least. Like likes? Yeah, like likes are back. Which means I should not have gotten that close to it. It could have just swallowed me whole. Oh, I was just inviting the vor. Now I know. Stay away from those things. Yeah, I'm climbing. This looks like a secret way. I don't like like them. Aw, I like like them. I'm glad they're giving so many throwbacks to things. Ooh, more mushrooms. More fungi. More bomb flyer. Like likes are dangerous, I assume. Yeah, they're in like a lot of the other Zelda games. What they do is they like take a... They just swallow you up into their like worm-like body. Oh god. Yeah, let's climb down. Gently, Link. Gently. <laughs> they swallow you into their worm-like body and then they'll steal whatever you're carrying as well. Like they were... Okay, let's see. Notoriously bad because they would like eat your shield and then you'd have to go buy a new shield. So if he had grabbed me, he probably would have just stolen one of my weapons. Let's try to avoid getting too close to them in the future. <laughs> Not fun. Not fun. It was like there's so many secrets around me in here. Oh, oh. Add insult to injury when they steal? Yeah. Oh, there's another one. Okay, come at me. I wonder if that's why it gave me bombs. Maybe they're strong against the like-likes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. No, it did about the same. It wasn't really particularly spectacular. Um, let's thick stick it. Oh, you bitch. Maybe waste so much stamina. So yeah, that was a waste of a bomb arrow. God. Now that I know this thing is a like like, it's way more terrifying. <laughs> um. I guess the board guster. You done? Okay, they done. Smack the... Yeah, got to take it out. Another like-like stone. Ooh, arrows. Bum, bum, bum. Opal. Has the power of water. Does water do extra damage to enemies? Maybe, maybe like fire enemies that will be able to like put out the fire. Flame emitter. Hell yeah. I haven't actually used any of those yet, but it's nice to have the option. Some more bright bloom seeds. Okay, we out of the cave. Am I going to freeze again? Shit. <laughs> yes, I... Oh, but we're right next to the thing. Uh, let's just eat our other recipe. There we go. It's 12 minutes, so we're good. The shrine's like right above us. They look like... What are chitterlings? I've never heard of those before. Had a monster from another game. 
wonder if I can just... <laughs> Fuzero da! That's not even what I meant about like making a weapon that could Fuzero da the other day. That's cute. Oh shit, can I not hit them? Fuck. No, yeah, this just doesn't do damage. They're too weak. They're too light. They just get blown away. There we go. Now that I know that these all create ice arrows, that makes them way more interesting to kill. Intestines? Ah, intestines makes sense. Okay, so I need to get up there. Let's just climb to it. Probably missed some things down here, but we can come back down and explore later. Ooh, shiny rock wall. It's cool. Oh! There are ice walls now. That's genius. Okay, so I probably need to get up there. Or I can just build a thing up to there. I'll go up here first. It feels like it wants me to go up here. Uh, yeah, let's create a bridge. Um, the dish made of pig intestines. Oh, that's what it is. I saw intestines and I was like, they do kind of look like intestines. That makes sense. Never heard of that one before. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, that's two logs. I'm going to need like two more logs. Where's my axe? Bum, 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 bum. What are these? He ranch. There we go. That should do. That should get us where we need to go. Attach this to hit. I don't like that. That's too off center. I'm gonna have to climb this thing. Is that a hatch? I can't move that. God, this is a mess. This is such a mess. But it works. It does what it has to. Yep, it does what it has to. Can I really not do anything? I feel like I can go into this. Nah, you can't cut through that. Weird. Up we go. <laughs> okay, this is going to take some trial and error. There we go. Perfect. If it works, it works. Exactly. Work smart, not old oh, Jesus. There's two of them this time. No, don't throw that at me. Ah, uh, no, 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 bad, bad, bad rock. Oh God. Oh shit. Why do you guys hit so hard? These are like the beginning enemies and they kick my ass. Oh God. Kill this thing fast sick of you. Yeah, board guster. Nope, nope. Oh, God. Just gonna heal on up real quick. Jesus. Oh, he got a flame emitter. Ah! No. <laughs> you know what? Maybe it's time to just take out enemies with arrows. Maybe it's time to be a little bitch. Nope, don't want to do that anymore. Oh, God! That hit so hard! You suck, dude, you suck. Oh, God. This weapon sucks, too. Just finish him with this. Jesus. Should have really used my flame emitter cub. Yeah, bomb arrow is what I was going to do, but then he got too close. Wait, the other one didn't die? Can I collect the flame emitter? Wait. See how you like it, bitch. I almost hit him. Oh, 
Okay, let's try a ball marrow. Yeah, that hit pretty pretty hard. I hit pretty hard. <laughs> he ran away. Yeah, it just barely caught his butt a tiny bit. And it's fine. We opened up the treasure chest. And we killed that guy. We can go go, go down and get his stuff too. Bum, bum, ba, dum, ba, dum. I forgot there's a shrine right here. That's what we're doing. <laughs> this game is so good. You just get distracted by everything. Uh, I can probably live this. Yeah. I suppose I could equip that flame emitter to something too. Another construct bow. Another horn. Ah, I lost his charge though. Stone axe. Oh, that's for chopping down more things if I needed it. Um, let's see. How about a flame emitter of tree branch? Sure. <laughs> that's just the dumbest weapon ever. I love it. Okay, where's my bridge? We're going to use it to get up to the shrine now. He was like, nope. Yeah, he was just like, no, nah, I'm not dealing with that. Bye. Uh, uh, God damn it. I keep pressing the Breath of the Wild button. I really don't like this. Ooh, there's a hidden little waterfall area there too. We'll come back to that. We'll do the shrine first and get whatever the new power is. Um, Stick this in here. This is the problem. This is not stable enough. Stabilize this up. Um. Damn it. Lower. But damn it, the rock's getting in the way. God damn it, Dwayne Johnson. I'm so angry. I'm so angry. This is why I don't play Minecraft. Down, 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 down. Fine, whatever. I don't care anymore. Just get up there. We'll stick you into the ground somehow. Is that high enough? Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Link, goddammit. <laughs> you know what I wanted to grab. You're pissing me off, Link. Link, don't push it. Come on, just climb. Just, just climb. <sighs> My brain. Okay, there we go. There you go. Now jump onto this one. Uh, not the ice, Link. Not the ice. <laughs> I'm so angry. Okay. Forward. There we go. Now we're climbing with sense. Push it real good. Do not push it real good. We don't need to push it. Ooh. An area to cook if we needed it. Which we don't. Link refuses to collaborate. Link's doing his own thing. He's got his own ideas about how this should go. Do I disagree with him? Yes. But he's onto his own. Special kind of interesting. What am I gonna say? Give me some apples or something. Okay, into the shrine. Hey, buddy. You wanna play? You know what? I'm going to make some red choo-choo jelly. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, it didn't even set on fire. I got white choo-choo jelly. That works too. <laughs> I was just... Yeah, I guess fire should kill ice instantly. That makes sense. Okay. Some water. Oh. Now we drink some water. Shrine looks so cool. Yeah, I love the shrines in this. They've been teaching us interesting things. The powers have all been interesting so far. Oh, they look like baked potatoes. They kind of do. Particularly like sweet potatoes. What's up, Rao Ru? What are you going to give me this time? You fun? Oh, you've made it here. Now then, extend your right hand. Why do you look at it every time, Link? Do you not trust me? Come on. I'm the weird furry daddy in your head. Surely you trust me. I'm giving you power. I gave you my arm, dude. Look how well I take care of my fingernails. Love me. Zaddy? <laughs> Where does Zaddy come from? <laughs> Ascend. Move upward through solid material and emerge on top of it. Mm. Nice. That sounds fun. 
This is the... Oh. This is the Ascend ability. It lets you travel through what's directly above you to ascend through it, emerge on top of it. You'll find it quite useful in all sorts of places and situations. Mm. Use Ascend and receive the blessing from the shrine. Aggie. Sounds like a plan. I'm guessing I have to ascend through this thing. It's a nice and simple beginning. Oh, that's so weird looking. And I can like choose to not come out of it. Can I just go through the big one or do I have to go through the small one? How much can I go through? I can go through a lot. Ooh, uh oh. Oh, so it lets you see what you're getting into before you get up above. That makes sense. It's like, hey, there may be enemies there. How was that not crit? There we go. <laughs> A poor buddy. Oh, man. He didn't deserve that. <gasps> Secrets. Small one might have treasure. Yeah, it definitely... I'm surprised that was for nothing. Oh, I can ascend through it. But yeah, there was a treasure chest down there, so I'm going to go grab that in a minute as well. Oh, that's a cool little effect. It looks like you're swimming up through the earth. Construct bow. Ah, oh, damn it. I love that it lets you drop things now in the menu. So you can actually get the item straight out of the chest. That's so good. But you burned... Yeah, no. Nah. I burned the boxes. It would have been funny if there was like a wooden chest in... Damn it. In there and I just destroyed it. Up we go! Hey, hey, hey! What you got for me? Best quality of life change? Yeah, that's so good. Another stone axe. You know what? I'll drop my old one. Boom. Brand new stone axe. All my slicing pleasure. We... That's so cool to look up. Okay, I can cut this down. That's why it gave me a stone axe. Oh yeah, it's at the front now. I need a slicing weapon. And then ascend right up through it. <laughs> That's going to be useful. That's going to be weird. Oh, now we've got a moving platform. Will it get in my way? Can I just go straight... Okay, so that's too far. But there is a limit to how far things can be above you. But you can go through a lot of material. Magical Earthworm Link? Pretty much. It's such a fun time. Burring through the earth. Let's go! And we're done. Come on out, Raoru and possible Zelda. Possible. Like, original queen, actually, that could also be. They said... The Zonai and the Hylian royal family worked together. Yeah, that could be. I don't know. I think it's Zelda from the past, though. That would be fun. And it would, like, be sad for Link, though. <laughs> oh, my God. Mr. Saito crossover? Yeah, I'm a llama worm now! Oh god, am I going to be freezing to death? Hey, Daudu. I got all the shrines. I see you've restored some power to that new arm of yours. Mm. The door to the Temple of Time should now open for you. Well, there was only three. You really thought they were going to surprise me with a fourth. I've still got cold resistance. Hmm. That's... Oh, that's a sign. That's... Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's the wrong shield. <laughs> if you try to shield surf with a shield fuse with something that will get in the way, you'll fall. That makes sense. <laughs> that was a learning lesson. Um, but yeah, I can go up through this, right? Yeah. Don't even need to build a bridge. Right on the edge of it, though. Hmm. Oh, another gachapon. And a treasure chest and a fire. And a Zuna. God, they're giving me so much here. The temple, it's coming for you. No, I'm coming for the temple. I'm on my way. Archaic Warm Green. Oh, Cold Resistance. 
believed to be from a very long time ago. Despite the old look, the heat retaining material makes it pleasantly resistant to cold temperatures. It's funny that these are apparently archaic, because they look exactly like the ones from Breath of the Wild. You know what? I've got cold resistance. I prefer the look of this. I like the bare legs, thank you. This... Ah. Oh. Korok. Here you go, buddy. Complete your pattern for ya. <laughs> you found me. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Love that little guy. How do I get to? Oh, floating platform. The floating platform is too high. I still don't have my sailcloth. I really thought Rauru was going to give me my sailcloth. How do I get down? Um, I now know how to get up things. Oh, Jesus. Nice, Link. That was actually really good. I'm impressed, Link. Okay, yeah. Oh, I can ascend. I'm an idiot. Do I get up through things, he says. Having just talked on the temple that teaches you how to zoom up through things. Did I just find a plane? Oh, there's multiple planes. Hey, can I play your gachapon? Lucky fail? Honestly, yeah. <laughs> um, my duties today are complete. Oh, this is a rarity. It's unusual for me to receive visitors here. I assume you will require Zonai devices to descend the mountain. Would you like to use the device dispenser? Yes. It's interesting to have a visitor after so long in isolation. I'm happy to address whatever questions you have. Uh, somebody already taught me about them, but thank you, buddy. You go back to sleep. Just be lonely for the rest of eternity. Yep. Is this going to give me different things? Nah. Still portable pots. A wing! A zona device that can harness lift to ride the wind to fly farther by balancing in the center of the wing. What does that mean happens if I go to the side? Kind of worried about that. But yeah, I could use some wings. Poor guy. It's okay. I'm sure he's actually very comfortable. I'm sure he's having a good time. Come on. Yeah, I'll do one more of these and then we're good. Keep running up the hill. Just stay alone, you're so mean. It's what they've done for who knows how long already. And I mean, I already knew about these things, so... Can I just push it off? No. Okay. I have to... Still using the wrong buttons. So I just need to get down... Oh. Can I combine this to... Well. Let's try to ride it first. Okay, that wasn't far enough. Ah, oh, too far. Well, that's okay. Hey, Rauru! You didn't see shit, sir. You didn't see shit. Zonai uh... so devices were the pinnacle of our technology. We built an advanced civilization with them and flourished for many, many years. And now, for some reason, I'm letting your dumbass play with them. Why did you drop that wing off the edge of the mountain, Uchan? Are you okay? If you can master the use of the Zonai devices, your quests will be much easier. Meanwhile, if you keep doing the shit you're up to, I think you'll find you won't get anywhere very fast. Oh, this is a rail cart kind of thing. It's a launching system. Right? Yes, go! This one's in the way. Hi, Rauru. I learned how to use your technology. I'm going to the Temple of Time. And just in time, because we were about to freeze to death. I didn't want to put on those archaic greaves. Quick, quick, get warmer. Please get warmer. Please, I don't want to use the archaic greaves. Oh, that's what happens if you go sideways. Come on, we're waiting. There we go. We're warm again. Oh, shit. I should have tried to fuse these to equipment. There were so many of them up there. This is cool. Oh. It'll help me aim it better. Wait, go down. 
Oh, you could go down too. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, turn right. Turn right. Turn right. No! My baby. Oh, it's going. It's still going. Goodbye. Space bird. Ah, I'll never know what happens. I don't even have anything to combine with that anyway. It's okay. It's okay. One too soon. Yeah. I wonder if that's how you make a power paraglider. Maybe you freeze one of those to a shield. Finally powerful enough to open up the temple of time. I might be free, yeah. It's on its own now. Closed door. Oh, I get a tear of the kingdom? That's bigger than the one that Ganondorf was wearing. Ganondorf had one on like his head or around his neck or something. It was tiny. I'm going to be so much more powerful. <laughs> what are these? Zelda! I saved you. Damn, that was fast. I didn't think we'd get it back so quickly. I'm not going to lie. I thought she'd be gone for most of the game. Hello. This time, take her hand. Don't miss. She's still kind of asleep, though. She's not going to go into the hand, is she? She got a tear as well. And I only just realized she's changed clothes a lot. You powering me up? Hand holding? I know, lewd. Now I've got glowy golden hand. Oh, what the heck? She gave me a new power. And she out. The heck? Oh, <laughs> we saved her for one second. Was she like inside the tear? Has she gone back to sleep? I, mm, I have many questions. Cool. Reverse an object's movement until it goes back to where it was. Stop the reverse movement at any time. Zaudu. Tell me what happened to my girlfriend. Stop stealing her. Ah, uh, recall. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. And Zelda has vanished as well. What you just saw... It's a mystery even to me. But perhaps it was a sort of echo. One that reflects her sheer will. Damn, so she hung around. That sounds terrifying. Is she actually dead? That you've now been given this ability. No doubt it will prove quite important. That's it? The man shows up, says it's a secret to everyone, and is just out? Okay. Really hope she's not dead. So I can obviously use these to climb. I reverse them. I've got wrong button. Not yet. Oh, it freezes time too. The world. Sick. Oh, it really is the world. Makes everything black and white. That's so sick. And it has no cooldown? That's kind of crazy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> My job here is done. Flips cape and leaves. Yeah, Rauru was just like, hmm. That shit was kind of crazy. Anyway, later, Link. Good luck.
The goddess statue smiles upon you. Um. Oh, I should just go through the door, shouldn't I? So these don't power you up anymore. They're just around. Interesting. In we go. Wait, I only have one glowy hand. Push! Oh, is this the new master sword? Ah, I'm too weak. And I'm dripping. That is a lot of sweat. God damn. The door stands as a test of your own overall vitality. <laughs> this man really reappeared 10 seconds later to say, Damn, Link, you weak as shit. No wonder Zelda left you for me, pussy. Look at his tiny waist. Oh, he's so fine. No wonder. You remain in a weakened state. You're not yet strong enough to open it. But there is one more shrine on this island. There, you can get another blessing. I knew I needed four. Mmm. Mmm. Tried to pretend they weren't doing the same thing as before. If you add that to the other blessings you receive at shrines and offer them all to the goddess, you might just find your way forward after all. Let me see the Pura pad. You gonna mark it on my map for me? Pur oh. The Pura pad lets you travel to certain places instantly. Now, see all the blue marks on your map? You can travel instantly to any of them. I'd suggest the one at the bottom of your map. Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You'll find the last of this island's shrines around there somewhere. Pretty much right there. There you go, buddy. Peace! <laughs> I like Raru. He's fun. <laughs> okay, so I now can teleport. Um, map. He told me to go this way. The Room of Awakening. Why Link dripping? Dang, dude. We know Raru is hot, though. <laughs> Makes sense. Yep. Raru's backseating now. I mean, he do be the tutorial character. I don't mind him backseating. He's teaching. Yeah, I'm also surprised about the fact that he knew the Pura Pad would let me teleport. That doesn't make much sense, but sure. Sure, oh, we've got more reverse timies. Timey, wimey, wibbly, wobbly. Okay, that's why I'm here. Can't I just ascend, though? What if I just get to the edge of this? Oh, it's in the water. Shit. They thought of it. Unless... I'm going to try to break this. Yeah, I don't need your time travel nonsense. That actually saved us some time, honestly. Otherwise, we would have had to reverse time all of these things. There might be items over there, though. Shit. This, uh, fuck it. That's fine. We found a secret way up. I feel happy about it. Can I go through this? I can. I won't. <laughs> I don't know where that'll take me. But that's kind of amazing. Ooh, shrine. Oh, that was easy. I expected much longer. But there's also this thing. Hey, buddy. How you doing? You okay. This is a crystal refinery. I can take your crystallized charges and use them to produce energy wells. Yes! Give me more power. Get producing. Get pro oh, the f... That's 300 zoanites. Oh, I'm screwed. The production will require at least 100 crystallized charges. Return when you've collected a sufficient amount, you little bitch. One note regarding zoanite required to protest crystallized charges. The mines on this island have nearly run dry. I doubt there's enough left to produce an energy well. If there is more to be had, check the distant depths of the world below. That is in its original source. Blah, 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 blah. So I have to go down to the earth to get more zone. If that's fine. I'm going in the shrine. Find a new power. I don't need you. Get me out of here. Come back later, you poor peasant. Yeah, basically. He said, bitch, you live like this? Ten out of a hundred? Nearly a tenth of the way there. Hurry up. <laughs> okay, what do we got down here? What other powers are there? Oh, this is just testing my rewind ability. 
And I can already see how I do this. You end? Uh. It really feels like the world. That's that's awesome. Numma 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 numma. Should I stop or should I let it come all the way? Oh. It doesn't come all the way. Okay, so I need to take it up here now. God, ah, it's going to take me so long to get used to the different button. Oh. There was another one. Where did that come from? Oh, did that come from up? So I need to rewind that one. Where did it didn't go. The oh, there's one. Don't leave me. Okay. Oh, wait. Can I use two powers at once? Damn, it's too far. Huh. Is this shrine Taco Bell? Why is everybody talking about tacos? Exactly what happened with tacos? I have many questions. What is chat on right now? Is this a water park now? Yeah, it is. A fun one. Come on. Oh, God. Nacho Shrine. Oh, I missed that. I didn't realize it was called that. Nacho Shrine. God damn it. Ten arrows? Hell yeah. Is that the only secret item here? That feels wrong. I'm going to miss cryosis at some point. I'm also hungry. Yeah, me too. God damn. What do these do? How do I mess with these? Oh, they have to be aligned at the top. Um, So rewind. Oh, you can rewind. Oh, I see. So rewinding will make them line up indefinitely. That's way simpler than I thought it was going to be. I mean, I guess this is just a tutorial. Now we're locked in here forever. We'll never go back. Did you eat breakfast? I ate like a quarter of it. I was going to eat the rest of it while the, the intro was playing. And then the internet started to die. So yeah, I've got like three quarters. I got something different today. I got a Baja salad with chicken. Delicious super high in fiber but yeah i'll finish as it goes on eat food dummy fine i'll eat some right now my wrap button um there oh it's inside my chest ignore that um <laughs> yeah that was pretty damn funny <laughs> You ever been so hungry, you put the food directly inside your sternum, just absolutely cut yourself open and said, you know what? Just get it inside me. Baja salad? Yeah, Baja with a, uh, with a J. B-A-J-A. -A. It's got like wild rice, couscous, red kidney beans, avocado, tomato, and Greek yogurt, as well as chicken. I think this guy had other things I could talk to him about. And if you were, oh, oh things I've already heard of. Okay. Can I ascend through the mountain? I could earlier. I mean, I gotta try it. Where does this take me? Hello. <laughs> I don't think this is somewhere I want to be. But it's interesting. But I can go back. Yeah, B. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. Okay, I'm going to go the way I'm supposed to go first, and then I may come back here and see what's on top of that. But I'm scared that if I go up there, I'm not going to be able to get back down, because I still don't have the power power glider. Oh, and here's some wings. Rauru? No Rauru? All oh, right, I need to get back to the Temple of Time. Just right in front of me. Yeah, okay, I'll go to the top. Screw it. Oh, it's not even that high up. Okay, good. 
Let's go, baby. A lot up here. Birds, a circular structure. There's nothing up here. <laughs> That's fine. There must be something at the tippy top, though. Look at that. That's... Oh, treasure. Oop. Bird meat. Ah, shit. I didn't get ahead. I'll catch you yet, my little bird. You have descent too? Yeah, you can just go back. Oh, three more wings. Awesome. Where'd the bird go? What the bird doing? You know what? I'm going to get you from the top of the tree. This is definitely something to do with the Korok. Do I have to sink it? Ow. Come on, Link. Get on top of it. Oh, it was just that simple. Even better. <laughs> so no head. <laughs> I will get the head, dabbit. Hey, Korok seeds isn't bad. That's a few bonus things. There's the bird. Wait, there's got to be another one running around too. Where'd the other one go? There's an apple tree as well. So many things. Let's go get the apples. Get the birds in time. Scream like a Korok. <laughs> They're adorable. <laughs> They're so sweet. Do you want to know a fun thing you can ascend? I don't think... Oh. Um... No, don't give me, like, gameplay spoilers either for now. Uh, later on, I'll probably be like, yo, what kind of crazy shit can we can do? But, like, I want to explore the world as naturally as I can. Like, finding out about, like, the minecart shield was so freaking cool. And being able to ascend through things. So, yeah, I want to explore on my own for a little while. It may be, like, a few sessions. But after a few sessions, I will be like, yo, what's some of the craziest shit you guys have done in this game? Where'd my bird go? I think he just disappeared. I let him be free for too long. But there's a bird. No way I can snipe that out. I believe in myself. Come on, Link! I got it! Okay, I feel like a god. <laughs> we got some bird meat. That's fine. Oh, there was... You son of a... Good. Yeah. Real meat. Dinner? Yeah. He was hiding in the bushes. I didn't know they could do that. They're so much smarter in this game. In Breath of the Wild, they just kind of let you hunt them. They would run around. In this game, damn, they actually hide. Boom, headshot. Yeah, that one was lucky. Shield stuff! God, I love my shield. Okay, let's go back to the Temple of Time. Um, bu -bu -bum, wrong thing. God hand. <laughs> Yeah, I do have to rotate it. I was like, maybe I don't have to rotate it. Maybe it'll just like align itself since it's like a platform. There we go. Okay, get in the middle. Crouch down because it looks cooler. Let's go, baby. Oh, God. I have to go straight down. Stra oh, what's that? I mean, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> oh, no. I don't have a paraglider. I don't have a paraglider. I don't okay, I'm fine. Go forward, 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 forward. Shit. Okay. I missed the circle of things, but I can fix that. The amount of times I've jumped off things and then immediately realized I don't have a paraglider already. This is so mean. Korok? <laughs> you found me. Have my seeds. Oh, that shit was impressive. Bye bye. Now give me the Aronas. Give me. Give me. Now let's find out if we can God Hand Fish. Nah, you can't. That's a shame. That would have been fun. Just grabbing fish out of the water. I see you. Where did you go? There was another one. Oh, I didn't even see that one. That'll do. That's enough fishy for one day. Just keep going at it. I always will. 90% of my deaths were because I forgot I had a paraglider. That's funny. <laughs> I mean, Breath of the Wild, you're just so used to it. This feels so much like Breath of the Wild that you're like, yeah, I can jump. Oh, I missed one of the eggs. 
Come on, Link. Don't fall off the tree. There we go. Okay, where's the Temple of Time? North. So we need to... Okay. Let's finally try this. Zone 9 device is where you are. There. Wing. Take out. Um. Return to game? Okay. Uh, quickly take out materials. Press and hold up. Select. Oh. That would have been easier. <laughs> Oh, but now I don't have a launching path for it. Is this even going to work? Hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Let me try something. Let me line it up. If I lift up, push forward, tilt it. Ah, oh, that's the wrong way. Okay, we need to cancel that. If I lift up, push forward, tilt down. Oh, I did it again. Frick. Inverted controls confuse me so much. Lift up, push forward, tilt down. That might kill me. However, Now I'm going to reverse time. That actually works. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, babe. Oh god, I'm sliding off. That's fucking awesome. Um, I am way too high. Oh, but there's another little island over there. You know what? I believe in myself. Oh god. Link, do dive mode. Do dive mode. <laughs> Do dive. There we go. Yeah, we'll make this. We'll live. There's the circle of rocks. That's a good sign. This is awesome. So you can just launch those from anywhere as long as you use the time reverse. Um, There's so many more ancient around us. Ooh, that was an enemy. Stamina bulb, stamina mushroom. I scared away a bird like an idiot. I'm annoyed I can't bomb the fish in the water. Come here, fish. Come here, fish. Get over here. Come, come here. There we go. I'm going to drown. I'm going to drown this tidy little lake. Okay, we're fine. 10 out of 10 dive. Yeah, the second one worked. <laughs> the first one, not so much. Hmm. Is there anything else up there? Nah. This island was just for some fish. Not bad. Do I want to waste another wing? How close are we? The Temple of Time. We're pretty close. Is there any water? There's water below us. Okay, we're good. We don't even need another wing now. We just... Yeet! I love this game. Oh, bird. You bastards. I couldn't even shoot them that time. Did you ever get a glider? I don't know. They gave me 19 wings, so... Maybe you just use wings in this game. I thought I'd seen people... Ooh, apples. Distractions. I thought I'd seen people use gliders, but maybe not. Or maybe it's like late games to just make things easier. But for now, we have wings. Oh, dragon again. Dragons are everywhere. You've escaped for now, birds. But not for long! <laughs> yep, headshot. Boom, baby. Give me that meat. Two more over there. Not worth it. Just grab the mushroom and let's go. Okay. Let's go into the temple of time. Am I supposed to be going to the temple? Yeah, okay. I can... Like, I forgot. We got enough energy. We can create a heart vessel and we can go past the temple of time. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Not just bouncing from island to island like an idiot. <laughs> you got head? Finally. Finally got head. Don't tell Zelda. She's away right now. But I mean, she's been apparently maybe playing around with Rao. I don't know. We'll find out. That'll be really sad. This was like one of the few. This and Skyward Sword, I think, are the only games where it's like canonical that Link and Zelda get together. So if they take that away. Oh, no, it's badly damaged. I thought I could sc skate on that. So, yeah, if they take that away from Breath of the Wild, Link, I'm going to feel so bad. Bum, ba, bum, ba, bum. Ooh, water. Okay, reverse. 
So are the... Allegedly. Alleg we don't know yet. We'll see what happens. I don't even know that that's Zelda. It may be one of Zelda's ancestors, or it may not even be... Shit. Related to Zelda. Oh, this is the actual way to do it. I've been doing it a weird way. <laughs> okay, that works too. <laughs> Zelda has two hands. You're not wrong. Oh, it glows when it knows you have all four. There's a go. What you got for me, goddess? You who have counted the shrine, conquered the shrines, and claimed their lights of blessing. In exchange for four lights of blessing, I will grant you your power. You want a heart container, yes? I shall grant the power you seek. I'm sad it didn't give me the option to get a stamina vessel. Because I know that would break the game, but I think it would be very funny. <laughs> Does your new arm have a vibrate function? I don't think so. It also has very long nails. It would not be great. A rare item that restores some of the life force lost into the gloom. What? Increase... Oh, yeah, because I lost all my 20 hearts from the gloom. Increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. So technically, I'm not getting heart piece... Uh, getting hearts anymore. I'm restoring my hearts, which were stolen by Ganon in the gloom. Huh. Go and bring peace to the world. Well... Wait. I have some theories about the timey-wimey bullshit, but it better not be right. Hmm. I'll talk about them in a bit. Nah, couldn't be. Uh, are you clearing out the gloom from you? Yeah. I'm making myself happier. Getting rid of the gloom. I like this strategy. It would be funny to turn into a stab at a vessel. Oh, man. I'm really happy to see you enjoy this game. My ears keep twitching when you mention Raudu. We'll have to keep the VOD. Oh, yeah, Realm. We'll have to keep the VOD later, dude. Bad Wi Fi. Yeah, my internet's not doing great today either. I'm glad I'm getting to actually stream it, though. Oh, good. Oh, voice acting. I see you have managed to open the door. Oh, I love your voice. I'm not fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. We're almost beyond saving. Well, thank you for saving me and this cool arm. By visiting the shrines and receiving their blessings, you have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Hmm. Though our time together has been brief, I am so happy that we finally met. Finally. You're going? You're not staying with me in the arm? You are exactly as Zelda said. Oh, you were with Zelda! You bastard. That's our boy Chris Hackney. Yo! Now it is up to you. Oh, I'm cocking him! Let's go! Link's finally not yeah! Link's a man! Sorry, that was a very dramatic moment. He seems nice. <laughs> I mean, if the original Sage of Light was named after him, he was like, does that make him the original King of Hyrule? Because he's on, like, all the statues and everything. But yeah, he did everything he could for Zelda and has left her to me. <laughs> ah, reverse NTR. You love to see it. What the f- Oh. Okay. What is that giant ring of fire? Okay, the clouds covered it. I saw something for a second. Creepy. Down we go. Can I ascend? Yes. There we go. Let's not put it that way. <laughs> nah, he was just a nice guy who took care of Zelda for a while. Now oh, I'm back. Same thing, same thing. How long will you be streaming today? I honestly have no idea. I don't feel like I'm ready to stop anytime soon. It looks like we're just about to finish the tutorial. Is this going to bring back Zelda? I mean, she came out of the tear, so maybe this is her light energy. <gasps> is she like the reverse to Ganon now, where Ganon has like a calamity energy, Zelda has a light energy? Find out. She was like, right, you've been waiting for since Daddy Joseph? Yep. That bastard, man. Messed me up. In four hours. It's been four hours? Oh my god. 
be being like we'll do three to four hour streams from now on <laughs> we haven't even started Zatsu Don. Oh, i'm not ready to stop yet yeah this may be a longer stream <laughs> we're gonna keep going for a while fee fi 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 is making her fi noises oh is this gonna restore the master sword a little bit probably right we'll cure it a little bit and then i'll have to go find x amount of other ones Oh. I sent it back in time. That's what we're doing, isn't it? She's going to cure it from her end and leave it somewhere for me again. Fine. Oh. I like to think that at least Zelda can understand Fi inside the sword. Bring me with you. So she's definitely back way, way, way in the past. Probably when Hyrule was first established with Rauru. Oh, it's just the dragons. Are they going to want to fight? Because I can deal with that. that music what's time limit is 12 hours i'm definitely not getting the 12 hours don't worry about it Link. Zelda. i'm not jumping that Link. you must find me i've done a lot of crazy things for love i'm not jumping this soda you're gonna have to give me a paraglider oh, wait i have a wing to the kingdom of Hyrule. There is water right below me. I don't have to wait. Oh, there's firing. It's not fire, it's malice. I guess gloom. Ooh, fine. What kinds of things going on? Do it worse? Yeah, I'm going to do it. There's water below me. I'm fine. Is that the castle? Yeah, that's Ganon's castle. Oh, Princess's castle. He's reclaimed it, I guess. What kinds of sky islands, too? Do a flip? Oh, I will. Oh. The big storm. That reminds me of Skyward Sword. Definitely gonna have to open up. Maybe the dragon will open that up for us at some point. Oh, I don't see any more shrines. I don't see any more green glue. So. I guess it's time. I want to go there, too. That looks like a big village. Oh, what the frick? Rauru? Rauru? Um, where was that village? But it's so hard when you zoomed in. It was just past the fire there. Okay. Let's go! Wait, flip and ascend? Flipping cannibal. I thought somebody said flip and ascend. I was going to be like, can you do that? Can you, like, ascend in midair? If so, that'd be crazy. I'm going to see that on the way down. Yeah, I'm going to see if you could ascend while falling. Yay! Nah, you can't. That's a shame. That would be funny. You know what? Let's just go straight. Oh, that's sick! You could shoot arrows straight down. Um, yeah, let's just go straight down into this water. This is where it wants us to go. We'll begin our adventure the hard way. Oh, there's another shrine. You can open the Pura pad while falling too. There's another one. And another. <laughs> okay, we have a lot to do. But first. Oh god, I'll just keep pressing the wrong button. Yay! Sick. We're back in Hyrule, baby. What is that on the map? Viral Kingdom. The music is so good. Okay. We have lots of shrines marked on our map. 
there's a very obvious direction it actually wants us to go it wants us to go to that town um but there's so many shrines around me in different yeah there's one right there and there's smoke which means that's probably a stable i'll go that way first and then i'll go to the town <laughs> i don't have to do what nintendo tells me what is this ah. well that was bound to happen eventually it, it, it had a good while viral restoration materials Use this material cachet for all your building needs. Come find us if you'd like a dream home. Hudson Construction! Yo shit, I already built my home. I better still have my home. Oh, we got wheels. I do have fans. Not yet. We're not building monstrosity yet. We'll come back. I will herb. That thing. A big old rock. Beautiful moon. Link breaks his neck. <laughs> I didn't. I lived, bitch. <laughs> I always live somehow. Just that lucky. Oh, this is so fast. A fire fruit? Oh, yeah. Gotta go home and see? Yeah, we'll find out. Find our way to Tarrytown eventually. Yep, shrine in the stable. I know those puffs of smoke like the back of my hand. Tadgy Cat Shrine! Oh, it's Katz's shrine. No. Moon is beautiful, isn't it? Hi. The moon is beautiful. I'm not going to say it in Japanese, though. Nice try. <laughs> Tony Hawk's Pro Scaler Life. Hell yeah. What is this one? Building with logs. It's nice and simple. The logs we got. Only one. Stupid buttons. Oop, ba -doop, ba -doop. Now you're thinking with logs. Hudson would be proud. You're coming with me. Okay, now we've got three logs. We just need to make a bridge. Nothing secret. Yeah, nothing secret, surprisingly. Okay. Bridge of logs. Okay. Let's actually twist things. To orient things properly so we don't end up with the mistake we had on the mountain. Come here. There we go. Yep. Down. Stick. Got a giant stick. Is it too big? Oh, <laughs> wait a minute. Did I do too well? Um, just release. Maybe I want to stick it into the water. Is there anything to hold it down there? Nah, too deep. Okay. Okay. Long, long, long. Yeah. Long, long, long. Get out of there. It's too long. It's getting stuck into every. God damn it. Come to me. Hmm. Oh my god. It keeps hitting the walls. Can I attach? No. I can't stick it there. Hmm. Maybe there's something on the other side of this I need to look at. How didn't you drop it on your head? I would die. Oh, I can probably jam it under the metal, actually. I just... <laughs> aim it right, which is so hard because it's so... <laughs> Maybe I just need one. Realistically, I don't need it to be anywhere near this long. The length... Yeah, the length is actually killing me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jam it in there, Link. Come on. Come on, move it down. Right? No. It doesn't hold it. 
Wait. The, the time thing. What am I doing? Um, I can do the time thing. It's here right now. I need it to go. Up. Forward. Needs to hover there for a moment. And then it needs to come back. I get on it. Oh, I'm an idiot. That's so easy once you figure it out. <laughs> so that's probably just the, what, the time it was actually supposed to teach me. Hey, you can do this. You can use time controls. Okay. There's definitely something up there. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. That's the studies. Is it to cross the water? Nice, Fuchan. Thank you. These puzzles are so cool already. Combining the powers is such an interesting move. But to get across there. Then we want to climb up there just in case. Ah. Your brain is as big as the stick. Nah, my brain pretty small. But the guidance was there. Wait, why would I even make a climbing thing? Just use a recall again. Up it. Up. Forward. Back. Down. Oh, there's nothing up there. Okay. <laughs> well, nothing up there either. I did this for nothing. This is, this is fine. Uh, let's combine some more things. Now we want long, long bridge. Ah, oh God. Damn it. That one went wonky. There we go. Grab it from here. Reverse, reverse. There we go. Nice and simple. Incept, it's rolling. It's rolling. Ah, oh, it stopped rolling. Oh, God. There we go. <laughs> Evo. Oh, now they want me to make a ship. Okay. I can do that. Then. Oh, that did not. You know what? I like this structure. I think this will work. I don't like the structure. Need some glue, man. I make my own glue. This is a Link special glue. Don't worry about it. He knows what he's doing. There we go. So there, there, there's got to be a secret in the shrine, though. I didn't find any treasure chests. That feels wrong. Oh, well. Oh, there. Yeah. Okay, that's nice and easy. We just angle it. Oh, too far. That's okay. That's okay. We're doing fine. Um, bum, bum, bum. Cool. Oh. There's also a current working against us. Um... Shit. Well, let's let the current carry us to the left. <laughs> now you're playing Raft? I know, right? This game is everything in one. You don't need another game. Yeah, I'll turn it myself. Ah, uh, left. There we go. There we go. Perfect. 
You sell it anywhere asking for a friend? You want to buy Lynx glue? It's going to cost you. It seems to work on just about anything, so... But do they have killer sharks? Probably in the future. Oh, they gave me a spiky shield. That's... I have two spiky shields now. Now we just finish our sailing. Although we can probably swim that distance. Take me home, little boat, to the place. This log is your log. This log is our log. <laughs> Ling's glue is so strong. Yeah, it works real good. No matter where you want it. Wait, actually, Zidon exists. You prefer Zidon glue? I'd imagine as a fish, he has like a mucousy membrane kind of thing. That should be a thing. Anyway, we finished that one. That one wasn't so bad. So, the oh, I've got the Korok on me still. Whoops. <laughs> so, they do want you to use the reverse time and the movement. You could do all kinds of things with that number. If you make a long bridge, you spin it around and then you reverse it. Doggo! I don't have enough meat for you not right now, buddy. But can I pet you in this game? No. Can I like at least give you a little fanning? No! I wasn't supposed to hurt you. I was supposed to be comfortable, buddy. I'm friend. I'm friend. Yeah. See, we friends. You know what? I may not have much meat, but I owe you some. Yeah, let me give you some steak. One of my two steaks for you, friend. What do you think? There we go. Ah, I thought he'd like the wind blowing. Uh, yeah, actually, not to be fair. I don't think most dogs like having things blown in their face. I blow on dog's face, he gets angry too. <gasps> confidants! What up, confidants? Are you... Did anyone else just see a rock fall from the sky? I'm pretty sure that just came from the sky. Which begs the question. One second. There's no way, right? That's a goat. Ah, goat works too. It's even more stuff here. There's stone stuff. Can I reverse time it? And if so, can you take me to the sky? Oh, holy shit. Here we go. Any time now. Did I take too long to get to it? I took too long to get to it. Oh. Is that a shrine? Is this how I get to that shrine? No, I need a paraglider. Can't move that far. How high does this go? Oh. Oh, fuck. I didn't think this through. <laughs> um. Watcha save me! <laughs> okay. <laughs> so that does work, <laughs> but that did not help me. Um. That is probably how you get to that shrine, though. I just. I guess you do get a paraglider at some point. That doesn't make me high enough, but with a paraglider, I could have gotten to that shrine. I didn't realize it was floating in the air. Damn. Unless I just make a giant bridge up to it. Let's go visit the stable anyway. Hydration helped me drown. That would have been even funnier. Hyrule seemed kind of chill. No monsters so far. I guess I did take out the monsters. Maybe Ganon hasn't started his attack yet. What's up, buddies? You eating some rice? Good job. Bah. Bah. <laughs> yeah. Go be free. I set the confidant free. Good job. What if you can reverse it while it's in the air? I think that would just take it back down because technically then the movement... I'll try that next time. But technically the movement has already gone down at that point. Hey there! Are you a fellow traveler on your journey of life? It's me, Beetle. If you forget, my beetle-shaped pack is right next to you to remind you. Yeah, yeah. 
In this topsy-turvy world, there's only one direction to go. Forward! So when I travel, it's forward all the way. I can sell you bugs of the highest quality. And if you need anything else on your life journey, I can sell you that too. Do you not remember me? Short on rupees? Don't worry. I haven't got any rupees. I'll buy anything you don't want weighing you down. <laughs> and what better way to lighten up than to sell your rocks? Gemstones in particular fetch a high price. Well, well, what'll it be? Ah, uh, what have you got? That's a lot of arrows. That's not a lot of arrows. Oh, alien rice though. I have no money. Thanks for your business. You did nothing. Anyway. <laughs> Ruby's worth 110. Wait. Oh, that's a blight broom. Um, can I sort? Yes. I type. Yes, please. Opal's worth 30. I've got five of them. Mm. Nah. I don't need to buy from you just yet. I'll be back. Good chance stop hitting us. I fanned you guys. I didn't hit you. My, this is so exciting. What are you staring at, bud? There's nothing out there. Recipe, recipe. Oh, I can't wait. What's so exciting? Oh, uh, excuse me. I was lost in thought. There's a group of gourmets who frequent our stable, and they always teach me new recipes to cook. And the recipe for our next session is a dish devised by Princess Zelda herself. I'm so excited, I can't even sit still. I kind of want to see them show up. <laughs> Let's see, what's in this issue of Lucky Clover Gazette? What's the news? Freezing temperatures bring feathery shivers to the Rito. Rito village is facing a food shortage. Cold winds make travel to the village dangerous for resident and visitor alike. That's awful. Sounds like anyone trying to get to Rito village needs to prepare themselves for harsh freezing river. Well, that's nice. Any other stories? Oh, now this is interesting. The Lucky Clover Gazette is here for you. It's open its office at Rito Stable. Any eager new journalists are encouraged to apply. So that stable has become a newspaper company then. Just when you thought you'd seen everything. If I'm ever near Rito Village, I might just drop by and see what this is all about. There's so much to read in these newspapers. That doesn't... Yeah, that was not too much, to be fair. But yeah. Rito Village has got a Lucky Clover Gazette. What's the recipe? That's way too close. Goron spice and crab. Make spiced crab, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I would have guessed. <laughs> the dripping. Yeah. Oh, it's done now. Work in progress. Do not touch. Okay, that's not useful. I guess that's it. And no, I don't want to sleep in your stable. But I have so many horses, sir, from Breath of the Wild, sir. Surely you remember me, sir. Unlike fucking Beetle, who doesn't give a shit about me. Oh. Oh, welcome to my stable. We deal in all things horse-related. We also double as an inn. Hmm, it seems you're not a member yet. You son of... I really have to recatch horses? How long has it been? <laughs> Our stable uses the Stable Association's membership system. So you'll need to register if you want to use it. May I ask your name? Um, Uchan. Link. All right, Mr. Link, there. You're all signed up. Would you like to tell me about the stable system? I already know. Is that so? Well, then once again, welcome to our stable. If you catch a wild horse and bring it here, you can register it. If you want to lodge with us, please visit the counter. Now, how can I help you? Goodbye. Aww. Wait, what am I thinking? I completely forgot to explain how pony points... What? Pony points? Oh. Well, that's right. It's a reward system you can use at stables. In short, every time you use a service, you get points. No matter what stable you go to, you can get points for lodging there, registering a horse, stuff like that. Now then, this is the first use of Rizzicide. You get a pony point. Sweet. Awesome, I think. Ooh. We're collecting PP. Pee -pee. Yeah, we are. Can you use Epina? Oh, I do have my hundreds of amiibos. But I'll use them at the end of the session today. That's the PP book. Mm. You can trade your PP for prizes at the ledger counter over there. Check out the ledger for prize details, member rules, and other information. Come back again anytime. Fuck you, Ember. Stole my horses. They stole my horses. They stole Lil Apple and Epina and Zelda's horse. Oh my god. Okay, the pink one was the one that was in the sky. Let's go see if we can find a way up to that one. Ooh, dragon again. They're just everywhere. Holy crap. And birdies. What's up with the birds? Weird. 
Don't trade your PP. <laughs> hey, man. Not doing anything else with my PP. I mean, might as well use it while I can. You either use it or lose it. Am I right? I lean to... We have tomatoes now? A fruit found widely from cold areas to warm climates. Full of nutrition. Kind of trendy lately. Use it in cooking to recover more hearts. I'm gonna make so much pasta. Oh, we don't have onions. They might have onions. They have tomatoes now. Tomatoes now. I'm gonna make so much pasta. So much pascari. Put down your horses are there. Ah, it's fine. I've got a thing. What do you mean my horses are there? He told me I don't have no horses. I signed up. How can I get to that? Is that a mo Oh, that's a monster camp. Here we go. There was an AO counter at this point. It was, yeah. It happens with every stream. Hey, buddies. Been a while. But a but Oh, that guy has a skull on his head. That's just random falling rock again. Is that just going to keep happening? It's kind of terrifying. Uh oh. That was a headshot. I don't care. What the fuck kind of weapon is that, sir? He's got a mushroom on a stick. Oh, these don't actually do damage, huh? Um, let's flame yo. Oh, it cooks the mushroom. <laughs> it actually cooks the mushroom. That's great. Oh my god. Oh, I'm about to be out of battery. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah. Okay. Somehow that worked. Bokoblin <laughs> home. Um, I don't need this thing. Yeah, bitch. Thank you for the arrow, though. Um, what do I use? Just finish this off, I guess. No arrows! Oh, I still don't have battery? Okay, just give me a minute. <laughs> you can't shoot me. There we go. Let's finish. Ooh, we've got air now, too. Oh, I don't have a... I forgot that I don't have a paraglider <laughs> again. <laughs> That's okay. A moblin horn. A hard horn that resulted from a skull mutation. Oh. That's what it was. Attach it to a weapon to increase its attack power or cook it to make an elixir. Okay. Boko blow. B bow even. Arrows. They're weak anyway. We don't need those bows. That means you'll get one. They're evolving. Yeah, they've got mutations now. They've got horns. I wonder if that makes them stronger. Probably. We did get the shit knocked out of us in the Sky Islands. Traveler's Bow. Five. Okay. Um, well, I've been using this one, so drop. Oh, drop. There we go. Is that a spear? A throwing spear. Oh, can't carry any more weapons. This one. Oh, God. I can't throw that here. I need to drop it. If I throw it, I'm going to explode everything. <laughs> Just carefully walk over here. Drop it over here. I'm not that dumb. I've done that too many times in Breath of the Wild. Later, flame amid a club. Arrows? Arrows are great. Throwing spear. I combine that with something. Will it actually like still like have the throwing effect? And go far? Because that would be great. Oh! I said I learned my lessons. I said I learned my lessons. I didn't think I was that close. He swung so wide. Why, Link? Why would you do this? <laughs> Enhancing armor. The great fairies can enhance your armor still. That's cool. Oh, God. Okay. We didn't lose too much progress. Let's, let's get rid of some of these things. This, is, this would be a smarter option. You go over there. You go over there too. 
just yeah away please wait what if oh i still haven't dropped the flame emitter it didn't drop fire when i dropped it so let me just drop grab Oh, <laughs> throwing spear bomb barrel. <laughs> oh, that's going to be deadly. Yeah, yep, yeah, that's... Mm -hmm. Chat can see exactly what I'm planning. And there's some moblins over there. Let's go try my baby out. Because I don't want to accidentally switch to it when other things are going down. <laughs> this works way too well. You didn't learn anything? Yeah, I did. I made it a throwing weapon. It won't hurt me if I throw it. Bomb barrel spear. <laughs> Watch this. Yeah, boy! It's only a one hit, but still pretty fucking cool. Ow, buddy. Oh, he survived. Pretty well, actually. Surprised. I thought I would do more damage. There we go. Now, what does your camp have for me? Moblin horn. Bookoblin horn. Arson time? Hell yeah. Always arson time. Arson is always the answer. Arrow, arrow. Little shroom. And a well. So I can dry it up well. Whoop. Wait. Bottomless pond? Okay. One second. <laughs> if it's actually bottomless, this is going to be death. <laughs> well, well, well. Nah, they lied to me. That ain't bottomless. How do they even get any water? Fish. Glowy fish. Ooh. Glowing cave fish. Luminous fish that lives in dark caves. When consumed, its light enzyme can make one's body glow. I can make myself glow. They're down here. Uh oh. <laughs> what up, buddy? It's been a while since I had to do. Oh god, they're still alive. Take out the heads. Oh, there's one more. Any more? That's what I thought. Oh, Coblin fan. That was weird. 20 damage? Skeletal arm that keeps moving in after it's hit a kind of gross to stuff over a pinch. Old and fragile. Okay, so it breaks pretty quickly. But 20 damage? What if I fuse something to it? Will it stick around for longer? What if I fuse a spear to it? <laughs> what if I fuse an arm to an arm? 40 damage! Oh my god. Even if that only hits once, that's kind of badass. It's a lot of da Yeah, the highest I've got before that is 12. Oh, hey. Go back to sleep. Give me that horn. Moblin fang, a hard steel fang. Ooh, why is this glowing? That's creepy. <laughs> this is a random glowing ground, and I don't like it. Okay, I'm just going to say that's a graphical glitch and move on. Anything else down here? They're holding hands? Yeah! One hand is holding the other hand. What are you? Where'd it go? Was that not food? It looked like food. <laughs> but I guess it wasn't food. <gasps> There's more. Sticky lizard. Suction of its toes allowed this lizard to easily cling to walls. It could be an asset for a climbing on wet surfaces. <gasps> we can finally defeat rain. Oh my god, finally. Yeah, that first lizard must have just fallen into the water so we couldn't get it. Oh. Oh. 
Amber and a bomb flower? Fuck yeah. Yeah, I think that, oh no, there's a couple more lizards up there. And one more, uh, more uh, war thing. The rain can be conquered, finally. We can conquer the elements. Considering we don't have Rivali's Gale anymore for some reason. I guess the, champ the champions of old just went back to sleep. Ah, oh, God. I need like a uh, an attack that like hits a big area to deal with those. Wait, was that a non-broken traveler spear? No, it's still corrupted. Okay. The rain can be conquered. Lizards, lizards are gonna be tasty. Gonna help us climb in the rain. Do I have to climb out? Oh wait, can I just? There's no way, right? That's so sick. So you can just get out of caves whenever you're ready. Oh my god, I love this game. Whenever you're done with the cave, you just say, nah, I'm out. Later. Uh, I need to get across the water to get to that thing. We Already? I've barely used this one. Man. Did you forget about the town you were going to check? No, I decided I was going to go this direction first because I saw some shrines over this way. But I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get to this shrine. I'm going to try it. Can I cross this water? Hmm. I could make a... Bu oh, there's stepping stones. But yeah, I was going to try to get these shrines before I head to the town itself. So I figure the town is where I actually want to go. But I mean, while I'm here, I might as well go in the opposite direction and get some power-ups. Then I can always teleport back here since I've hit some shrines. Weep. Oh. <laughs> that almost went bad. And what is this, this adorable dead village? Florette Sandbar. Flowers. Oh shit, silent princesses. This lovely flowers said to have been a favorite of the princess of Hyrule. They were once farmed, feared to have gone extinct, but it's not uncommon to spot them growing in the wild. Oh, they've started to come back since Zelda came back. That's good. Easy to get sidetracked in this game. I figure that's pretty much the entire point of this game. It's just exploring and having fun. You get to talk with chat. You get to have fun. Oh, this is the fountain. Wasn't this near Hyrule Castle? No, I must have imagined that. There's so many collectibles here, though. Warm Safina. It's warm to the touch and increases your cold resistance. Mighty Thistle increases your attack. Let's go. We're getting all kinds of power-ups here. This Amaranth? Yo, that increases defense. Truly bad for my ADHD. Yeah, we're going to be traveling all over the place for a while. <laughs> what is that glowy little guy? Sunder Lion. Soaked in sunlight. Its petals can restore health depleted by gloom. Like my po oh hey oh oh it's you do you guys remember the crazy flower lady from 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 around the flower shrine where her flowers like hurt us she's still here what is it i'm busy tending this flower bed all around us is the best garden in hyrule have some respect and try not to disturb the plants too much the best garden oh are you a flower expert now Sure, it got a little messed up by the upheaval. But this is genuinely the best garden in Hyrule. Uh, Sorry. I have a bit of chip on my shoulder. I shouldn't let my temper get the best of me. Anyway, I'll get it back to tip-top shape soon. So until then, just look at it and imagine how it'll be when... Uh, it's well, uh, how it'll be when it's once again the best garden in Hyrule. So this is where the shrine was. This was her flower garden. Which means only one thing, in my opinion. I won't let you come back. She's going to kill me if I, I need to save first. In Breath of the Wild, she killed you if you fucked with her flowers. But yeah, I've got to burn it before it takes over the land. This is for Hyrule. Uh? Oh, ouch, that hurts. What are you doing? That's what the flowers you ruined would be screaming if they could scream. Uh? So listen to them and don't do such awful things. That's it. I expected more. Hmm. 
takes forever to load though she's back yeah does she say something different if you do it again though hot 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 yeah i am thank you she's gonna murder me let's just keep going this may take a few fire fruit but it's worth it burn for me burn it all down to the ground why is the flower garden bad uh in the original game she made a big flower garden that was full of thorns and it hurt you and it wouldn't let you get to the shrine what do you think you're doing the only things it's okay to fire our way are smoldering glazes <laughs> what kind of maniac goes around setting fire to wildfire wild wildlife i can't it's what the flowers you just ruined would be wailing if they could wail so please don't disturb the best flower bed in hyrule about that I'm oh, sorry, but... Help! We're burning! Can I not kill them? Does this just... No, it has to have an end point. It always has an end point. Nintendo work things out. She's going to murder me at some point. She's going to go full flower, flower blight. I want the horror scene. Is that what you were hoping to hear from us? Just leave us alone already. Thanks to Magda and Princess Zelda's fiery determination... We've grown into a blaze of color across the soil. Huh? As if your puny fires could burn us. You know nothing about the spirit it takes for we flowers to bloom so strong. That's what the flowers you ruined would be screaming if they could scream. Huh? So listen to them and don't do such awful things. Oh, they think they're stronger than fire? They're stronger than fire, are they? Let's see how they like... F oh, I'm too high. There's fucking trees in the way. Let's cut down the tree. What a plan. Up we go, up we go. And then we see just how strong these flowers are. Goodbye. I didn't even damage them at all. That's kind of shocking. Oh, am I just too far away? She only activates when you're close to her? Okay. They're gone! <laughs> Help, we're burning! They're finally gone. Goodbye, lady. It took a while, but we finally finally took out the flowers the garden will never come back you will never harm another stranger just hoping to get through the goddamn woods how'd they come back okay huh? they're super powerful who even is magda huh? okay you win lady you win it's fine wow i i got defeated by flowers kind of embarrassed <laughs> she's too strong yeah i'm not gonna lie the best karma would have been if i straight up like blew myself up with the bomb that's kind of what i was expecting when i had to get close to it my flowers actually died when we exploded them though i was so excited it's like finally i've defeated flower blight oh she defeated us alien pinecone grows on trees all over hyrule contains oil and burns well thrown into a fire to increase the intensity of the flame is this how I burn down a garden? No, we're not going back. Even I'm not that crazy. And I'm pretty crazy. I've done some wild things in my past. Can I climb up the root for this one? Aw, that was embarrassing. The Florax? Not the Florax. Oh shit, there's a flow. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, oh, God! Okay, let's deal with these guys properly. Oh, I'm out of stamina. They're so strong. Why do they have so much health? And they do a lot of damage too. Okay. This is fine. I'm fine. I've got mushrooms. I've got shish kebab. Dude, fine. Yeah, that arm is strong. 
I'm glad it does one more than one attack too. Everyone quiet. It could have been bad. It could have been real bad. We got through it. Bum, 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 bum. The burning grass on the side is that? I don't know how the flower survived. She said something. Who is Magda? She said Magda and Princess Zelda did something to keep them alive. I don't even know who Magda is. I don't remember that name. Unless her name's Magda. Oh, that's her name. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, unless her name's Magda. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck are these? Can they climb? They cannot climb. Okay, that's good. I do not like it. What the fuck? No, no, no. You stay down there. What the fuck was that? Dark clump. An unusual substance. It's cold to the touch. It seems as though it's filled with pitch black darkness. Use it in cooking to get a gloom resistant effect. Oh my god, that was terrifying. Did they only come out? Oh, I was so lucky. The sun just rose. Oh, so that's even worse than the skeleton creatures coming up at night. The, the fucking like critical shot on the hand still did like no damage to it. Eh. You were lucky? Yeah, I was. I had come a few minutes. I'm glad I spent so much time burning flowers. Otherwise, I probably would have died there. <laughs> fine, I'll fall. That's fine. God damn it. Let me up. Oh, and there's a whiz robe over there. Can I just ascend? No. Oh, but I won't be able to climb up this either. I don't have the stamina for it. Anything to grab him with my grabby hand? If I can make something. There's a tree down there. I've got a plan. Musky hands? Is that what you call them? That doesn't sound right, but... I'll believe you for now. I don't like the musky hands. They're a problem to me. I can't cut down that tree. Oh, there is a pine cone. What do I do with the pine cone? What the pine cone for? I clearly need to do something with this. Ah, okay. That makes sense. <laughs> a plan using a plant? Yes. A plant plan, if you would. But it didn't work because that wasn't the type of tree I needed. Mm. I have one stamina restoring item. How strong is it? It recovers barely any of a will. God damn it. Yeah, I'm not getting up there yet. That sucks. That sucks. If there was stuff near here I could use, I could lift myself into the air. I can make things. Oh, wait. I have Zonai devices. I have fans and wings. Let's try just a wing. Got a lot of those. So here's my plan. Bring this up here so it's stable. I lift it as high as I can. She's not very high. <laughs> Leave it up there for a few seconds. At least I get a bit of a boost. Maybe that'll be enough. Let's see. But maybe, yeah, you can reach. Maybe. Maybe. With the extra stamina, I'll use my stamina eating item too. We'll see. I think I might actually be able to do that now. Holy crap. 
having fun for the chat. I haven't been able to watch much because of work. Yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. I might not even have this need the stamina boost item. Yeah, I can definitely do this. But yeah, I've been having a lot of fun. There's a lot of like thinking involved in this game. If I jump right now. Fuck yes. Okay. Mordok shrine. Question is, am I even going to be able to do this shrine or will it require stamina like it required to get to it? <laughs> I was close. Yeah, that was at the absolute limit. I don't think I could have done that if I didn't use the zone eye device. They really make you think about things in this game. It's great. A bouncy device. That is indeed a bounce. Is it going to kill me? Are there any other items here? No, I I don't think I think I need a sailcloth. I don't think this is gonna work. I uh oh. Yeah, I'm screwed. That won't work for me. Hmm. Unless I move forward at the same time. Okay, step one complete. A bouncy device. What are you? Are you spring? You look like spring. Yes. You are spring. So if I move you... Go, go forward, go forward. Yeah. Okay. Step one done. <laughs> oh, it's so much higher. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be doing this. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to do this. How do I activate you? Oh, that's more springs. Can we get much higher? I don't think so. I think that's it. Oh, what if I put you sideways? Like, tilted. Ah? This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt a lot. Okay, I lived. I lived, bitch. Okay, so I need to send the ball back. Um, it's like this. Yeah. Um, um, um. How is this working? I'm not sure, but it is. Ah, oh, god damn it! This has got to be. Wait, place it better with this. Now do me. Oh, it's gonna land in there. No, it didn't quite land in there. That would have been cool. This might kill me. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> okay, we can't do this shrine. We were so close. We need a sailcloth. Um, we need a sailcloth. So you can apparently get the sailcloth at some point. Damn, man, that would have been fun. We, oh, we came so close. Okay, let's get out of here. At least we have it unlocked. We can teleport back here as soon as we get the sailcloth and finish the shrine. Splat. <laughs> yeah. What if you aim towards the wall? The wall's too solid. It would just, it would, with how far you have to go, I think you'd still die from full damage. There's probably some other way to choose that. But for now, like, I... Chest? But for now, I was happy with how much I cheesed it as is. I just have to get up to the top of there. Can you climb this? Or is there an ascend point? 
Oh, there's a rock wall. That'll help. Am I going to get stuck in there, though? <laughs> Is the next question. Oh, that's an ascend point if I've ever seen one. Nope, it's not an ascend point. Oh, dear God. I guess you have to climb from there. Do you want to hint on where to get? Nah. Nah, I'm sure if, like, if I start following the actual main path, I'll get to the Selkoth eventually. I'm just having fun exploring for now. So thank you for the offer, but yeah, I'll continue the main part. The main, like, plot and, like, direction in a while. But I'm just going to continue, like, exploring where I can for now. This is so stressful. Why is this so... Oh, yeah. I won't be able to drop in here without the sailcloth. <laughs> this shrine is really here for, like, anybody who's like, I want to grab some extra shrines on the way. Just to fuck you over, huh? Like, you should probably go find the ship sailcloth. Is that a spring? I don't know what that is. But there's a treasure chest. I want it. We lived, bitch. Now, can we get out? Is the question. Large Zonai charge. A Zonai charge with massive energy stored within. Put it in the Zonai events. Wait, am I stuck in here now? I just realized you're supposed to use the spring to get out, but I don't have a sailcloth. Um. Um. Put it right up against the wall. Um. Oh, grab the wall, grab the wall, leg, leg, leg. <laughs> I'm going to come back when I have a sail cloth. <laughs> uh, it's an interesting item, though. I've never seen one of those. <laughs> Shrine teleport? Yeah, that's the best way to do Oh, they put me back in here? Oh, I've got the item then. That's cool. <laughs> Um, uh, we've only been to this shrine so far, so thank god we unlocked that one first. If we'd come here first, that would have been a problem. Another floor splat. Yeah, we die a lot in this game, but it's all a learning curve. We're doing it, you know, to learn things as we go. Death counter, you know what? I can do one. You guys want one. Still set up for... anything. Let me reset to zero. Okay, one, two, three, four. We're on four, right? Okay, stable. Now we're going. Blue was another shrine, red was another shrine. Okay, we'll go to red and then to yellow. That'll lead us to the town and the main storyline. Let's, let's continue the main storyline now. We'll get our sailcloth and then we'll start exploring. <sighs> Is that from Wulong? Yeah, the 200 deaths was from Wulong. God <laughs> damn it. I'll hide them for most of the time because I don't want it on the screen all the time. But every time I die, I'll pop it back up and add a death to the counter so we know how far we've been dying. Bum, 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 bum. Get your horse. They literally said they didn't know me. What? That doesn't shoot an arrow? Oh, you live today, mister. Oh, you live today, mister. You can't outrun me, buddy. I'm the hunter. You're the prey. Why does it keep bringing out my Bobakin arm? I don't want to break that. The horses carry over. Oh. I'm about to have a horse. Come here. There you go. I have a horse. This is actually a really beautiful... God damn. So black with a white snout. We'll go register this one and we'll find out if they actually carried over. Because he told me he'd never seen me before. He asked if I'd... Oh my god, four stamina as well. That's really impressive. It's better than my horse glue. <laughs> Wait, horse glue? You named your horse glue? That's so sad. <laughs> Will this horse have a name? Yeah, we get to name it when we register it. So what do you guys want to name the horse? Stop ignoring me, horse. Don't terrorize Beetle. Calm down. 
There you go. I think I need to sell my stuff too. Because I'm going to need money to register the horse, so... Um, what do I sell? Oh, I can part with one opal. I don't, I don't like it, but I'll do it. I think you normally need 20 rupees to register a horse, so that should be fine. No, I'm good. Oh god, no, 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 you're still mine, you're still mine. There you go, there you go. Pull it, ho-ho. <laughs> that feels rude. Noir means black in French. We could name it Noir. We're not naming it Ligma. Come on, man. You gotta be more intelligent than that. You gotta give it more pizzazz. It's gotta be something funny. Seahole? Not sea. Oh my god. And every time I talk about it, I'd have to do the seahorse voice. <laughs> How can I help you? Register horse. Oh. You want to register, huh? According to our books, you're entrusted to horse to us once before. I'll just go ahead and register any horse that had your name on it. So it does keep your horses. Why didn't he just say he had my horses? Why did he even pretend I didn't have any horses? You want to register this? Yeah, sure. 434? Four, Fuck yeah. Mm. Only when you register a horse, we charge 20. Special promotion. You can do it for free. Oh, okay. Ooh. I didn't even need to sell the opal. I got a pony point. I got a PP. Well then, I'll move on to the registration process. First, choose a name. Oreo is cute. I like Oreo. It's black and white. That's cute. Call it Onyx, maybe. Onyx isn't too bad either. Ganon, because we want to ride him. <laughs> I quite like Oreo. Juan. Juan is a bit too... A bit too obvious. And Uma. Uma, like, just being Japanese for horse. Yeah, we'll go with Oreo. I think that's adorable. Our new friend, Oreo. There we go. Yes. Name registered. You want to take it? Well, let's board it for now, because let's see if it has got my old horses. I want to see if we've got Little Apple and, like, Epinus horse. Epinus? Oh. Zelda's horse and Epina. Oh. I haven't been to Kakariko Village out east. Located between two steep mountains. However, ever since those distinctive ring-shaped Zonai ruins landed there, things have been pretty lively. Oh, so that's Kakariko? They dropped Zonai ruins on their head? Damn. But we're going a different way. Oh. Welcome, Link. Do you want to register a horse or take one out for a ride? Take horse. Mm. Yay, Lafu! Ephra! And Zelda too. Oh, man. We have many choices. I and mean, I think I have to go for Zelda too. She's the strongest. We did just catch Oreo, though. Everyone is here. Yeah, we have two more spaces for horses. Zelda two. Yeah, Zelda the second. That's the Zelda I get to ride. That's the Zelda that Raru didn't steal from me. Which one do we want to ride today, guys? Everybody in chat, just say which one you want me to ride for now. Good old little apple. Why did they change his color? He was like a chestnut brown. It was like a dark brown. Oreo, Oreo, Epina, little apple, Epina. Oreo, Epina, apple. Mostly Oreo. Okay. New horse, new game. That's what we'll go for. Oreo's our new buddy. Oh. Thanks for waiting. Speaking of which, do you know about whistling? You get separated from your horse, you can whistle and come running. I did know about that. Your horse isn't magic. It can't hear you if you're too far away. Oh. Come back anytime. Okay, Oreo. Let's go. Huh. Got a new buddy. We're going on a new adventure. Where do we want to go? Red first. Good job, Oreo. I wonder if you can still fight on horseback. Yeah, you can. Sick. Oreo has good stats for the first one. Yeah, that was really lucky. Meat. I see meat. <laughs> Thank you, mister. <laughs> Why did the music suddenly change? I knew there was something here. These trees looked too weird. You lucked out with a really cool horse right away. I really did, yeah. I, I was immediately, I was just walking along saying like, I don't need a horse, I'll just walk there. And then a horse came over the mountain to me. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, wait. There we go. Hey, hey, you found me. Mama. Bye bye, little comfy Korok. What is that? Oh, it's more more random horses. Cool. 
I took your buddy with me. I hope you're... Ooh, another dragon. They're everywhere. Weep. Oreo sounds like a delicious snack. They are. They're a good horse. These are Oreo's old friends. Now he's my friend. We've got to build up our bond, though. Our bond is not very strong right now. The music of the gallop? Yeah. This is the Breath of the Wild. Well, yeah, this was the same Breath of the Wild soundtrack for the random things. Oh, there's another enemy area. What is that? Oh, a horseback for Koblen. See what you got. Yeah, you think you're a badass? See how badass you are. Yeah, I'm back in the area I'm supposed to be in. <laughs> Compare that to how bad the lizard flows were. This is the direction we're supposed to be going. <laughs> Let's clear out this camp. Give him an apple. Can I give him an apple? Oh yeah, you could do that in the other game. You could give them carrots as well. Here you go, buddy. Here you go, Oreo. You want? Yeah, good boy. Oh, he's so happy. There's another wild horse. There's a lot of wild horses around here. This is not going to end well. We just made as much sound as we could coming in here. <laughs> this is fine. What does that guy have on his back? He's got, like, spikes on his back. That's kind of terrifying. You got the prettiest one? Yeah, I like him a lot. Shit, not the head. There we go. Oh, they all saw me anyway. Um, hey, guys. You know what I need? I need flame emitter. Just set fire to everything. Yeah, come at me. I dare you. Burn you all to death. <laughs> Give me my items before they burn. There we go. Okay. Did I clear out this area yet? Nah, there's probably still some in that skull. Bum, bum, bum. Backpack for his applesauce? <laughs> That's cute. I like to think of the idea. That was fire fruit. Oh, he was going to be shooting fire fruit at me if I didn't knock him out. That's a lot of fire fruit. Thank you. you. Got any explosives in there? No, but there's only one of you. Is he eating meat? Oh, That's got to be my meat. I'm not going to save. We've gotten this far. Yeah, that's my meat, baby. Oh, there's another one. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, he has fire fruit. So they have... Now you can tell which one has special arrows because they just, like, carry around the items on their back. That's adorable. Sometimes they carry fruit or meat in the packs. Aw. They're just living life the best they can like us, man. Still going to kill him, but that's adorable. <laughs> oh, this is new. Is this a claymore? Yeah. Can't carry any more melee. I know. Two chests. Damn, we're starting off strong. Their screams are haunting, especially now that they've got adorable little things with them. Moblin sledge. Not bad. It's a spear, but it's not as strong as most of my weapons, to be honest. Uh, um, um, uh, it's better than a rock hammer. Drop that. There we go. And what's in chest number two? Amber. Hell yeah. Night. Nah, you can't crawl in there. It's just... Oh, you can! That's so cool. It gives you so many ways to deal with enemies and situa scenarios in this. Come on, Oreo. We can leave now, buddy. There you are. Yeah. Yo, you can do the Legolas mount now. That's so sick. Oh, we made it to the shrine. 
Don't go too far. That looks horrifying. Be careful, bud. Is this the town I was going to? Yeah. That's where the pin is. You could in Breath of Wild too. I must have never managed it. I feel like I tried that quite a bit and it just never happened. Bum, bum, bum. I remember you could like grab them from the back and just instantly start running. You could grab them from the side, but I never like managed to grab them while they were running and just like swing over behind them. Shape rotation. What is this? Oh, <laughs> it's literally the baby game. It's literally that thing that you give babies to learn like shapes. That's cute. That's a good idea. Tried what in Breath of the Wild? Um, tried to like grab a horse from the side while it was like moving. I need to like twist it so this is flat. There we go. Perfect. Legatus, my beloved. Um, <laughs> Legolas, my beloved. I read that as Legatus. I'm an idiot. Yeet! Okay. Getting trickier. This one's easy. <laughs> this one is just like head empty. Holy crap. I say it. Now I'm going to screw it up. That's the long side. Oh, I have to flip it. There we go. What about these one? The goddess. <laughs> it goes into the square hole. It goes into whatever hole it wants to. Oh, that's the shrine end. So I just need to get it into this hole too. But then there's an item up there. There's got to be. Ah. Oh, you can't climb it. Oh, not like that. Like this. Weep. There we go. You don't know the meme? Nah, I don't know any square hole meme. That confused me. Ooh, a hasty elixir. Speed up for a little while. Down we go. And now... I need to turn this... This kind of way. More like diagonal. Hmm. Like that and just like jam it in get it through one hole then second hole there we go yeah that was easy blah, 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 blah. he's a boomer you're damn well right i'm a boomer never once denied this in my life Doubt it's like that, probably. That's gonna be too tall to climb, haha. <laughs> but I'm gonna try, yeah. Yeah, okay. Need to put it down on its side. Bum, 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 bum. Other way around. No. There we go. Perfect. Wait, I wonder if I could have I could have just used recall <laughs> You can I feel like you can use recall to cheese most of the shrines now that I think about it I feel like I could have just like lifted that into the air and then From the medium side and just climbed up to the top Anyway That was fun <laughs> These shrines so far have been interesting. Oh, and I could have just used Ascend. Because it was like 
diagonal. I could, yeah, I could have put it. Mm, that's so sick. There's literally three ways to do that one that I can just think of immediately. Probably way more ways. That's another shrine. I'll go in there immediately, but I'll mark it. Hey, buddy. You feel awful? Iral huh. Field Chasm. Hey, traveler. I'd stay away from that stuff if you care about your health. Folks are calling it gloom. If you get any on you, you start losing your strength like it's sapping your life away. Hmm. I touched some gloom while poking around in the depths and now look at me. Well, the most of it will recover on its own little by little, so long as you're on the surface. But while you're in the depths, you won't recover at all. I think I was going to die down there. Ugh, some investigation leader I turned out to be. This is just pitiful. I'm completely reliant, reliant on Duvall, so I really want to recover by morning. Who's Duvall? That's probably Duvall. I'm going to avoid this goop. Bum, bum, bum. He has a freaking air balloon. Dude, that's badass. Oh. Oh. Hey, buddy. What's the big idea? You can't just walk up behind someone who's standing on the edge of a chasm. For one thing, a nasty accident like that would surely hold the research here. Yep. Chasm investigation is super important right now for the Zone I survey team. Even one researcher had to stop. Josha, who's hard at work on plans over at Lookout Landing, would cry. Not okay. Who's Josha? Oh. Josha's the cavern, chasm investigation leader. See that oh. tower over there? It's where you'll find our base of operations, and incidentally, Josha. Okay. Oh. She's a genius. Such a genius, in fact, that they say she's the next up-and-coming Pura. No way. You got another little baby being like, Shaky. <laughs> She's in charge of the depths and the chasm investigation team. But even so, Josha's still a kid. There's no telling what dangers are down there. As such, she's not allowed into the depths, so our Zonai investigation team is helping with the investigation. Chasm investigation. Oh. You know the giant holes that showed up after the upheaval? No. There are lots of them, just like this one, all over the world. You can't see the bottom. They're so deep, so filled with mystery. We must continue our research for the sake of our dear Josha. Oh, also, don't oh. startle me again. Deep in my investigation work at the moment. Okay. So I need to find a way to kill this guy. Okay. What have we got in our inventory? Oh, that might work. Like, yeah, that should work just like that. Do, do, do. Hmm. Guess the axe is the best thing to touch it with. He lied to me. He doesn't fall in there. <laughs> he lied to me. Can I unstake this from the ground? No. Fine, you keep your... What if I set it alight, though? Really? Oh, you can pick it up. Oh, my God. You can walk around with it. Your hot air balloon sucks. Oh. oh. No, traveler, don't do it. If you touch that, well. Uh, hello? It will sap your strength. You end up like me. Too sluggish to move. Okay. God. Creepy shit. Where's my horse? <whistles> Let's mark this on the map, though. This is important. Leap pin. But also, no, not you. No, right here. Um, cavern, cavern. Make that cavern. Come on, buddy. Where are you, Oreo? There we go. Okay. Yeah. Let's continue the story. Ooh. Fruit. <laughs> like, let's continue the story unless dazzle fruit. Fruit charged with powerful light. Break it down, unleash dazzling sparkles that blind any monsters nearby. Throw material. Select an inventory from your... Oh. You just throw things? What do I want to throw? I've got a lot of flint. Oh, sick! So you don't always need to use your bow. Can I, like... Where am I... Bright fruit. 
ones that make light. Oh, giant. There's the one. Oop. Yeah. Oh, sick. Okay, that's going to save a lot of arrows. Can't believe they didn't tell me that earlier. <laughs> well, at least now we know. Finally teaches you? Yeah, that's cool. I wonder why it took so long. I'm hearing a blood moon. I'm hearing a blood moon. That's not cool. Well, this is fine. Oh, I'm sure I'll use the axe. I love that my shield does damage too. Give me the honey. The bees are going to kill me now. <laughs> Run! Oreo! Oreo, where'd you go? Oh, God. Join me, Oreo. Yeah, that's early for a blood moon. That's wild. I haven't even gotten to the first town yet. Is that what it is here? Blood moons rise. Well, I'm witnessing it. When its red glow shines upon the land, the aimless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. That's way scarier than it was before. What the fuck were those things? Just as they did. That's a big boy. Well, they made that a lot creepier than it was before. Jeez. Oh, God, the bees. Come on, Oreo. Good oh boy. Oh, God. I'm so proud of you. No idea how much you just saved my life. Get out of my way. Yeah, that's what I thought. Fear me. <laughs> Can we take a nap during the blood moon? If we do, things don't go well for us, I'd imagine. <laughs> Link. Oh, finally, people who recognize me. I thought everybody forgot about the hero of Hyrule who saved the day. It's you. You're back. Where, where have you been? Aww. Best that anyone saw of either you or Princess Zelda was when you went to investigate the gloom. And then the castle rose in the sky, and everyone's been so worried about what happened to you both. Pur has nearly worn herself out trying to figure out where you two went. Okay. Pur is working at that large building over there. Uh. Please, report to her right away. She'll want to see that you're all right. You get out of the way of my horse. How dare. Huh? Someone recognizes us? Finally. Look out, landing. You know what? Maybe I shouldn't be on the horse right now. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. No, no, I want to go see Pura. What the heck does Pura... What's she been up to? She made a Pura plaid, so she's been doing some interesting things. You can't go any faster, buddy? Damn it. Fine, go around. Oh, oh, oh. Is Matt Mercer everyone? No. <laughs> Where did you hear Matt Mercer other than Ganondorf? Hmm, this present. Oh, yo, little old man. I remember you. Oh. Robbie, that was your name. You used to make me ancient arrows. Oh, what an excellent night. Oh. Hey, hey, you. Where have you been? Robbie, head of Pura Pad development. What the hell does Pura do then? Well, I guess she's examining the depths. No, wait, it was the other person, isn't it? What? Don't answer that. Tell me later. For now, you should hurry and go talk to Pura. She's been in a tizzy ever since you and the princess disappeared. She's in the building with the telescope up on the second floor. Go see her and give her some peace of mind, will ya? Okay. Why do they have part of a thingy thing? They have part of a hot air balloon. I like his hair. I like him. He's fun. Kind of wild. And who are you? What? Oh, you're Josha. Yeah, you're just a bit bigger than Pura. That hair, those eyes. Da, da, Doc? Oh. Dr. Pura, the swordsman. The swordsman has returned. Yeah, get her out here. She needs to power up my Pura pad. It can't take pictures anymore. <sighs> okay. Now, where have you been? Linky. You're not a ghost, are you? She has a voice, and she grew up. Hey. That 
That looks interesting. Can we talk about the tights? Take off the silly mask. One step at a time. Oh no. What exactly happened? She's hot. <laughs> and she has a hundred years of experience. How long have I been asleep again? Oh god. So she's hot. It's clearly been a while. She looks like six when we last saw her. Maybe even four. So when she you was and tiny. Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle. And she has a voice now. You discover a mysterious mummy. Before she never got like voice lines. She just had this sketchy. Suddenly reanimates. Wonder if she's still gonna say it. Then Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. Yep. Lost my wife. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. All I know is it wasn't a fun time for me. Then, later, you wake up on a sky island, saved by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. Hmm. You get the Pura Pad from an unusual creature. A robot? Yes, you'd be interested in them. And learn that your new arm belonged to someone named Ravu. The Master Sword disappears. You hear the princess's voice and find your way here. Maybe I should have stopped playing right before this. <laughs> Since then they do like a whole catch up. <laughs> that would have been the perfect place to start a new part, but okay. Nice summary. Yeah, considering we literally just did that for the last five and a half, five and a half hours. Oh my God. Um, for the last several hours, we'll say. That was pretty random. Then... What? Are you saying you came from up there? I love her voice too. She sounds so... Valley girl. <laughs> Which is perfect since we had like... Well, even when she was a child, she did the whole like... Checky! One, two, three! Scoot! Like that kind of shit. This Rao you met. I think that's what the first king of Hyrule was named. Really? Hmm. Are they one and the same? So much of that doesn't make sense. Yet, but I'm certain that mummy you found on the castle must be related to the upheaval. We've had the calamity, the fall, and now the upheaval. The castle rising up, the ruins falling down from the sky. The mummy must be connected to it somehow. Ah. And then there's the most important detail of all. You're sure that you heard the princess speak to you? And she gave you a clear message to find her. That truly was the princess. And that means she's alive. Maybe she's trapped beneath the castle and you tell I just realized the little girl standing next to her. Her face is amazing right now. <laughs> oh, wait. That's Erica Linebeck, the good person who does Sakura. Oh, Linbeck. The person who does Sakura. Sakura from Naruto? That's what... That makes sense, actually. I can kind of hear it. That's wild. That settles it. I know you only just returned, Link. You call me Linky. How dare you call me Link? Especially now you call me Linky. God, that, look at the heels. Fuck. But I need you to meet with the search party up at Hyrule Castle. They've been searching tirelessly for you two. The captain in charge of the search is named Haas. Work with him to find the princess as quickly as you can. I know that mummy may still be lurking somewhere around there. Which is concerning to say the least. We have more immediate problems to deal with right now. I'm counting on you, Linky. There we go. Much better. What is this? Oh, we've got character profiles now. She is, yeah, she's used herself as a test subject. Look at the little baby version. There she is. She has used herself as a test subject in her experiments. Despite being over a century in age. <laughs> she reversed her aging to the extreme and actually looked like a child not too long ago. Yeah, look at his baby. Look at that little gremlin. That's what she was like in Breath of the Wild. She was adorable. Now she's mommy. Hey, how are you doing? Plus, she has a century of experience. Imagine what she knows how to do. Goddamn. This is everyone's new waifu, isn't it? The eyeshadow. The pouty lips. The hips. Okay, I'm gonna go find Zelda before I do something that Link should not do. Onward! Hey, what was that? Oh, it's a fish. There we go. Nice Hyrule bass. No more ancient ones. For Chan Lamau. 
You were all thinking it. Let's be honest here. You all knew exactly what was going on. Come on, Oreo. It's hard to believe these ruins just fell from the sky. I mean, they're the same. They're from the Age of Legends, and now they're here. It's also strange, huh? Ah. Yeah, it sure is. But it's also a great opportunity. All of us on the Zonai Survey team should count ourselves lucky. If it weren't for the upheaval, this never would have happened. Not that anyone knows what the upheaval even is. While Pura is investigating the upheaval, she certainly will provide clues about it, Princess Zelda. But progress isn't great, I've heard. Aww. Is the princess all right, wherever she is? These ruins right here are an exceptional. But really, who cares about that at a time like this? He's so grumpy. Why is Oreo not... Oh, Oreo has to go all the way out of town to get to me. You got this, Oreo. <laughs> Spread the lineage first, Fuchan. <laughs> hey, man. They're doing their best. Here comes Oreo. Look at the man. Le yeah, I'm tiny. I can't help it. It's what I am. It's who I am. Wh where did Oreo go? Um. <whistles> Oreo, get lost. <laughs> There's Oreo. Good job, buddy. I I'm going to climb this real quick. I just realized I should climb. There's something up there. But I'll be back for you in a second. Oreo trying his best. Yeah, he is. He had a bunch of stuff to get around. What is this? Hey. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. It's been a while. This is a crystal refinery. I can take your crystallized charges. Oh, God. I don't have nearly enough yet. Okay. I I'll be back. Don't worry about it. Um. Oreo. Let's go. Onward to the castle. Or you're like, bitch, why you leave me? Hey, I had to climb some things. I was doing important... Oh, a shrine. I was doing important things for the sake of Hyrule. What is that? Chloe. Oh, it's another silent princess. I dedicate this monument to the memory of the souls lost to the community. It, c calamity, even. She even left a flower. That's cute. Hey, buddy. What are you up to? You have my support. Well, give me money then. Oh. Ow, you dick. That's not support. F support. Supportful? Supporting. Supportable. Oh, 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 darn it all. President Hudson, are you okay? Oh, yeah, that is Hudson on the sign. We stole the flower. Hey, I need it. I need to cook it with things. Oh, no. What have I done? All right. I'm sorry, President Hudson. I won't let you fall over again. That was unforgivable. It's all your fault. You're not even looking at me. Startling me like that. Yes, I know it's just a sign, but I have great respect for President Hudson. So I pin the blame on you. Unforgivable. You haven't heard about Mr. Hudson? He's the president of our construction company. He's the one appointed by the princess herself. She placed him in charge of putting those material caches everywhere. And now he's shouldering Hyrule's restoration. Of course, he's also the founder of Hudson Construction. And besides all that... Yeah, I know. He built me my house. He was kind of... Wait, didn't he? I feel like Hudson built my house. Uh, hey, I'm right in the middle of Pre President Hudson's epic tale of heroism. Well, fine. What was I doing before? I don't want the others getting jealous. So I haven't spread the world around. President Hudson gave me an extra special mission. That's to put up these signs all over the place that let everyone know that Hudson Construction is a big deal. These aren't your ordinary signs, as you can clearly see. These portray Mr. Hudson himself in detail. Noble, glorious detail. <laughs> He's even done his hair the same way as him. That's adorable. I thought so. Yeah, he was the one who moved to Tarrytown after. Okay, that was Hudson. It's unforgivable for even one of these to fall over. And so, <laughs> I've pledged to support him. Don't worry, Mr. Hudson. I am here for you. But I can't stand here forever. I've got so many signs to spread around. I don't know what to do. Try letting go. What? Are you going to support him? All right, I'll let go. I meant like let go of the, the you know, the psychosis you're going through right now. The attachment to a person who doesn't care about you, you simp. Oh, unforgivable. <laughs> yeah, he's got a lemon grab feel to him. You're right. <laughs> President Hudson. Oh, 
support you. So I have to fuse things to this to keep it up par. Keep pressing the I'm never going to get used to that. Um, I don't know. Let's just j -j 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 jam it in. Oh, another rock fell down. Let's put this here. Can I not attach? Oh, maybe I'm not. I have to just like build things around it. Huh. Okay. Maybe I need like a foundation. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, ba, dum. I love how he's not worried about the fact that I'm just randomly moving things around with my mind. Um, boop. So it falls this way, so. I mean, logically, that should be fine, right? There's no way that sign is heavier than this. Um, I'll just add, add something else heavy. No, not you. You. The triangle is the greatest of all directions. There we go. Let's just lock this in here. Yeah, that has to work. What is it? I need to stay focused. President blah, 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 blah. Can you not bother me? Try letting go. What? Are you going to support him? All right, I'll let go. Yeah, baby. He's standing. How is the president standing? That was brilliant. I would have never thought of it. All right, let's get him secured while he's still landing. Standing. Just put this right here. Get, get that fastened. And it's on the builder. Why are you making this so complicated? On That's so many stakes in the ground. Holy frick. Well, that's not coming out anymore, at least. <laughs> Dude, are you blind? I know, right? He's like, how did you do that? What did you do? I mean, I just put things together in front of you. Perfect. I love his face. And his hair is amazing. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. Oh, it fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Take this with my thanks. Got a red rupee. <laughs> also, you must be hungry after all that hard work, right? Well, let me give you a little something I made myself. Yo, veggie rice balls. This homestyle dish of Kakariko Village. Cute. Ah. Oh, but I still don't feel like I thanked you enough. This is a little something for my premium collection. A special gift from me to you. Sleep of it. A lodging voucher for a regular stable bed. Oh, cool. Ah. Now I could go to other places to put up more signs. And with that, come off. E is very dedicated. I'll give him that. Oh, now this is here for nothing. Damn it. It doesn't. Orsi, come back. Don't be afraid. I won't hurt you. Again. Probably. For now. <laughs> Let's be honest. I might. Let's go get to that shrine. We. So he did see. I guess. Yeah. He's just a weird, weird person. There you go, Oreo. Good job. You did great. Kionis Shrine. Kyononis. Kyononis Shrine. Wow. You scared my Mill? Mill. You scared me. What are you doing at such an hour? Hyrule Castle Chasm is nearby. It's dangerous, you know? Well, I know this shrine could be dangerous, too. I'd say most things are dangerous these days. What with the upheaval? Watch your back. Okay, later. I've already seen the chasm. Check this shit out. What do you think about that? You want to go in? Oh, was that opening there before? How could I have missed it? Um, oh, what is it? We're close to the chasm. Okay, okay, chasm. Trial. Go away. I'll, I'll do this. Don't worry about it. <sighs> Looks like Millie. Yeah, Millie and Kyo are hanging out together. Millie right by the Kyo Shrine. It's a good time for everybody. Okay, what you got for me this time? Oh, it's combat training. Okay. Let's get ready then. Moblin horn time. Come at me. Oh. 
why does this feel like the roblox one wait roblox i hope not did you know you're close to the chasm i kind of figured that out <laughs> this shrine purifies the ancient evil you who have entered here heed my instruction use a side hop to avoid enemy attacks this will create an opening that you can use to strike back i know how to do that game but okay um I don't want to make, waste my rare weapon if we're doing this. Come at me. Yeet! Oh, too early. Come at me. Yeet! There we go. Do a backflip to avoid enemy attacks and create an opening to strike back. A gremlin duo? Yeah, for real. No wonder we have to fight. Oh, I'm about to get wrecked. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Um, yeah, I'll use this now. Yeet! There we go. One, two. Let's not waste durability, actually. You can repel an attack if you parry with your shield at just the right time. Strike back in the opening you create. Do a flip? Yeah, he literally told me, hey, do a flip. Too early. Ooh. Boom! Damn it! Too early. Too late even. Ooh. Boom! Damn it! He spin, then he strike. Damn it! He spin, then he strike. Oh my god, I'm so bad. There we go. Build up your power and then release it to unleash a charge attack. Catch your enemies in this motion to damage them. Skill issue, Fuchan? I've literally not fought this enemy before. I mean, yeah, it is a skill issue. There we go. I, I, that was my first time, man. It's media primero. Your mastery of these techniques has earned you access. Proceed within. Oh, is that still a trial to do? Zone I charge. Construct bow. Yeah, drop that one. Don't mind if I do. Imagine doing it perfectly. <laughs> I imagine a lot of people did. I mean, it's all the same stuff from Breath of the Wild. I'm just not smart. Oh my god. Zoanite sword. A Zoanite sword made of Zoanite. Resonates with attached Zoanite devices, so slightly increases its attack power. Oh, so this is like extra good with fusion things. Um, oh, I can drop the rusty one. Damn it. There we go. Got a Zoanite sword now. Oh, it's all glowy. Nice. You're very smart. Maybe just a tad bit clumsy. Yeah, my I definitely have the boomer reaction speed. <laughs> Light of blessing. Damn, we're almost up to a new heart already. We got three out of four. It's a good start. May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. Farewell, Link. It's a pizza cutter. I mean, it do kind of look like one. It kind of looks like a fish slice. Hmm. Well, like one of those things you cut up pie with. Either way, I like it. It's glowy. One more shrine completed. There was something in the middle of the fountain when I did this. Something glowed orange up there. Did I imagine that? I mean, I can't. Oh, I can't. Yeah, there's. Oh, it's just a rock. <laughs> I knew it. The family. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I had to put the rock somewhere, little guy. You were kind of in the middle of everything. That's, that's on you. Note on the table. Bura has sent urgent orders from Lookout Landing for all of us on the Monster Control Crew. As Hyrule Castle continues to float, she's tasked us with searching the area beneath it for Princess Zelda. Be aware that the gloom has spread even more in this area. Prepare yourself before you depart. Captain Haas. Probably should have given that more of a manly voice. What are you? Traveler's Shield. Awesome. Traveler's sword, also rusted. Not great. 
Do I have anything super weak? Nope, you can keep your traveler's sword. <laughs> I feel bad laughing at that. Don't feel bad. That was funny. <laughs> Wait, is this Hoz? Come on, buddy. There you go, Oreo. Are you Hoz? Blink. No, you're not Hoz. Is that really you? When did you get out of the castle? I'm so ashamed. I've been on watch duty the whole time and I didn't see you at all. Mm. Oh, I've really got to get serious about my training. Captain Hawes doesn't know that you're back, does he, Link? You should report to him right away. He's on the Great Tower at the top of the hill past the lower gates. Mm. I'm sure the captain will be just as surprised to see you as I was. Yeah, you weren't even looking in the right direction, idiot. There we go. Here's a good buddy. I don't think you're getting through this one, bud. But let's see. Yeah! Nah, I guess I have to do this one alone. Oh. Oh. There we go. You're good, buddy. Nothing dangerous. Just me messing around. It's fine. It's fine. Are you Captain Hawes? Oreo knows? Yeah, Oreo's scared. <laughs> Hey, this area is off limits while we conduct our search for Princess Zelda and Link. <sighs> this guy's an idiot. <laughs> you can't just come wandering in here like that. Oh, Link, it's you. I'm sorry, I had no idea you had returned. I mean, if you're back, then does that mean we don't need the search party anymore? Uh, you should go talk to Captain Hawes. He's leading search efforts here from the first gate of the house, blah, blah. You'll find it at the very end of this road. Considering he didn't mind that the gate randomly opened, the gate he's supposed to be protecting. You're terrible at your job, Ross, I know. Hope you know that. I hope you get fired. It's okay, buddy. About that guy. I know, right? It took him so long to realize I was here. It was me. I was the link all along. Hey, buddy. You want to have a chat? Uh, Link? No, it can't be him. I can't allow anyone past there. This area is restricted to only those involved in the search. This is by direct order of Captain Hodge. If you insist on passing, you'll need permission from the captain. You should be in the first gate house up at the end of the road. Okay. End of the road. You got it, buddy. Yeet! <laughs> Oreo sounded so angry with me there. Just a little... <laughs> missing Link. It's always missing Link hours. Oh, we've turned up nothing in there that would help us find the princess. Ah, you're the spinning image of Link. I bet if Captain Hawes saw you, he'd be so sorry he might even fall off the gatehouse. Am I about to kill Captain Hawes? Oreo tired. Yeah, he's sick of me just running around, jumping on him, heading off elsewhere. Do, 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 do. Axe time. Arrows for days. There's a missing link joke in there somewhere. Yeah. Zelda 2, the missing link. God, there's so many people. I'm done talking to them. Where is Captain Hawes? You will tell me. There's no one in that tent, okay? You will tell. There's no one in that tent either. Um. Does anyone work at this gatehouse? Over this way? Where? It says it's here. Oh, oh, he's right here. Nope, this is Purpen. God. Just like I thought. The weapons here have all decayed too. Nice fedora. I wonder if they're... Milady, I wonder if there are any intact weapons left anywhere in the world. What about the weapons? Hey, it's a new face. During the upheaval, all the weapons, swords, spears, claymores, you name it, suddenly disappeared. I've explored many regions in search of weapons that might still be intact. I found none. At this point, I'd be surprised if there were any intact weapons left in Hyrule. Those are a real pain to repair, so the best thing to do is strengthen them. Milady. Goodbye. It says it's like somewhere, right? Is that new? Soldier's broadsword. That's actually a pretty good base weapon. Um, 
God, I have so many good weapons right now. You're, you're fine. Where is this guy? It says he's like right next to me. Is he above me? Maybe. Let, let, let's try. Ah, um... oh, it's too far away. But maybe if I climb up here. Oh, oh, oh. He did say at the top. Did he say at the top? God. I'm a freaking idiot. Oh, let me just appear out of the ground in front of him. I should give him a nice little fr- Hey, there we go. You look like a captain. Sorry, but I'm in the middle of something. Huh? Wait a minute. Those supple thighs. That beautiful, luscious hair. Link? Is that you? You're alive! And all in one piece, it looks like. Does that mean Princess Zelda is safe too? About that. Oh, what a relief. Yeah, I kind of lost her. Huh? Hang on. You're alone? Oh, but you heard the princess calling out to you and you're here to help with the search? I see. Or maybe I don't. I'm a little confused, but that doesn't matter right now. What matters is continuing our search for Princess Zelda. Oh. I'm relieved to see you come up here and help us, though. We needed some good news. The sheer amount of gloom has gotten overwhelming. Our work carries on, but we've been a bit dead in the water. Captain! It's Princess Zelda! Wait, what? That do be Zelda. Mm -hmm. Unless it's the other one from, like, the paintings and the statues, and she's just cut her hair like Zelda, she has different clothes. Princess Zelda! Is she safe? What's she doing over there, though? Oh, <laughs> wait a damn minute. <laughs> wait, what? She just straight up looked at us and was like, I must go. My people need me. <laughs> you saw that too, Link? Because I don't think I ate any of the weird mushrooms. I think I only ate the Hylian shrooms. You saw Princess Zelda turn into light and fly off, right? How strange. <laughs> This is an emergency situation. She's been kidnapped by the sun, Link. We need to fight the sun. <laughs> Why would she leave without saying a word to us? We need to let Pura know about this as soon as possible. Considering what we just witnessed, I think it makes sense for us to withdraw. But it's going to take a bit. Basically, I don't want to do work anymore. I mean, you're here, and Zelda just basically said to screw ourselves, so... I'm going to go have a nap. You can deal with this shit now. Please, you must tell Pura about what happened here as soon as possible. Or else. <laughs> He's really just instantly like, everyone, let's withdraw. That's enough for me for one day. <laughs> Seen enough shit. Kind of want to go to where she was. But can my horse get out here? Oh dear God, I'm going to die. Yeah. I could probably open that door with my hand, right? That's the wrong thing. Go to the sky. Yeah, she just seemed to float off to the sky. I cannot open that with my hand. I guess you're staying here, buddy. I'll call for you someday. I guess you can find... Oh, my God. That was further down than I thought it was. It's just side siddle over here. <laughs> there we go. Your girlfriend became the sun. That's rough, buddy. <laughs> Sounds pretty rough. Come on, Oreo. Find a way to me. I'm gonna go save my girlfriend. I wonder if Oreo will actually be able to find their way to me. I hope so. No, I just lost a horse. Not the Avatar <laughs> reference. It had to happen. My girlfriend became the sun. Sokka's girlfriend only became the moon. At least the moon is gentle and soft. Sun, on the other hand. That's spicy. That shit hurts. I love Sokka. Sokka, best boy. Sokka kept all of the comedy going in that show. Am I going to be able to get up here? Yes. Goodbye, Oreo. Yeah, we never saw Oreo again. 
Oreo was just like, I've done enough. Lizard! Oh, it got away from me. This was dumb. She's very hot, at least. I mean, that's one way to put it. There we go. Up we go. Oh, it's just a Korok puzzle? I thought she'd leave, like, a weapon or something. She did look this direction. And now it kind of looks like there's an arrow pointing in that direction. Yeah, you found me. Bye-bye. It looks like it's pointing out that way. There's a shrine out that way. Mark that. Tower thing. Maybe she went to the tower. Or to the Sky Island. There's a lot of things out in that direction. Interesting. Well, my girlfriend became the sun and ditched me. Oh, is that a whiz robe? Damn. I could really use... <laughs> You know what? I'm just going to teleport. I already lost my horse anyway. I'll just go see Pura. This is easier. <laughs> the happy sucker found happiness, but damn. Yeah, it took him a while. That's rough, buddy. Yeah, it is. It's fine. If I get the sailcloth, that'll be a good time to end this. But I... I mean... Maybe after talking to Pura, we'll see. This has been quite a long quest so far. How long have we been? Oh, it has been six hours. Okay. Yeah, this seems like a good time to wrap it up. We'll talk to Pura. Which direction was she? Is she backwards or forwards? Backwards. That's the castle. Um, Oreo, are you close? Oh, I think Oreo actually heard me. It didn't say your horse was too far off. No. My horse isn't even on the map. Okay, I'm on my own. Short stream, he said. I mean, we're still going to do Zatsudan after this too. <laughs> so it may turn into like a six and a half hour stream, but yeah, it wasn't like a 12 hour stream. It, was, it wasn't the longest stream. <laughs> I miss Oreo. Me too, man. It's six hours. How crazy is that? The gate is closed, so Oreo's stuck. No, I opened this gate. The gate by Oreo, like, wasn't in the direction that Oreo needed to travel. Oreo just, I think, went to sleep. They're not even on my map anymore. Oh, no, they are. Oh, they did start to come to me. They got to the bridge. Oreo. They'll meet me. Damn, the whistle works really far now. Oreo is a fucking champ. You feel fine? Why not? Exactly. That's what matters. Proud to say I've watched all six hours. Thank you. Is this statue talking to me? Wait. Wait. Okay. Those were ghosts and others out there. Ooh, arrows. <gasps> Wait a minute. God damn it, Robbie. What do you think you're doing? Ow. Josha needs those for her chasm research. Don't touch any of it without her permission. I'll get in big trouble if you do. Okay. She has Zoanite. Oh, man. Creepy statue. Yeah, that's a very creepy statue. Oh, there's the Pura pad on the wall. About the map, about pictures. You can use pictures? I haven't let me use pictures yet. Put up the camera and put the poor pad. Do so and you can save a target. Object. Uh-huh, okay. Really? I can assure you that I've now tried every button. You cannot take a picture with the poor pad. I've been lied to. Now let me talk to Pyre. Not Pyre. Pyre's at Kakariko. Let me talk to Puda. Hmm. Link, well, did you find anything? Oh, you have to unlock it? Why do they have a tutorial what? on it then? Damn it. You're telling me Princess Zelda was at the castle and then she transformed into a lion and flew off? Link, you need to stop eating random things you pick up off of the ground. God damn it, you're wild. But if you're telling me that's what you saw, then I've got to believe it. Sounds like we need to change our approach. Since the princess flew off, maybe we should redirect our efforts and dig into the upheaval. For now, at least. I've already got a few regions in mind to start exploring. I bet we'll pick up clues about where she flew off to as we look around. Oh, yeah. You still got the pyrapad, right? Can I see it? For oh, now she's gone on. Oh, God, I feel like an idiot. 
It's a little worse for wear, but seems to be functioning fine. Map, map, map. Aha! Alright, I forgot to that before we could look at your overall map of Hyrule. We need to add map data from right around Lookout Landing. For that, we need our Skyview Tower. Tosha, what's the status of the Skyview Tower right now? Let me see. <laughs> God damn it, though. Mm -hmm. How dare. She's so chill about Zelda just flying off. Yeah, she's just like, okay. Zelda did some weird shit. We'll, we'll deal with that later. Outwardly, this structure looks so looks to be complete. It is a big tower. What is it for? Ah, but the travel point is still undergoing final adjustments. Hmm. Travel point needs tweaking. Sounds like I better get cracking. Sorry about this, Linky. I'll fix it up quick, so just hang tight. In the meantime, why don't you rest up? You must be pretty tired. The emergency shelter is just the spot for you. It has free beds and a kitchen, so it's well stocked for getting some rest and rejuvenation. If you want more info... Do -do -do -do. Talk to the soldier who's watching over everything from the center. Right where the emergency shelter entrance is. Oh, the stairs? If you need clothing for your travels... <gasps> clothes? We should go to Mub Shop. Okay. Why does she sound like that? Because she's grown up now. She's like a valley girl. <laughs> I'll be over by Skyview Tower. So when you're ready to head out, just let me know. Yes. All right, Josha. Let's work on our final preparations for the tower. I'll head to the travel point. Check it. Check it. Oh my God. She grew up so much. Before she did the whole like, hickey. Now she's like, check it. <laughs> Josha, you're in charge of the switch. Woohoo! Okay, Doc, you can count on me. Oh, I can't believe we're still doing child labor, but now it's not even a 100-year-old child. Okay, into the, the bed I go, I guess. This is... These are not downward stairs. Glad to have you back, Link. My name is Scorpus. You look badass. I have been charged with managing Lookout Lunding. If you have any questions about the place, any at all, come right to me. I'll answer as best as I can. Ah. Now, please, allow me to open up the emergency shelter. Sure did grown up. Yeah, it's cute that she still uses the same line, though. That's adorable. Mustache is cool. Yeah, facial hair on point. Oh, Yo, it's me. Open up. There we go. Scorpius is such a cool name. Yeah, sounds like Scorpion. Very badass. What the frick is this? royal families and their secret exits ah. i was gonna say oh it's just a shelter i thought it was like an exit this underground vault used to be an emergency shelter for the royal family now we're making constant use of it feel free to make yourself at home in our vault use any equipment you want okay no ladder though i don't do ladders ladders are for wusses i don't want to talk to you Look at all this dust. I mean, you're underground, woman. It's probably never going to be... You sure you want to keep cleaning that? Oh. Hey, I know that face. Any face I know is the face of a friend. Please, Link, help yourself to anything in the shelter. It's all yours to use as you see fit. But don't you dare go making a mess. I spend so much time cleaning in here and there's still endless amounts of dust. Where does it even come from? Again, underground. Um, okay. Um, do I want to... Where's this bed they spoke of? There's the cooking pot. Hmm. Oh, there's the weapons. Ooh. A Boko Reaper. I mean, don't mind if I do, but what do I trade for it? I guess I've got a two-handed axe. I don't need a stone axe. Later. Boko Reaper. Nine damage. Let's go. You are less clothed than me. <laughs> That's saying something. Oh, goddess statue. Oh, there's the beds. Perfect. Until morning. Bunker gave me the ring flashbacks. It's because of the well-like structure. I mean, we literally jumped down a well earlier. <laughs> what if Link talks to them with no clothes on? They normally just say things like, well, interesting look you've got there. It's fine. I just want to go talk to Pura. I want... To see where this story goes. It doesn't feel like a good ending point yet. I feel like there's going to be a good ending. There she is. I feel like there's going to be a good ending point coming up. But right now, it's like, no. Nah. It doesn't work with me just going to bed. 
If I put this here, then that goes there. No, no, that's not quite right. Uh -huh. That should do it. That sounded worrying. Oh, it's Sheikah Slate technology. Hey, Link, you all set? I just wrapped up here myself. The travel point is working fine now. Or it will be, once you do your part. You look so disheartened. <laughs> hey. We're ready, Josha. Pull the switch. <laughs> Kronk, hey. throw the lever. Is this her daughter? No, it can't be. We haven't been gone for that long. She's just so much like her. It's crazy. She even speaks the same way. She's so pretty. Yeah, Pura's gorgeous now. It's crazy. I mean, you live for a hundred years. You learn to take care of yourself. What? The fuck? That was not what I expected. So is this the new way to explore? Oh, yeah. To mark maps. I, I thought it was going to, like, examine the area, but... They're launching flares. I looked away for three seconds. Yeah, she hit the fan. <laughs> Look away for three seconds and suddenly Pora's launching an orbital space cannon. Except the opposite. An orbital Earth? No. Oh. A cannon into space. All of the Skyview Towers have now been activated. Oh, we don't even have to explore. They're just good to go. Do I just get the full world map? Yeah. Okay, Link. Your turn. What do you want? Ah. Go hold the Pura pad over that terminal. All right. It looks like a Sheikah one, though. Pura is NASA now. <laughs> Pretty much. It'd be cool if we get the whole map at once. I guess they do have like different layers and things now. They have the underground thing and the sky thing. Yeah, that makes sense. Hopefully we didn't hit Zelda doing that. <laughs> Imagine if we just knocked Zelda out of the sky while she was light. All right. The Skyview Tower is now active on your map. That means you can now use this travel point to get here anytime instantly. Awesome. Same is true for every Skyview Tower you add to your Pura Pad. <laughs> Impressive, right? Yes. He remade the towers from Breath of the Wild, which should still be around. What happened to the towers? Why are you giving me that look? Oh, God, she's giving me bedroom eyes, and I'm not sure how I feel about it. But Skyview Towers are about more than just traveling quickly. Their primary function is to survey the area, or more simply put, to make a map. The Pura Pad works with the Skyview Tower and scans the topography directly onto the map. Oh, we still do have to collect the maps. I thought you just activated all of them. Pretty great, huh? Hmm. Only thing is you need a paraglider when... Oh, thank God I kept going. When you're scanning. It takes a lot of skill and nobody here had what it takes. To be honest, that's why we haven't tested this out yet. We needed you... Wait. Is she going to fire me out of the cannon? Which brings us to this. Paraglider! Yay! I feel so much safer. This item given to you by Pura lets you ride the wind and glide through the sky. Press X in midair to activate it. Ah. Right. It showed up, Madam, stop pointing at me. You're doing things to me. Let's start with a test scan. Mm -hmm. Now, it's time for our very first test launch. I mean, our first test. <laughs> she is going to launch me. Just step over there into the circle and find me afterward, all right? She's not even warning me what's going on. I'll be observing from the research lab. When the yeah. test scan is over, we'll have a final briefing on the search for Princess Zelda. And I'll need to update your map with the places where the upheaval has wrecked the most havoc. Best of luck. Best of luck, she says. Okay. Um. You did this to me. You're lucky I'm a simp. Yeet! Oh god, what the fuck? It's Guardians! Pura was working with the Guardians all along! What the frick? Hello? What in the Tony Stark? Yeah, that's about right. That's a long rope. What if that catches while I'm up here? I would snap my spine. Oh my god. That's high. That's a different way to get a lay of the land, I guess. 
So I scan the topography, then it gives me the map. Yeah. It's cool. So is that the way to get to the Sky Islands too? Sick. Surface map updated. Ooh, and Sky Map? There's nothing here. There's literally nothing in the sky here. That's fine. Oh, well, that made me a bit uncomfortable. Oof, that angle change. We good? Well, can I control? Yeah, I can control. Oh, thank God. Finally have a paraglider. What is? That was the chasm. Yeah, that's the chasm. Are there any other shrines around me? Not that I can see. Probably would have been better to do this at night, though. Okay. Yeet. Coming back, Pura. Time to go to the castle. Uh, I don't want to fight Gadid just yet. I feel like he's probably in the castle. Uh, let's not. I want to live, man. I want to... Oh, this is the tower. She's that away. Catch me, Pura. Imagine if you could slam back into Pura. That would be great. Welcome back. That was some good gliding up there, Link. I expected nothing less. So how did it go? Did you get a proper map scan? Good. That map is crucial to our search. There are Skyview Towers in every region of the world. You want to make a point of visiting them all. Right. Let's talk about the upheaval. It's affected more than just the castle. Reports of other strange phenomena have been com uh, coming in from all over Hyrule. Let's take a look at your map. Go into the hole? Um, we're kind of continuing the main story for now. Oh, I could go into the hole now, though. I have the paraglider. So I won't just go splat on the ground at the bottom. Not today. <laughs> but maybe on Wednesday. <laughs> no, Wednesday is thing. Thursday. Maybe on Thursday. The first report comes from Hebrid in the northwest. Next up is Elden to the northeast. The Gerudo are reporting trouble in the southwest. And finally, there's a Lanariu in the east. There's five? There's four. I can't count. <laughs> Is this a, okay? So Gerudo, Zora to the northeast, Rito to the northwest, Gerudo to the southwest. Yeah, okay, it's the same four as before. The strange phenomena are concentrated in these four regions. Yes. I can't say for certain, but I've got the nagging suspicion that we might find out more about Princess Zelda by looking into these phenomena. Hey, Doc. I don't know if this is helpful, but I heard something weird the other day. It was about someone who might have seen Princess Zelda at Rito Village over in Hebrew recently. Hmm. That is pretty weird, yeah. Generally speaking, I don't put much stock in hearsay. But this does sound like it's worth looking into. So to the northwest we go. Oh, and before I forget, Link, we've asked the Lucky Clover Gazette to help us in the search for Princess Zelda. There's nobody who knows more about the goings-on in Hyrule than them. You can find them near the entrance to Rito Village. Yeah, they really want me to start with the Rito Village. They're like, go northwest. G go north for the love of God. Go There's so much to the northwest. You have no idea. <laughs> if you do go there, you should speak with the editor. I'm sure she can help out in some way too. Mm -hmm. I'll be here directing a variety of investigations into the upheaval's many chasms and new ruins. I'll also be looking into different villages. Someone somewhere might know what's happened to the princess. I'm counting on you to check out the major phenomena that are troubling regions around Hyrule, Link. We'll find Princess Zelda one way or another. <laughs> Gotta find goggles. What is she running off to? What? Tiny child, what are you doing? Here, <sighs> here. Ah. Here, <sighs> here. Ah. Here, <laughs> here. You okay? Okay, this is where we end for the day. That's what we're going to continue with next. A little hee hee here. First, though, we get to do our real gacha. Okay. Because, boy, do I have amiibo. <laughs> Touch an amiibo to the NFC touch point? You know it. Okay. This is Breath of the Wild Link. Let's go. Oh, my God. That's so many items. Sunshroom. Sky Shroom, Sun Shroom, Iron Shroom, hell yeah, increases your defense, Sun Shroom, and Rush Shroom. Oh. Knight's Broadsword, damn, that's really high level, actually. Oh my god. That's almost as strong as this fused weapon. Oh my, oh god. I guess the boulder, mm. 
I don't need two flame emitters. I'll drop that. There we go. If I combine this with something, it would be pretty good. Okay, let's go again. We got so many to do. This is Link with a horse. Mushrooms again. Zap Shroom offers protection against electricity. Chill Shroom. Good in cold regions. You can fuse them. Yeah, that's what I'm planning to do. Oh, wait, I could fuse those two weapons? I didn't even think of that. Well, I don't want to flame fuse the flame emitter, but I could fuse those two. But let's keep going through items for now. We'll probably get a bunch. Buy all mushrooms? I don't know. It's been two links so far. This is Super Smash Bros. Link. Ah, oh, shit. I've already got one of those. Um. Hey, Epina. I. I didn't mean to cheat on you, but I've already. Don't look at me like that. Yeah, you go be free, girl. You go be free. We literally got a second Epina. I didn't know they'd let you do that in Breath of the Wild. We already have one registered. <laughs> Um, look away, chat. Look away. <laughs> this is Zelda with a loft wing. <laughs> Epic of the sequel. I know, right? Ooh. Of course, they give me a fortified pumpkin. Reminds you of all on village. Adds the defense. Warm Safina. Nightshade. All these goodnesses. She's a granny by now. True. Goddess fabric. Tough fabric bearing a goddess design. Looks like it could be used to make a paraglider. What? How do I... Okay. Maybe Pura can make me another paraglider? That's weird. Next up, that's Moth. That's not usable. Why did I have Moth in here? <laughs> Next up is the Guardian. Customization. Let's go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. There is still... Bye, Epina. I told you to leave, girl. I told you to be free. Rusty broadsword. That's not even good. Go away, Rusty Broadsword. Um, I'll leave those for a second. Scared horsey. <laughs> Giant metal boxes come running down, for, raining down from the heavens. Fishies! And meat. So much meat. Mighty Carp increases attack power. Stamina power. More attack power. Raw prime meat. More hearts. Good job. That's just scared her. Yeah. She doesn't like... Oh my god, that's a strong-ass bow. Um, Bye-bye, construct bow. Thank you. We're gonna be so powerful. Okay, I should break these. Hungry now? Yeah, my breakfast is still staring at me. Good, you can still break them that way. Ton of arrows. Let's go. Okay. Do, do, do. What was that one? Oh, sorry. That was Link with a bow and arrow. This is Link from Wind Waker. <laughs> God, I have so many. Let me know if you get bored of this chat. We could just switch to Zatsudan. If you guys don't want to watch this every time, I could just do this before I stream. <laughs> Stealth fin trout um, suppresses noises. Okay, so that's for sticky stuff. That's for boosting heat defense. Resistance to electricity. Nah, it's okay. Okay. Good, we'll wrap it up this way then. Boomerang! Oh, it's decayed though. Damn. Um, do I want to drop? No. I have a lot of good weapons. I could fuse the boomerang and the sword. I could make a boomerang sword. You know what? Let's see if that works. Let me drop my really, really strong sword. Get the boomerang. Let's see if I can fuse the boomerang with the sword and make a boomerang sword that flies back to me. Not to the Boko Reaper. Um, to the Boomerang. <laughs> You're shitting. Okay, well, it crashed. But still, it comes back to me. Knight Sword Boomerang. <laughs> A Boomer Sword? You're damn well right. Oh my god. <laughs> That's fucking sick. This game is stupid in the best way. This game is stupid in the way that just makes you continuously smile. Oh my god, that's gonna hurt people. 
This is Urbosa, the champion of the Gerudo. Oh my god, she likes her meat. Big bird thigh. Raw gourmet meat. She doesn't fuck around. She doesn't deal with that basic meat. So much meat. And a Gerudo shield. I'm taking that shield. Come on. This one's almost broken. Yeah, let's drop. Even though it's got spikes. 28. God damn. Um, this is Link from Ocarina of Time. Good boop. Nice, simple meat and a chest. I'm hoping to get some of like the cosplay outfit things. Soldiers play more. That doesn't really matter. Just soldiers anyway. We could fuse some of these together just for the fun of it though. See what they turn into. That's Byleth. Why the frick was Byleth in here too? Bum, bum, bum. This is Daruk. The Goron champion. Yo, he drops ore? Oh my god. That man just made me money. That's so much amber. And he dropped the cobble crusher. Yo, oh, I'm replacing this with it. Oh, it's still, it's frayed. But I can combine things. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm taking the cobble crusher. I don't need, wait, no, it's not the axe. It's the boulder hammer. I'll use the cobble crusher for smacking ore. Sick. Link now a sugar baby. Oh, yeah. This is Mifa, the Zora champion. Of course, she gives a bunch of fish. Party bass. Oh, yo, let's go. Maximum hearts. I love just seeing Epina walking around like, are you not going to turn me in, Link? Zora champion fabric. I didn't even know that was a thing. So we're going to get a Zora champion paraglider as well. Sick. Um, this is Rav not Ravali. Yeah, Ravali. This is Ravali. Bird boy. Oh, good. He gave me some arrows. Hydro man, heat resistance. Fleet lotus, speed. Chickaloo, just for sp health. And some arrows. Sushi, let's go. I know, right? And a swallow bow. Bowstring has been specially engineered for aerial combat. Fuck yeah. Drop this one. And we take. It's a shame you can't combine bows. <laughs> if you could combine... Well, I mean, you put things on arrows, so that's essentially combining bows. Rivali, my do my boy? Yes, that was boy. This is 8-bit link. <laughs> Good, we scared the shit out of that guy. What do we got? Soldier shield. Bum, bum, bum. We'll drop this, I guess. Ah. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. Need my axe. Apples and arrows. And a Hylian shroom. Let's drop them next to this guy. I like him being scared. <laughs> this is Twilight Princess Link. God, I have too many. Can we talk about this? Just gonna collect my epinas over here. <laughs> we got three epinas in this game currently. What the frick? Epina three? Yeah, that's epina three, baby. <laughs> it gets up, you get a multiple epinas. I managed to have four. <laughs> that's crazy. I had no idea that was gonna be a thing. Oh, this is Wolf Link with Midna. Meat. Oh, that's a lot of meat. They're multiplying. Yeah, they're having babies. Mirror of Twilight fabric. Oh, that's got to be beautiful. I'm going to take those to Pura before we log off as well, just to see if she can make more. Um, this is Zelda from this game. So Breath of the Wild, Zelda. Electric. Electricity resistance. Sweet. Really want the fabrics? Yeah, the fabrics. And there's another one. Hyrule Princess fabric. I didn't know that was one either. I thought all the fabrics that you got were from like the older games. This is a Boko Blin. And I'm also going to do this one which came out. It's um, blah, blah, blah. Majora's Mask Link. We got mushrooms and meat. Two chests. Silent Shroom lets you be stealthy. 
We're all prime meat. Let's go. Waiting for Epina the Fourth. <laughs> there better not be an Epina the Fourth. That's another really strong sword. God damn. We'll maybe combine that later. No, we've got too many weapons as is. And a weak ass Boko Ball. Okay. Well, that one I don't feel bad just leaving in the chest forever. I think this is the final one. This is um, Wind Waker Zelda. A tiny little chibi Zelda. Cool Safina. Increases heat resistance. A big hardy radish. That's so powerful. Oh my god. Increases your movement speed. And a swift carrot. I can upgrade Oreo already. Damn, we are overpowered now. Fuse the Epinus together, if only. And Amber. Nice. Is that everything? Yep, that's all of them. Okay, gotcha over. <laughs> God damn. We're just surrounded by shit now. Okay, time to save. Let's move to Zatsudan mode. Next week. I got... Oh, well, not next week. What am I talking about? In two days. We'll be back. I kind of want to... There's a well here too. Okay, we're saving right here. We're going down the well and then we'll continue the story with Pura's apprentice thing. Child. <laughs> That's what we're doing next time. Okay. In Zatsudan mode. God, I love this game. This was even better than I expected. There's so many things I just never expected to come out of this. Oh, I didn't have chat set up for this page. Whoops. Let me fix that. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Thank you all for joining me today. Let me put on some music too. Um, how about yeah, the simple calm one. This is the one I like the most for just chatting. Um, 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 doo, doo. Turn it up. There we go. Comments. Wrong comments. There we go. There you guys are. Atsufu chan, thank you. It's been super fun so far. Yeah, this game is amazing. I always knew it was going to be good, but damn. Can't believe we threw through six and a half hours. It turned into six and a half hours of gameplay. That's that's not bad. That's not bad. Let me grab my comment grabber. Twidget. There we go. But I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. And thank you so much for being here. Art. There we go. Get off center now. I need to deal with that. How you feeling, by the way? I'm good. I'm a little bit tired, but that's more because it's hot than anything. In fact, what I'm going to do is turn on the air conditioner. I'll be back in like two, well, like 20 seconds. <laughs> There we go. I feel so much better. <laughs> I didn't want that on while I played Zelda because I wanted to have like clear audio, but man, it's still pretty hot today. <laughs> Time for Doggo to bathe in the AC? No, thankfully they're downstairs. They cannot steal my AC this time. They would probably try if they could. <laughs> if they were upstairs, they'd definitely be all over it. After all, it's been a long time. It was fun. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. This game has been great so far. Exploring it for like a first timer, man. So many of the things I just tried, I wasn't expecting to work. I wasn't expecting to be able to like move things around. I wasn't expecting to like be able to reverse time after I'd moved them. I wonder if you can combine a scent with that as well. Like, do you think you could lift something above your head and then go up into it? But yeah, fusing like the minecart to the shield. <laughs> Even fusing the minecart to the sword. I was like excited about that. 
and then it was like wait can i use the shield on the like i thought i could just use it on the the actual rails itself and then it turned out it just literally turns into a skateboard that you can use anywhere that shit was wild <laughs> doggo will come soon no thankfully they're kept away um Vixalarius, thank you so much for donating the feud funds i hope you enjoyed the stream today hope you have a wonderful evening thank you for joining us the boomer sword i know right when i was like yo i wonder if i could attach a sword to this boomerang and it will come back to me uh-uh this game is gonna be so much fun blinky hawk pro skater yes this game is so stupid but so good it's like a combination it's stupid but really smart like i imagine it's incredibly hard to have created all the things that nintendo created but then the fact that you can play with them in such broken ways is so good as well oh yeah let me grab links to the assets that we use today as well and i'll throw the assets onto here so that anybody who wants to see them can see them not even finished breath of the wild and this game makes me want to play it again oh i would definitely suggest bre playing breath of the wild before you play this one just because they feel one so connected and two like you get to know the characters more but yeah if you want to finish it i'd love yeah for that i hope i'm not like spoiling anything i hope you didn't want to play this yourself uh let me grab the full ass links oh there's another donation thank you it's jerry lawley what a comfy stream for tan thank you for waiting to play so we could watch along i know it must have been difficult i love your passion and enthusiasm for zelda we love listening to you nerd out of the games you love never change by you thank you so much this game is incredible i just realized i never retweeted the links either god i'm such an idiot but yeah zelda like i said i i'm pretty sure i've said this to everyone before um the legend of zelda a link to the past was actually the first video game i ever played like back on the snes it got me into gaming <laughs> so i've been quite attached to this series for a long time and to be able to now oh i do have them in the link i'm an idiot why did i not see those they're in the description i am stupid i just need to retweet them <laughs> just retweet those real quick rio did such a good job on this multi level link outfit and oh my god arena with the adorable koroks i'm only using the comfy korok because i just think that's so cute there's also a normal korok asset but i liked like the little sheep like hiding itself with a leaf and pretending to be a korok i think that's adorable so i kept that <laughs> My favorite thing about playing it was bullying chickens. Oh my god. Did you create one of those evil contraptions? God damn it. Never change by you. Thank you so much for donating the food funds, Miss Jerry Lawlia. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Please rest well. Take it easy. Um, oh, do you mean a link to the past you liked bullying the chickens? Because that was more simple. The cuckoos have gotten terrifying nowadays. Foo foo with boobies out, true. The, the booba. I told you I had booba. I mean, you can kind of see them here, but they're hidden. <laughs> but you can see them in the outfit. Lily Demon Nerd. Fufuchan. It's good to have you back. I missed you so much. Bye, you. Also, ready for the 22nd? Sorry for the off topic, but FF16, I'm hyped for it. I'm hyped for that. I'm hoping we get permission to play it. It probably isn't going to happen, but I would love to play that one on the streams as well. Obviously, I wouldn't play it as soon as it came out because we've got a lot of other things going on that are long term. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not going to be playing it immediately on or off stream, but hopefully we'll be able to play it on stream someday. I'd love to. The action RPG elements look so good. The story looks pretty dark. I love how the character like grows up and gets gritty. But yeah, it looks amazing. I'd love to play that one. Thank you for donating the food fund, Lily Demon Lord. And yeah, I feel that. I'm in the same boat. I can't wait to see how that turns out. That should be better for positioning. There we go. Um, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. And Kakui. Thank you for donating the food funds. No message, but I hope you had a wonderful evening. This has some surprisingly dark moments. It really did. Whatever the frick those hand things were. I found, I, I'm so glad that I ran into those at like 4 a.m. And at 4.30 a.m. the light came out and scared them away. They looked so powerful, and I was in the wrong area at the wrong time <laughs> without a sailcloth, and I just climbed away from them. I'm so lucky. Oh, that could have gone so bad. They're called gloom hands. Oh, somebody said gloomy hands earlier. Lemire's th thumbnail shows them too. Yeah, Lemire's thumbnails are always beautiful. And yeah, showing off the chest is great. But yeah, the darkness in the game in general, going down into the cavern, Ganon just being like, Zelda, 
Blink. Been a while. Shattering the Master Sword. I don't think that's ever happened before. The Master Sword has been like drained of power, but I don't think it's ever actually snapped. From what I remember, that's crazy. And it cut his face a little bit, but he still healed from it. As if it was just nothing to him. The Sword of Evil's Bane just reduced to nothing. Master Sword got snapped like a toothpick. Yeah, this has got to be intense. I can't wait to see what the final fight in this game looks like. I'm going media blackout when it comes out. I want to play it for myself. Ah, I get you. Yeah, FF16. Final Fantasy games are one of those things where everybody wants to talk about the storyline in them. So it's got to be hard to avoid it. Definitely just like get off of social media for a little bit. The part was so good. It was terrifying. It was. The voice acting was so good. Everything about it was amazing. But I hope you enjoy it when it comes out, Lily Demon Nerd. Waiting for Ganon and Seedon. I know, right? I wonder how much Ganon will actually get in this game. Like, will we see him from place to place or will he only appear at the end is my big question. I want him to be in a bunch of places. I want him to be in, like every, every area just taunting us. But we'll see. Hope the story is better than FF15. Yeah, FF15 was kind of rough. If the story is better, that'd be great. The gameplay looks amazing, so they just need to sell it on the story. Hopefully they put in a lot of effort into it. Oh, we get quite a bit of him. Yeah, me too. <laughs> and yeah, Sidon will definitely be around. You may hire TY for the stream for Chan. Every time you play Zelda, I get tempted to try playing again. But I think I enjoy watching you more than playing myself. But oh, that's really sweet. Thank you so much, you may hire. I have so much fun playing these games, so I'm glad that people do enjoy them. If people got sick of me, I'd completely understand, but <laughs> I'm still playing it three times this week. I don't care. <laughs> The Blood Moon was crazy too. Yeah, that was so much darker than before. Before it was just like, ah, the Blood Moon rises. Everything, all the evil things are coming back. And it was like, yo, kind of creepy. This time it was straight up like poetic and evil as shit. Oh, we'll see what happens. We'll see how it goes. You encountered Gloom Hands? Yeah, we somehow managed to encounter Gloom Hands. Gloomy Hands, whatever they are. We, we ran into them because we went way off track to get like a special this shrine then it turned out we couldn't even complete oh yeah we can do that immediately when we start back as well now that we have the sailcloth it should be easy to solve that shrine because we basically already solved it we just needed a sailcloth <laughs> but that'll be good we can finish that shrine and then we'll have four things so we can get one more heart container or stamina thing that's good that's good um who's that girl that narrates the blood moon that's zelda i don't know the voice actress's name i when she first came out in like Breath of the Wild, I wasn't like super stoked about it, but I like like the fantasy sound she brings to it now. She has that accent and that very wavery soft voice. It's very relaxing and soothing. I quite like it. And it's so different from like all the other voices in the game because a lot of them are very American and then she's very British. <laughs> it's very British, yeah. But I don't think she actually is British. I think that's like an accent she's putting on. I don't know. Either way, it's a very cool voice. I like it. It does feel very fantasy. Jojo BB. TY for the stream. I have to catch this in the Zatsu since I had to work today and celebrated my birthday yesterday. I spend it with cats. <laughs> Thank you for donating the food funds and happy belated birthday. I hope you had a wonderful birthday yesterday. Thank you for donating. Rest well and thank you for being here, Jojo BB. Zelda is British. In this she is. Possibly. She has that accent anyway. It was good. <laughs> it's not only your new obsession, it's ours. Okay, let's all join in this adventure together then. Hopefully next time it won't be six and a half hours just of gameplay. That was way more than I thought it was going to be. Ah, Patricia Somerset is the voice actress for Zelda in Breath of the Wild. And oh my god. There she is holding the Master Sword again. Beautiful image, Tri Princess. Thank you for telling us that. So it's Patricia Somerset. She's doing a wonderful job. She's getting a lot more like emotion in her voice this time as well. Obviously, last time she was mostly just like at the beginning, she was like shy, reserved, quiet. And then post post 100 years, she was like this all knowing sage, just guiding Link. So she never really got a chance to show off her vocal range. Whereas in this one, she's already shown like scared, relieved, happy. It's been great. She's been really showing off her age. She feels really adult, very mature. Yeah, very mature, very like fantasy it feels very fantasy to me i like it and i hadn't heard the english dub in a long time 
So I'm glad that worked out. <laughs> like literally in this one, you start the game and it just immediately dives you into the cutscene. So I didn't even get to choose which language I wanted it to be in this time. So it was just like, ah, we're on English, I guess. <laughs> Super cool for a development. Yeah. Seeing Princess Zelda like come alive. Cloudines, do you are. I'm really glad I got to watch the stream today. I was looking forward to you playing this. Would have been hard to wait longer. It was a huge fun. I'm on my vacation and lucky my hotel has good Wi-Fi. Oh, I'm glad you got to watch it. I'm sorry that we dropped so many frames at the beginning. It's finally fixed itself, so it must have been on my side. I don't know. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> that is my alarm that's supposed to be telling me to walk the dog, because this is normally the time by which I've already, like, finished streaming and doing everything. God damn it, I'm late. <laughs> this was a long stream today. Anyway, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it seems to have been on my side, whatever it was, not YouTube side. Uh, but it's fixed now. It just sucks that it happened today of all days. It terrified me. I thought we weren't going to be able to stream this game at all today. Get out and walk the dog. Nah, it, it, don't worry. He'll be fine. He had, a do he had a walk like right before this stream. I can continue and finish the Zartadon portion. It'll be fine. And then I'll walk dog. And then I'll rest and relax for the rest of the evening. Dog for sure is about to remind you. <laughs> yeah, he tends to be pretty good at schedules. You give it like half an hour and he'll realize, wait. I should have been walked by now. And then he'll start barking his head off. But yeah, for now, he'll be fine. He won't even notice that it's time exactly yet. <laughs> Dogs love schedules. Yeah, I'm surprised how well the circadian rhythm works. He, yeah, he knows when it's time to wake up. He knows when it's time to go to bed. He knows when it's time to walk. Dog was like, excuse me, sir. It, it's not that perfect. Give it like an hour and he'd get really angry. <laughs> Kiwi, thank you for the stream today. This is the kingdom is consumed by life and I can't wait to see you play more. You're going to have a blast. I can't wait with like all the different things we've discovered so far. That's an adorable little Link avatar as well. Thank you for donating the food funds, Kiwi. I hope you had a wonderful day today. Thank you for joining us for the stream. And yeah, we'll definitely be continuing this soon. Can't wait. <laughs> Dog's internal clocks are crazy, but he deserves the best of the best. Yeah, he does. Oh man, it's pee time. That's the problem as well. It's a bit cooler today than it was the last few days, so. It's been getting cooler considering last week was horrible. But yeah, he has a bit more energy. When it's hot, he doesn't do anything. <laughs> but as it gets cooler, he'll start being more aggravating. Luthier! Do I for the stream for Chan? Watching you play this game is so much entertaining, like I thought. I also like the game mechanics. It's so cool and challenging. And you're so big brain, Borg. Especially with the tiny whiny thing. I don't think I've even, like, started to hit the big brain yet, which is the fun thing. Like, I've only combined some of the basic powers and used some simple versions. I feel like we're going to be able to do so much more when we've played around with it a bit. So, yeah. Thank you for the compliment. I will just take the compliment. Um, I'm not even sure if I was supposed to have figured out some of the things as early as I did. Um, but it's been so much fun. The boomerang sword was such a twist. The having a skateboard thing, it's a shame that that destroys durability so quickly. And now we're about to run out of the second one. <laughs> we already ran out of the second one, in fact. We already lost our skateboard. We finally have some good shields, but we don't have any carts. Hopefully we'll find some carts soon that we could fuse to more of those shields. Yeah, it'd be nice to keep those around for a while. It was so much fun skating around. It was so fast when you went downhill. It's going to be good. Boomer sword is going to be fun, yeah. As soon as I see a whiz robe, I'm just chucking that thing at <laughs> Can't wait to see more unhinged creations. Yeah, that isn't even beginning like the wild stuff some people have done online where they made like robots and death contraptions, cages. Oh god, there are so many pieces that I don't have yet that are going to be wild. Even just the wing was cool enough to me. The fact that it just flew away from me at the end. Spooky Fever, thank you for the stream. I really enjoyed it. No problem. I'm so glad you enjoyed it. Thank you for donating the feed fans. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Shimomi, always love to see you enjoying yourself and follow you around exploring Hyrule. This of the Kingdom is so cool, but I don't have the skills to handle the game. TY for your service, Oreo. Oreo is amazing too. I can't... We got so lucky in this game. We just stumble along on like an incredibly standard horse and really good looking horse too. Not in that way. Don't start, chat. <laughs> but yeah, the like pure black body, the little like white markings on the face and the hair. Really attractive horse. In a horse way, not in a weird way. <laughs> really attractive for a horse horse, okay? <laughs> I can't say anything on these chats. Um, but yeah, 
it was cool like really powerful we got to name it oreo i'm glad everyone was like yeah no take oreo we have unfortunately had to abandon a little apple but it's cool that they let you keep your horses from old games as well and somehow we currently have three epiners in the game which is very weird they didn't let you do that in breath of the wild if you used one like one of the ones that summons an epina you couldn't summon an epina again after that it was just stuck um so yeah weird weird it's getting pretty weird not gonna lie it was pretty weird it's good we're done Sisube, your run-throughs of any Zelda game are absolutely amazing. Your love of the game always makes it so engaging to watch, and I can't stop watching. Looking forward to seeing more Fucha and the Builder. Ah, oh, thank you. Can't wait. Ah, oh, so much to explore. We've barely touched it. We've literally only barely scratched the surface, because there's so much surface world, and then I know there's a whole underground world, and there's a sky world. <laughs> this is going to be a lot of our time upcoming in the future. Epina multiplied? Yeah, she's everywhere now. <laughs> but thank you for donating the food funds to Sabay. Thank you for the big donation too. I hope you have a wonderful day and please do rest well. Oh, and thank you for the gifted. Mian Fung, thank you so much for the five gifted membership. Oh, Margarita. Fuchan, you're amazing. Thank you so much for your comfy streams. They help me relax when I have bad days at work and your community is so sweet and accepting. They are. This community is incredible. And we didn't even get many spoilers, Drew. That was what I love. Like, people... We're definitely trying to guide me towards certain mechanics, but it wasn't too bad. Um, but yeah, people like generally, there was one person who even just asked, like, do you want me to say where to get this? And I was like, no, 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 let me do it. Do you want to like find a hint for this? And it was like, yeah, so pretty good. How many hours do you think you'll have at the end of Tears of the Kingdom? Oh, God. I mean, I probably I want to do all the shrines and get like the tunic of the wild if it's in this game again. Um, so that's going to be a while. We're probably only going to like play this like multiple times a week for like a couple of weeks though. And then we'll start doing it once a week. I want to like fly through the main game, but not like just the main game. We'll explore and hit every shrine along the way and all the different points along the way. We'll take our time with it. But yeah, I don't want to immediately do all the shrines before we do Ganon. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe like 60 hours to do the main story, depending on how big it is. It looks pretty big. We put in six and a half hours today, and like I said, I feel like we barely touched anything. Maybe 60 to 80 hours to just do the main story. And then like 120, maybe, to finish all the shrines off at the end. Who knows? I mean, there was also like a lot of story in this one. We were confined to a little area. We'll see how it goes. Raven Hikari. Friends and I were trying to figure out how long a Zelda short stream would be. I said six hours a minimum. I think we know you pretty well for chat. Yeah, I'm just glad I'm strong enough to do this. Like, I was worried after, yeah, the little visit to the hospital. I wouldn't be strong enough to do this for a while. So I'm glad. Like, today just went great. I woke up. I felt good. Walked dog. Started to eat breakfast. Still have some breakfast in front of me. <laughs> but yeah, no, it was just a great day of, like, going through it, not feeling bad at all. Just enjoying the game. So hopefully that will continue in the future. Because, yeah, that felt like a good stopping point. The better stopping point would have probably been right when I got to the town. <laughs> but as it is, I think this is a good stopping point for now. If we tried to go any further, I think there'd be like a lot more story to go through. So yeah, it's good. Take it one day at a time. Yeah. In the future, it may be as short as like three hours for one stream if I start to get fairly uncomfortable again. But we'll do what we can. I did 90 hours and feel like I haven't done anything. Damn, Kami. <laughs> Fun times. Vexilarius. Yellow message got eaten, so I'm trying again. Um, it might not if it was recent that it got eaten, but I haven't read the old, Oh, no, I see your old one. Sorry, I'm going to go through the old ones after I catch up on the new ones. Vexilarious. But thank you for donating in the past as well. Yeah, I see that one where it's just a pur uh, purple heart. Thank you so much for donating the food funds. And Otsu Long Stream. I'm so glad to see you thriving and having fun. It really gives me hope. Thank you and bah. <laughs> thank you and bah. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Thank you for joining us. And that's a cute little avatar. Is that? Oh, it's a Mareep. I, I thought the thing on the tail. I didn't realize. Is it Mareep? It's one of the Pokemon. I recognize the Pokemon. I don't know its name. But yeah, the tail just looked like my net jack. I thought it was like a different version of like a sheep. <laughs> it's a Mareep recolor. Oh, okay, cool. It's cute. Yeah, it looks very confident -y. Thank you for donating the food funds. And I hope you have a wonderful evening. Wasn't this meant to be a short stream? Yeah. It, it, it was 
just like, you know, uh, uh, 10 minutes after three hours. We we hit three hours and I was like, oh, we'll just do 10 more minutes with 10 more minutes. This is a, it, was, it happens. <laughs> it's a really good game, okay? <laughs> Vivian. Puchan, thank you so much for the stream. Actually, I didn't play Zelda those days too because I wanted to see you play first. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. I hope you can play it now and I hope you enjoy it. But thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. We still do a few more weeks of like a bunch of Zelda and then we'll start to calm down and just do it once a week when I've calmed down on it. But yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Have a wonderful evening. It's okay. Short can be relative. I mean, yeah, compared to some people, like Alira on average does like an eight hour stream every time she streams. Sonny recently, every time he plays Breath of the Wild, puts in 12 hours. It's crazy. Man is on fire right now. <laughs> so yeah, it was a short stream compared to those. It's fine. <laughs> Lily Demon Nerd, should we scatter with so many sticks? I think we should scatter. I don't get it. With so many sticks? I don't get the joke. I feel like that's a reference to something, but I don't understand it. I'm sorry. Alira is built different? Yeah, Alira is the master of long-form RPGs. Oh my god. Luthier, thank you so much for the five gifted membership. There's so many. Hope you're having fun too. He's having fun with it? Yeah, he is. I'm glad he is. I've been watching a lot of his streams and he's been having a wonderful time. I I finally understand everybody when it comes to backseating now as well. It was very hard not to backseat Sonny so many times when it was like, you're not using one of the main features of the game, buddy. And I'm sitting there like, I really want to tell him this, but I'm not. And I think there was one point where like, he was like right next to a shrine or something and the shrine sensor was going off. And I was like, that means there's a shrine there, buddy. There's a shrine there. You could, you could grab the shine and then you can teleport back. You don't have to go to the tower first. Go, just go touch the shrine. And I was sitting there just watching and it's like, don't say anything, don't say anything. Don't do it. Don't be the, don't be what you hate. Don't become what you hate. So yeah, <laughs> I just had to sit there like, it's okay. So he's doing it in his own way. He's having fun. That's what matters. <laughs> the key is control, yeah. You just gotta have, let people have fun their way. Explore the game in their own time. I've got to blow my noosh. Yeah, now I understand. As somebody who loves Breath of the Wild, watching people not use like basic mechanics for some things was like, oh, I wish I could say some things. <laughs> Gotta blow my nose. One second. And I'm sure there are people going nuts about the things that I'm doing in Tears of the Kingdom right now too. <laughs> so yeah, we'll figure out things as we go and hopefully we'll get less embarrassing about it. <laughs> Thank you, Dor. Oh, it's raw in chat. Oh, thank you so much for the beautiful asset. I used it all day. It was incredible. It's so gorgeous. And I even like used the different levels of it. We leveled it up as we went along and we actually got the archaic outfit. But thank you for creating that beautiful piece of art and thank you for letting me use it. Hope you have a wonderful day. Mian Fung, thank you for donating the food funds. No message, but thank you again for the donated membership as well. I hope you have a wonderful evening, Mian Fung. Oh my God, there's been a bunch more donations. <laughs> Raw, th oh, that's where Raw was. Raw, thank you so much for donating five gifted membership to the sheep pile. Welcome to all of our new sheep. I hope you have a wonderful time. And thank you, Raw, for the five gifted. And Stefan Shepard, thank you so much for donating five gifted membership to the sheep pile. Hope you're having a wonderful time. Thank you for being here. Please do rest well. Bless, bless, but yeah, I feel more like you care about the game than when you want to show it off, but you've got it back. Yeah, you got to hold back and let people figure out things their way. Sonny's having a wonderful time and nobody should ruin that. Not even me. <laughs> Not even me. But I get the feeling now. I've never had that feeling before. Because like the only game I'd really consider myself good at is Smash. And you can't really tell people like, oh, you have to do this. You have to do that. Like they have to figure out those kind of things themselves. But yeah, Breath of the Wild was the first one where I was like, there are things you can do that would make this so much easier, but I won't tell you. Good luck, Sonny. Have fun your own way. And yeah, he's been loving the game, so that's good. Should be the Tears of the Kingdom soon. Okay, Skate, thank you so much for donating the food funds. Uh, Red Heart Bar, thank you for donating the food funds. <laughs> Hope you have a wonderful evening and please do rest well. Trial and error, exactly. He'll figure it out as he goes. Or not, as long as you beat the game and do it your own way and you're having fun, that's what matters. Okay, reload this. That's not what it was. <laughs> Whoops. Reloaded the wrong thing. Okay, I'm going to do Streamlabs because I don't want to miss them. Especially since I have like four from yesterday to do. 
And then I'm going to go back into the past history of oh, 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 super chat donations. And then we'll be done for the day. Um, Lean lambs. Let me put this on as well. Boom. Aggie. I don't think we got many. To yeah, good. We didn't get too many. Yesterday we stopped at Mitsu, who doesn't want it to be read out loud. So fine. <laughs> Thank you so much for donating the food funds. And I hope you have a wonderful evening, Mitsu. Thank you for the donation. I won't read the message out loud. Aw. I hope that works out for you. Thank you so much for donating the food funds. Have a wonderful evening and thank you for being here. We're going into the past. Yeah, we are. I got disconnected. Uh-oh. Is everybody else good? Um. Hope you guys can hear me. Um. Next up, you may hire. You say we only live once and to treat ourselves. But if I could be anywhere, it would be with you all here in the sheep pile. Being here makes me happy as heck. Worth every minute of life I spend here. Especially now that I'm working seven days a week. It keeps me sane. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, you may hire. I'm glad you enjoy it so much. And I'm glad you're here with us too. Yeah, I more mean like just don't overspend money on like donating to me, especially. Um, but doing anything like gifted membership or spending too much time that you can't sleep in the night just be here when you want to be and yeah donate what you want to and i'll just be happy while you're here thank you for donating the food funds please have a wonderful evening i'm glad you joined us thank you for the stream i was stressing over homework but watching you play made me feel more relaxed thank you arius i'm glad to hear that thank you for joining us dipped for a subtle moment but we're good okay so it is just still doing the thing from earlier damn i hope it stops that soon <laughs> At least it didn't completely disconnect. Ryu, welcome back, Fuchun. I also lived. I caught COVID when you were away, but I'm glad I'm already mostly recovered when you came back. I'm fit and set for your stream marathons. Can't wait to see you play the new games. Thank you, you. I hope you enjoyed this one today. I'm looking forward to continuing Father Morgana tomorrow. So thank you. Midua. Hi, Fuchun. I miss listening to your voice while I work. Especially your stream schedule, it perfectly starts just when I start working. Glad to see you back. Let's all keep ourselves healthy so we can have more time together in the future. Exactly. Make sure you take care of yourself because, yeah, if your body breaks, it breaks. So make sure you take breaks so that you take care of it. Thank you for donating the food funds and media, and I hope you have a wonderful evening. Ah, Narina, thank you for gifting a membership to the sheep pile. Welcome to our new sheep. Ignis. Hey, Fuchan. Please don't read this out loud. Okay. Oh, that's all good. Don't worry about it. Thank you for donating the food funds. This is a very simple thing. For anyone who ever feels bad if they get timed out, keep in mind, if I time you out, I've just timed you out. It's no big deal. If I say, like, don't do X in the future, then that's one thing. But yeah, if I've just timed you out, it's not like I'm going to hold a grudge against anyone in the future. It just means, like, it was a badly timed joke. It didn't land or it broke one of the rules. And yeah, if I actually like got annoyed, it would be more than that. It would be a sterno warning or it would straight up be a ban. If it happened multiple times. <laughs> there are very few things that people can do to make me ban them instantly. It's normally only one when I'm in a bad mood, which I can't be right now. I'm having too much fun now that I just came back. <laughs> or two, if it's just something incredibly rude and trolly that I can tell isn't like a missed joke, but just straight up like vitriol and like venom. In which case, yeah, I take people out, but yeah. It's like you spray us with the water bottle. Exactly. In fact, where is it? <laughs> I have these like all lined up now because I have so many different ones that are basically bad. That's the wrong water. Ignore that. <laughs> this one. <laughs> it's like bad sheep. Bad. St, st, st. And then you guys dry up and it's fine. <laughs> oh no, why did I bring it up? I forgot I had that one. I haven't used that in a while. <laughs> I mainly just use like the shame corner, the gun, the bonk bat now. I need to remember all these crazy, amazing assets that I have. Thank you for reminding me, sheep. <laughs> okay. Aku! Oh, thank you for donating the food funds. Uh huh. <laughs> thank you for donating the food funds that's very sweet of you to worry about and i hope you have a wonderful day aku thank you so much jesse no way the way me and my work besties symphonically screamed across the office before monday morning meetings seeing your waiting room on our monitors 
Welcome back, Folger, Esteban, Julio, Ricardo, Montoya, De La Rosa, Ramirez. <laughs> you watch it with a bunch of people at work? That's wild. I hope you guys had fun today. I hope you had fun yesterday. I'm glad to be back. Thank you for donating the food funds, and I hope you continue to have a good time at work. That's wild. <laughs> Imagine having such base co-workers. That sounds like a really nice work environment. Like, I think the only thing me and my co-workers in the past have ever not Niji Sanji. I mean, like, office environment kind of co-workers have ever, like, agreed on in the past is things like Game of Thrones. <laughs> like, that's about it. Like, very mainstream stuff. I've never had, like, friends who were into anime at work. I've never had co-workers who were into VTubers or anything like that. So, yeah, that must be fun. Can I work there? I know, right? I wonder what they have. <laughs> yeah, it must be a very nice environment to work in. Thank you so much, Jesse. Oh, and that was today. Thank you so much for donating the food. That was a huge donation too. I hope you had a wonderful day. I'm glad to be here and I hope you enjoyed the stream. Please take it easy, rest well, and have a wonderful rest of your day too. Game of Thrones was wild. Yeah, I feel like everyone watched that while it was airing. I'm sure it was similar for like Breaking Bad and maybe things like Succession or Better Call Saul as well. But yeah, I never really watched any of those, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, welcome back. Cringe, no need to read. Okay. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you so much for donating the food funds. Welcome back. That's so sweet of you. I'm also, I... I see your name on the right side. I see what your actual <laughs> like YouTube name is, but I won't read it out loud. That's one thing I need to stop doing is essentially like doxing people. <laughs> it's not full doxing, but it's bad enough to be like, ah, you used a fake name, but I see your YouTube name. So yeah, I'll let people like, I sometimes see your names, but I'll leave you to hide them from now on on Streamlabs if you want to like be anonymous donator. But thank you so much for the three donated messages. I'm glad to hear that. That sounds so good. I'm glad to be back. Thank you for being here. And please have a wonderful evening. Full doxing. I mean, yeah. Exposing like people being nice and, gen and giving money. Stop doxing us. I am, damn it. That's what I'm saying. I won't read out the other names anymore. <laughs> One sheep. Thank you for donating the food funds. There's no message. But I'm very worried if this is a start of a new count. Maybe it's just one sheep. Maybe it's fine. <laughs> but thank you for donating the food funds. And I hope you have a wonderful evening. And Future Corpse, thank you for donating the food funds. Oh, it's been a while. Thank you. I'm so happy to see you again. Bye, you. Please remember that I buy I, 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 you. Even if I squeeze your cheeks and have to punish you. Wait, where's my whip? I should make my own reverse of that song. I should make like an aggressive version of that song. Where is my whip? Hmm. Maybe I don't have it on this one. I don't. That's wild. <gasps> I only have it on the small versions. That's okay then. I have a book. I really have forgotten so many of these assets. I need to I need to go through these at some point. I know I have a typing asset. To, there's the whip. <laughs> this says no asset. What does that mean? Oh, it's literally me being like, no. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I need to go through these at some point again and remind myself of all the fun things people have provided for me. Yeah, but anyway. Please remember that I buy I, 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 you Even if I have to squeeze you And sometimes teach you a lesson Anyway, thank you for donating the food funds <laughs> Future Corpse, it's lovely to have you here An asset stream? True I have so many <laughs> Ren Losset Ganba Fuchan So happy to see you having so much fun with the new game But I'm gonna head to sleep first with you as the BGM it's a long day for me tomorrow, so have a good rest of the day, Fuchan, and every bar. Thank you so much, Ren Losse. I hope you have a wonderful evening, too. Please do rest well and take it easy. I hope you're already asleep by now and you only get to see this in the VOD, but thank you for donating the food funds. <laughs> An asset refresher? Yeah. No thank you, Fu. No. Thank you, Momo. Lower the whip, Fu? Never. <laughs> you may hire. As someone who mainly listens and isn't watching the screen... There's always that split second when you add dialogue that I'm like, wait, what? And it cracks me up every time. <laughs> Today's stream was super fun. 
Can't wait for more Zelda T.Y. Fuchan. I love doing that. Especially since I like, give most of the characters voices. Like, it's nice to just be in character voice and say things and just like have people be like, Fuchan, no. They wouldn't say that. Raru wouldn't talk about cucking Link. How dare you? He's a good boy. And it turned out maybe Raru just loves Zelda, but Zelda was still in love with Link. I don't know. We'll find out as it goes on. There's timey wimey BS going on. I don't know what's going on right now. She's in present and in the past. She kind of looks like a goddess right now. Maybe she unlocked like full power. Maybe she got the trifle. I don't know what. Yeah, we'll find out. Anyway. Sisuri, thank you for donating the food funds. The message is just terrifying. <laughs> Hope you have a wonderful evening. <laughs> Luther, thank you for the stream today, Futan. It's so much fun. Six hour stream, we'd love to see it. Glad you're finally playing this game live with us. I'm also happy to see you having a great time. Anyway, get in line, sir. Pura didn't choose you yet. I mean, true. True, Pura is for the world to share. Just like Sidon. There are so many, you know, they're fictional characters. Everyone can enjoy their presence. That's what matters. <laughs> thank you for donating the food funds, Luther, and I hope you continue to have a wonderful evening. And Miu, thank you so much for the huge donation to the food funds. I'm glad you enjoyed TOTK. Thanks for the little bit long stream. <laughs> Thanks for the little bit in quotation marks. Long stream. Hope you have a good day and rest well. Thank you. I hope you have a wonderful evening as well. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm going to start charging my phone because it's about to die. It truly really has been a bit of a long stream. <laughs> that looks ominous. Yeah, the smile always looks ominous. I've been threatened with them by a long time. For a long time by Sioux City. I'm glad they have fun with it. <laughs> Thank you for donating the food funds and me. I hope you have a wonderful evening. And yeah, you rest well too. Kyo chan Ochu! And welcome back, Fuchan. I miss your streams and Zatsu, so I'm so glad you're feeling much better now. And I hope you continue to feel better each day. Seeing you play TOTK makes me want to play as well. This is the thing. Where do I start? <laughs> you should probably play Breath of the Wild first, but like, you don't have to. It seems like pretty much no one remembers Link. It seems like the world has changed a lot. The shrines are gone. The divine beasts seem to be gone. The Sheikah technology seems to be gone. So I think you could probably just jump into this one. But feel free to. <laughs> but thank you for donating the food funds and I hope you have a wonderful evening. Your brain? What did my brain do? Has my brain broken again? I haven't even noticed. That's the fun thing. <laughs> okay. I am actually feeling a bit broken right now. <laughs> I have definitely pushed myself to my limit. So, what I'm going to do, I am not going to lose all of these uh, super chats from today, but I'm not going to be able to read them just now. So what I am going to do instead is end for now and up. Oh, that's the wrong thing to delete. <laughs> it's this I need to delete. Uh, I'm going to read them tomorrow because tomorrow we're just doing a Valorant stream. So during Valorant, because it's like a group game, there's normally not too many donations during that. Uh, there's going to be 10 people playing tomorrow. So yeah. During most of it, like during the Zatsudan, I'll read the super chats from today as well tomorrow and catch up on them. Sorry, I can't read them today. But thank you to everybody who donated today. Thank you to everybody who watched today. It was so much fun to have so many of you here. Valo, yep, hell yeah. But yeah, I will read out this, uh, the membership names on the way out. But yeah, for the actual donations, I'll save it till tomorrow. Thank you all so much for being here. Uh, uh, tomorrow we're going to be playing Valorant, as usual. <laughs> we play so much Valorant. But I hope you guys will rest well as well. We're on our way to... Oh, it has been seven hours. <laughs> that was me about to say, we're getting close to seven hours. It's been seven hours and ten minutes. God damn it. Thank you all for joining us. I hope you have a wonderful evening. As always, do not be led astray, my confidants. And I... We'll catch you guys next time. And as always on the way out, I'd like to say a special thank you to everyone who joined the membership today. Everybody who's rejoined, everybody who joined for the first time, and everybody who donated gifted membership to the sheep pile, including Dom, Cha Cha Lin, Kiwi Butt, 
Momo Meow, ASY, or Azzy, Saya Stark, Ayakashi Kun, Natsu, Mangrove Lamb, oh, also, Ushuan, thank you so much for donating the food funds. Since this wasn't an old one, I need to read this one before I forget it. <laughs> Fuchan, you're so awesome. I'm glad to see you happy and enjoy the game. Hope your life is filled with joy and happiness. Have a nice day and rest well. Thank you so much. I hope you have a lovely evening as well. Thank you so much for joining us. Back to our membership, we've got Dodor, Pico, Skylin, Ushen. Oh, Ushen again. Thank you. Psycho Pearl. Velour, thank you so much for gifting a membership to the sheep pile. Arena, thank you so much for gifting a sheep to the sheep pile. V, thank you so much for the gifted. Natsu. Mangrove lamb. I just read that one, my bad. <laughs> Honey rose. Shina. Sirod Aurora. Chen Yaya. Ying Shijie, thank you so much for the gifted membership. Urado. Ren Gore. Luthier, thank you so much for the gifted. Wiyu, thank you so much for the gifted. Jay's Stray Dogs. Tedium, Lacey. Alphetic Rose. R. Gwen. Aki. Wen Wen P. Gang Cho Gun. Moni. Leo. Eren. Ritsuka. U Ocean. B. Yena, Sheep Sheep, Anachan, Janice Ho, Isha Pish, thank you so much for the gifted, Nobody Knows, Sombra, Meru, Minimon J, Shakura, Jasmine T, Lala, Benedis, Rosen Rivers, Shaw, Rum Coffee, Michu Kenikuma Land, Lily Sheep, Miss Jerry Lawliet, thank you so much for the gifted, Muna, Mini Siva, Meowlery, Remy, Dorku 69, Ops on Mercury, Yusin, Sana, Envy Demon, Helion, Hichi, Mer, Noru, Def Kuzu Sara, Ying, Nixie, White Choo Choo Daisuke. Sorry that I killed a lot of White Choo Choo today. Miyu, th oh my god, Miyu, thank you so much for the 20 gifted membership. That's so many. Kushi V, Kushi V, or Kushi the Fifth. Cakes, Misha, Unspeakable Horror, <laughs> Belle, a proud confidant. Mota, Rebecca, Ertsu Shaoshan, thank you so much for the gifted membership. Sofu Sofu Miao Miao, Yujie, Luckyim, Spirulina, Wandering Far, thank you so much for the gifted. Arcos, Tracy, Haunting Fry, Shelby, Ming Lu, oh, Li Ming Lu, Hazuki Ilium, Yuki, Cheese Chuo, Vante Tu, O Koji Chan, Min Min, Apasora, Yerio, Exu, Fumi, Karamiao, Baby Faced Bunting, Anisasa, Lord Algamon, Wolf Wolf, Cupbot, Sunako, Mori, Maru Maru, thank you so much for the five gifted membership. Jenya, Silabi, Irarin, Mina, Claire 606. Claudine, thank you so much for the ten gifted membership as well. It's so many. Saika, Billy, Puffy was here. Akatsuki, Layla, Universe. Sarah, Holly Jolly Packer, Snoop Loops, <laughs> cute. Mian Fung, thank you so much for the five gifted membership. Ritzy, and final. Oh no, a few finally. <laughs> Mumu, 
and then finally Stepon Shepherd, Uor, and Luthier. Thank you so much each for the five gifted membership. I hope you all have a wonderful evening, and as always, do not be led astray, my confidants, and I will catch you next time. Oh, there is someone streaming. Inanna streaming. What the heck did it say? It wasn't. There was no one streaming for. Um. Oh. Shh, fish. Shh. <laughs> there we go. I'm gonna send you guys to Finana on the way out. Hope you all have a wonderful evening. Do not be led astray, and I will catch you guys next time. <laughs>